Ladies and gentlemen, I, Tim Hansen, have taken on quite the task. In the past, I've made two videos playing every single zombies map in one video with a challenge tagged along with it. This time, I'm going to be doing the starting room challenge on every single Treyarch zombies map. However, this time, instead of doing it solo, I have one zombies YouTuber with me per map to help me with this endeavor. 29 maps, 30 YouTubers, including myself. This is going to be the biggest Zombies YouTuber collaboration video of all time. Zombies YouTubers, small and large, will be featured in this video. This isn't a popularity contest. These are mostly close friends or people that reached out to me. Zombie Slayers, the likes of Mr. T. Lexify, JC Backfire, and more will be featured. In the description, you will find the link to each and every single one of these people. I realize it is a lot to ask for you to go subscribe to 30 people. I don't expect you to do that, but at the very least, if you would be so kind, subscribe to the people you enjoyed the most in this video. I will tag them along with the map so it makes it easier. If there is a Zombies YouTuber that wasn't featured in this video that you would like to, please let me know down in the comment section. And if we get 10,000 likes on this video, I know that's a lot to ask, but if we hit 10,000 likes, I will be making a part two video with some new people in it. We will of course be starting with World at War Nocturne Toe and making our way up to BO4's Alpha Omega. We won't quite get to DLC 4 because as of recording this, that map hasn't released. One last thing before we hop into the video, I swear, all right, these posters on screen, phenomenal. High quality, amazing posters, both Ether and Chaos. Click the top link in the description. It'll take you there. Reed and I are trying to sell these posters. I think they're great. I'm going to cop some. You should as well, even if you can't afford it at the moment. Just browse it and tell me how you feel about it. And I would love you forever, especially if you use this code. This is going to help me out quite a bit if you use this code. That would be phenomenal. Thank you so much. I love you. Um, if there's anything else I need to clarify, I will later down in the video. But I think now we can start. I'll say it again. 29 YouTubers, 29 maps. Ugh. Let's go. You have the the honor of actually opening up the entire video since we're playing the first map, Nocturne Toten, uh, chronologically. So you you uh. I was gonna say I'm either ruining the entire fucking video. Yeah. Or if this people is gonna be if people aren't interested in you, they might click off. I'm just, I'm just fucking with you. Just, uh... Bro, I, I might just need to step out for a sec. Just like, this, this is pressure. Ladies and gentlemen, Nocturne Toten starting room challenge. Let's not waste any time. This starting room is half the size of the map. So, we're playing half of Nocturne Toten. <laughs> just no mystery box. And no mule kick in the World of War version, unfortunately. I know. It's, uh, it's an iconic perk. But, that's, uh... That's what we're dealing with. Bro, you ever thought about that? Like, this starting room is basically half the map. Yeah, we're we're good on space. That's not the concern. The concern is, just like any other map, the power. <laughs> the firepower. We got a card I'm ID concerned today. that I'm bad. I've never played with you. I, A lot of the people in this video I've never played with, which is interesting. Yeah, I mean, well... I, I don't think I've ever played with 30 people to begin with, you know, let alone for a video. Yeah, that's that's also true. The only thing I do is play with myself, so like, you know, come on. I don't know how you want to take that one, but I'm just going to let that lie. I would say the majority of this is going to be kept in the video, unless you say something like truly vile. <laughs> I'll probably cut it uh, out. It, it's going to be like a two minute segment then. Like when lie. Crazy Rabbit and I record, I keep most of it in, even if it like stretches the boundaries of what's appropriate or not. Uh, but sometimes he says something just, like, too awful to keep in the video. So Bro, I, me and Justin are literally twins. It's actually stupid. There's like, a reason you don't put me and him anywhere in the same country. I'm... Okay. <laughs> he just... Sometimes he just says just the worst possible things. Yeah, he got Call of the Dead in this video, by the way. So if you want to, like, send your uh, regards to, to Crazy Rabbit, <laughs> I'll let him know on Call of the Dead. Justin, if you're listening right now, which he probably isn't, but, you know, <laughs> I just want to say that you're fat, you're bald, but I fucking love you, and you can have my children any day. Bob. Not doing too bad. Alright, I got a max Bro, ammo. Was... I, it really just doesn't matter. I'm just gonna grab it. I was gonna say, that burp was pretty hot, not gonna lie. That sounds like something Crazy Rabbit would say word for word. And you just blew oh. yourself up, and that's I something was... that Crazy Rabbit would also do. <laughs> I was behind the box, okay? <laughs> I'm trying to see how many objects in this room can be pushed around. So far, all the buckets can be, but the lanterns can't, and the sandbags can't. Uh, the gas can. Uh, 
Ooh, this ammo box can. So I didn't want to do this. Like, you know, are we going to be like the new kid in class? You know, do you want to introduce yourself? What's your name? What do you want to be when you grow up? Um, Tim, I am currently a zombies YouTuber. Um, <laughs> and that's not going to be my career. But I'm happy to, to be where I'm at right now. How about you? Uh, so my name is Luke, and I want to be a fireman when I grow up. <laughs> when you grow up? Bro, I'm like 20. I still got growing up to do what you mean. Yeah. I, I know. I feel you, though. I'm only I 18. Mean, you know, I don't know if you knew that. I'm, I just graduated high school. I, I still... <laughs> that makes me feel old as fuck, not gonna lie. I graduated like three years ago. I think about that every day. Yeah, high school flies like, like nothing. Yeah, I mean, except when you get bullied. Oh, well, <laughs> I guess, I guess in that case, it would last a long time. Like, you ever just sit there when you were in class in high school and you go like, man, everyone's such a loser. And then you ended up being a YouTuber and you're like, well, I died to a crawler. Thank you. Bro, why does this game suck? Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Dad, move. Thank you. Oh, God. I swear to God, if you die, I'm going to eat your ass. I mean, if I can somehow get to you, I should, you know what? You know what would be a, like a great investment is... Something that isn't the starting pistol, like an M1 carbide. There we go. I think you're on to something there. Wait, you're not gonna do like, you know, infinite warfare, advanced Hell warfare? No. no, 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 no. I don't delve into that mud. Uh, but you are the first World at War recording. Um, so okay. there's that. You know what I feel happy about today? What? I woke up. Some, I woke up and I'm some not. Some people, dead. why is my ringer suddenly on when it was just off? I swear to god I'm haunted. Dude, my Xbox was turning on and off by itself the other day. I swear to god. My controller was not like Dude, on what? and it was just it was just like kept turning on. And then I unplugged it and I sw if it, if it turned on again after I unplugged it, I would have literally packed up my bags and just walked out of my house. I don't fuck Bro, the ghost of hentai past activity. is haunting you. I don't fuck with paranormal activity. I do, do you, honestly, do you believe mad stuff? Not I mean, I don't see a reason to believe in it. I've never experienced it. I'll believe it but if I... But do you have I any reason to not believe in it? Listen, if I experience it, obviously I'm going to believe in it. And if somebody tells me they've witnessed a ghost, I'm not going to laugh at them. I, I don't think that's, like, funny. But you're going to be like, hmm, you kind of stupid. Skeptical, for sure, obviously. Um, but if somebody is like crying and panicking and telling me they saw a ghost and they're scared for their life I mean, I'll, I, I'm ears for that. Like I'll be like, okay, maybe you need to like get out of your house <laughs> Maybe there's a ghost But yeah, maybe just burn it down. Yeah, I, 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 I take, so. I'll take it with a grain of salt. Why are you a believer in ghosts? Uh, not particularly. I just sit there and I go like, you know what? The world does some weird shit, man. Like, you ever see, uh, what's it, that place? I think it's in Brazil that lightning strikes, like, 2,000 times an hour for, like, the last 100 years. Wow. I heard like, it, like, it's rains... It's a perpetual storm. Doesn't it, like, rain frogs somewhere constantly in the world? Not, like, like all day. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, um, it's, it's from some waterfall South thing. South America, I could have sworn. It doesn't rain frogs all day, but, like, it's very common, I've heard. Yeah, it's something about a waterfall, man. I don't know. There's so much shit that we don't know. You ever think about the ocean? Yeah, we've discovered... How much we don't know. We've discovered, like, 5-10% of it, and there's still so much left. Yeah, and, like, we can't even see most of it. Yeah, it's just just a dark abyss at the bottom of the ocean. The ocean is as close as we can get to the infinite, like, on Earth. You know what I mean? That's fair. It's, it's like, kind of mind-boggling how big the ocean actually is. Do you ever think about, like, you know, how much we know about space and all that shit, and then we know nothing about the ocean? Yeah, that's also pretty insane. It's just because... It's, it's like, why don't we just go down there and just die for it? I think the Earth is 70% water and 30% land, if I'm not mistaken. Something crazy like that. Yeah, some it's majority. By the way, viewers, we don't have a strategy. <laughs> We're just running around. <laughs> there is not. actually a strategy to this. I mean, you know that, speaking, right? speaking of running, um, it just got real. <laughs> They're running. Why? Wow, what's the strategy? What should we? Uh, should what should we do? So you stay at that back window over there, right? And you let them come in, and then you just train around a little bit. Like, um, I know the guy that has a fuck. Well, I was about to say the guy that has the world record, but, you know, clearly I'm not him. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start utilizing uh, explosives. I'm going to throw that there. I'm going to loop back around here, um, blow myself up, and hopefully not get hit and die. Oh, my God. 
Well, that's the one thing I like about the war. The world of war zombies is like it's it's great how you have to like totally stop for them to kill you. I was helping there for a second. Thank you. Oh, I died. Oh. <laughs> Shit. Gee, right. we suck. Seven rounds. I mean, there's not there's like there's nothing to work with here. <laughs> But anyways, I guess I guess that's it. On to Verrucked, but before that, do you have any closing statements? Um, Justin's my dad, and he can stay bald forever. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to head into Verrucked on World at War. I'm on PC again, so I apologize for the uh, the safe area looking kind of odd. But um, anyways, I got Z Hunter here. Are you ready for this? I'm ready. Let's go. <laughs> I'm not sure if we're going to spawn on opposite sides or if we're going to spawn together. To be honest, and I love that ad of uh, Intel Core. That's okay, cool. Yeah, that, <laughs> that is the worst. Okay, we ended up on the same side. That to me is actually oh. surprising. I did not expect that. Okay, so this is harder. We're on the same side, I think. Yeah, actually. Could have been easier. Now that I'm thinking about it. Honest to God, round prediction. I'm gonna go with like round like <laughs> like maybe seven. Like this this is gonna be tough. This is gonna be very tough. Nah, I don't think so. Maybe maybe like twelve. Well, okay, you know what? Perhaps. Oh, I forgot this Springfield exists. Dear God. <laughs> On round one, it's not even a one shot, unless it's to the head. Okay, uh, there's an M1 Grand here. Probably gonna use that, to be honest. Yeah, that's probably gonna be the go-to. Oh no, the, there's a bar in here, but we need to pay 750 for this. Oh, you can't open anything, correct? Right, yeah, that's sort of the essence <laughs> of it. Okay. I don't so know if this is I the guess. better side or, or that is the better side. I'm not quite sure. I don't think it entirely matters. I think you're just as screwed either way. I mean, that side has nades. You can work with that. Want to cover this barrier or you want to cover those barriers? I'll cover this this side. All right. So you cover the the window on my in front of quick. You know, I have a habit of just sliding and I can't slide right now. <laughs> you don't even dolphin dive either. You're just straight up prone. Wow. That's, uh, oh. that's a throwback. M1 Grand. How old were you when this map was released? Oh, God, I was eight years old. I'm 18. Yeah, I was like 15, and I thought it... I didn't like to play this alone, man. I don't care. I was 15. I was still scared of it. <laughs> Dude, Zombies was scary. I My first map was Verrucked. Or, uh, not Verrucked. Sorry, Keynote or Toten. That was my first map. I was 11 years old at the time, and then I went back to play World of War. I was scared shitless on Kino. Like, actually couldn't even play it for the, like, the longest time <laughs> by myself. Like, uh, I had to yeah. have my brother sit next to me and play with me. I mean, it's already, what'd you say, round seven? We're halfway there, almost. Yeah. yeah. You we'll know, make it. Yeah, you know, I think we'll be fine. But then again, things start picking up quickly. Like, about round six, that's when shit hits the fan. So when you hit me up and you said, okay, we're doing Verrucked, I was like, uh -huh. okay, so it's basically gonna be, hey guys, it's me, Z Hunter. Uh, all right, let's play for like five minutes and then we're done. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, but it must be, it's definitely like, it must be a pretty cool experience just playing with so many creators. Yeah, small and big. For one video. Ooh, I thought we were gonna die. I didn't know where to go for, by ammo. <laughs> I got lost. Insta kill. Hey, you know I'm a furry. Is that right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why I have a wolf. That's my fursona. Oh, right, when you stream. Should I even try to use the Springfield anymore, or is it just not even worth it? I have no idea. I mean, if it's not a one-shot kill anymore. <laughs> it's, it's like a four-shot kill. <laughs> it's just not nah, nah, good. Nah. Throw it away. All right. In yeah. the trash. We should have done Springfield only. Well, that would just be an official... Round two. Yeah. That back barrier over there actually seems to not have a ton of zombies ever. Totally baby. Okay, we got him. All right. Maybe you're right. I think maybe round 12 is like... Possible. A few moments later. Yeah, I didn't think so. When you told me World at War, I was like, okay, I hope he doesn't mean Black Ops 1 because I do not have that. Ooh, 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 okay, I got a breach. I got multiple breaches. Oh, goodness oh, gracious. Oh, no. All right, I got a double points. That does nothing for us. Okay. All right. All right. Ah. I love these classic uh, Marine characters, the no name characters. They're sprinting. Okay. No, I'm dead. Shit, shit, dead. shit, 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 shit. Yep, there it is. All right, round six. Six? Yep. <laughs> it's not easy. Okay. You were right. You said seven? Yeah, I said seven. I Damn. All right, well, <laughs> dude, that's one of the hardest ones. It seriously is. I'm, I'm, I'm like, 
I'm not upset about that at all. <laughs> yeah, I'm super happy. That's that's probably my highest round on this map. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the Shino Numa starting room challenge with Ross. And um, do you have any round predictions for this, or are you just hoping for the best? Um, I'm kind of nervous for the dog round whenever that comes. Oh, that's right. So I totally forgot about. Was that like rounds like five to seven? Oh God, look at Tokyo. Well, here we are. Very good. We got Peter McCain. Looking as uh, dangly as ever. My sensitivity is so high, oh my god. So we have the Gewehr, and I think the Arasaka is our guns. And no perks, uh, yeah. of course. I guess I'll buy the Arasaka for now. <laughs> is there any particular reason? I know there weren't too many options, but... Uh, you just like... Do you like Shinonuma, or do you not? <laughs> I kind of do, actually. I think at one point I used to have in, like, my top ten maps of all time. I think now it's, like, just outside of it. Uh-huh. I don't know, I kind of like this map. Yeah, I think it's underrated. I think people give it shit yeah. because there's mud and it doesn't look great, I guess. I'm thinking, I'm probably thinking maybe round... I don't want to get too cocky because all the World of War rounds have been fairly low. I'm going to go for, like, six because that just seems to be, like, the average. It's actually oddly satisfying, popping heads with the Arasaka. Yeah, the Arasaka and the Car 98K are fun guns. They're just bad. They're just copy and pasted versions of each other. They're literally yeah, exactly. the exact same thing. I, I don't think yep. there is a statistically better. I don't know which one is better. I don't think. I think they're, yeah, they're the exact same. They're indistinguishable. <laughs> Iron Sight might be like slightly different, but that's about it. Yo, I heard this rumor that the Springfield is two shot, one kill on insta kill. That That's not true, is it? I heard that too. I don't know. It might be. I've always heard it's like our insights are broken, that it's like it always misses like you can't aim it properly or something like that well the world of war zombies are uh more forgiving than bo1 and bo2 for sure because um you have to pretty much stop all together you have to stop moving for them to even like swipe at you so i mean there's that yeah the world of war zombies aren't too difficult it's just the maps and the the size right. we're, we're working with here shinonuma is one of the more graceful ones i would say Verrucked was just yeah. bad. It was just a nightmare. <laughs> we yeah, died around plus five. You're, you're on separate sides, right? Well, it's either that or they do put you on the same side. It's random. We got put on the same side and we had nowhere to move. It, we were on the quick revive side and we just got totally overwhelmed. Round six is the round where shit hits the fan. Right. So be ready for round six. I've noticed that. All right. After doing all 28 of these starting room challenges. Arasaka's already a two shot to the head. Ow, 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 oh, god, yep. I hear crawlers. Is that just me? Yeah, that's what I was hearing, too. Like that All hissing right. noise or whatever time. Makes. Time to stop playing games. I hear a crawler, I don't see one. Where did we toss a nade? This is like one of those myths, if you toss a nade at Peter- Oh, I- what?! <laughs> what the fuck?! Wait, did the nade kill you, or did, like- I think- Oh god, it's a dog. Oh right god. <laughs> I think that was a glitch. I think if you shoot Peter, if you like anger him or something, or yeah, move like him, you're you. just down. Because I don't think one, exp I don't think a grenade could just kill me. Just oh one. God. Oh god, there's so Watch out. Oh, I'm boned. Oh god. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. I'm dead. Oh god. Okay. 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 Shit, there's like shit. five. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. Ah! Oh! oh! Okay, I'm gonna let this you. No! Oh! Yeah, just let me go. Uh, no run! Way. They're faster than I am, I swear. Okay, 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 okay. Run, run. No, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Run! <laughs> oh, this is the scariest moment of my life. This is the scariest moment of my life. There are so many behind me. How many are, how many are there behind me right now? I don't There's... even want to look back. Wait, what? There was two. I just killed them with a pistol, though. What? Oh, yeah, I died out. That's fine. Okay, Oh! Okay, okay. Reload, 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 reload. This is scary. Die! Oh, thank God. That was... We are not surviving the next dog round. That it was... That was yeah, I don't close. know how we survived that one. Dear God. Very few times am I actually sweating while playing zombies. <laughs> God. Damn. Yeah, I know that feeling where, like, you're trying to escape, like, dogs, but, like, you can't sprint for a long time. They're, like, faster you than you are in this game, I swear. Right. World of Warhounds are actually, like, genuinely difficult. On BO3, they're, like, measly. Like, they just die with a shot. I swear, I, hear, I think I hear zombies behind me, and then I turn around, and there's nothing there. It's, like, sound Yeah, when I was off. playing this earlier, and, like, I was in, like, the, like, the Thompson room of this map, and I kept hearing zombies above me. 
I can never figure out where they were. My new prediction is when the next dog round happens. That's my new prediction. All right. I mean, the zombies, I, I think we're holding down the fort pretty well right now, but that was just too close of a call. A nuke. Oh, what? I forgot about World, World of War nukes, like, they can still damage you when they're exploding. Oh, really? I didn't even know that. When was the dog round? Like, round five? Honestly, I don't even remember. I was panicking the entire time. If it was five, then either next round or... I really hope it's not next round so we can at least get to round ten. Yeah, that'd be cool. I mean, they did warn us, though. There's a sign here that says... It says warning. Oh, God! They stuck out from... Oh! They stuck out from that barrier. I didn't even hear them. Dude, the sound, I swear, is off in oh, this game. Oh, I was game. lagging. I'm not trying to make excuses, yeah, but I actually didn't even... That totally... I got blindsided by that. I think it is. Um... I swear I should have. I don't think I have time to get you. No, I understand. I can't even move. I'm actually stuck here. I'm like glued to the fucking floor. I'm to train, I guess. All right, you, you. Oh god, I'm stuck. Okay, you try your best. <laughs> oh, no pressure. Get, get through. Get through. Okay. Well, what am I stuck on? <laughs> oh, oh shit. Man. World at war in a nutshell. Right oh there. god. Well, you know what? All things considered, World at War. I'll take round eight. That's not that bad. Yeah. I suppose. Hey, we got even kills. Oh, wow. Six, six each. <laughs> we almost have the identical points as well. And downs. Yep. Okay, do you have any closing statements or uh, or do, do we want to move on? <laughs> you just want to move past that. Yeah, I'd probably move on. Ladies and gentlemen, we got Doris here. I got Mad Gaz, a great custom zombies developer. And uh, we're going to go get our, 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 our cheeks clapped <laughs> on Doris. Oh. Oh yeah, everything else will be clapped as well. Don't be bad. I do apologize for the child screaming in the background. That's my daughter just screaming. Oh, well. All right. Nice. Okay. Sensitivity's working. Everything's working. Yeah, it took a while to set everything up on uh, PC and World of War. It's a little bit outdated and confusing. But we got here, and that's all that matters. Yeah, we're here now. Yeah. So, that's um... It. By the way, guys. Uh, shameless plug for uh, Mad Gaz. He has a great Hello. new custom zombies map called Atonement. You definitely Yay. should check it out. I played it on my channel. For some reason, that video got age-restricted. No idea why. A lot of my videos Whoa. get age-restricted for what I'm assuming is swearing, but I don't swear a lot. Anyways, yeah. Check that check that map out for sure. Um, maybe because it's got zombies in it, and I did put Nazi symbols around the map, so maybe that was a reason why it got age-restricted. I don't know. <laughs> the world will never know, because YouTube never makes anything clear. Oh god, this brings back so many memories. Do you have any round predictions, or you're just gonna try your best? <laughs> oh, uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna give you a prediction of round three before I go down. Three, three. Round three. Damn, yeah, I'm gonna shoot for. Uh, I'm gonna shoot for ten because I like shooting for double digits. As long as I get that, I will be a, a happy clam. And uh, okay. what do we okay. have for starting guns? We have the car and the gewehr, I think, right? Yeah, the gewehr. Oh god. Ooh. The knife and is so slow, everything just so slow and clunky. There's no auto aim either, which um, nope. I have to rely on my actual skill now. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. Controller on PC is never good. It never is good. Doris is my favorite World of War map by far. I think it's the best. I don't think there's oh, much definitely. questioning it. Definitely. This map fucking changed everything. Mm -hmm. well, I totally agree with you. And even then, on Black Ops 3, when they re remade it again, it was still phenomenal. I yeah. loved it. I haven't died yet, and there's round 3. Oh, there's a bitey thing. There's a crawler. Round 3, and we're still alive. Yep. All right. Oh, what? I just hip-fired and totally missed. Point-blank range, missed with insta-kill. I'm going to go Dear grab God. the bear now. I am out of ammo. This Gavare is going to be, like, the only reliable source of damage, and mm. even so, it's just not enough. I remember as well, the, the main thing what these maps used to have, which was, like, the fear factor, you had to board those windows up. You had to keep those windows closed. Oh, yeah. Yeah, dude, World of War Zombies was something else. A zombie just teared on the barrier at this side and then just decided to run the opposite direction behind the barrier. Oh, he's back again. Oh, God. I hear a zombie right behind me, and I can't see them. I'm scared. Yeah, grenades are going to be really right. helpful. Damn, double points. Yeah, because that's really helpful when we have nothing to buy. <laughs> yeah. Except for more ammo. Why the hell is the wall oh, oh, so oh, high? Oh. Like, who, what, what, what? We're doomed. We're doomed oh, yeah. dogs. Oh, I forgot dogs were a thing. Yeah. Wow, wow. It's crazy how you can just forget that. Hmm. I would suggest hiding in the tunnel. I'm scared. Well, not this round. We're good this round. Nope, we're good, we're good, we're good. So for these challenges, uh, whenever I do these every Treyarch Zombies map in one video thing, I never do the Black Ops 1 remaster of any of these World no. of War maps. I just play the World of War maps. The original. Yeah. I mean, I could 
try to extend the video, but <laughs> I just the less editing the better, no, I think. Yeah, there's no point. Really. And, and yeah, it's literally a copy and paste. Careful, dude. Careful, there's a lot coming. Yeah, yeah, max ammo. There it is, round six. Okay. All right. We, we made dub double digits for what I thought. Well, double the amount of what I thought. Oh, they're running now. They are running. Oh, Shit gets are, real on round six. This is when. Sh round six is always when things become more complicated. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. No, I'm killed. Oh, God. Oh, oh, God. Oh, dear Lord, Mother of Merciful Jesus. I'm dead. <laughs> oh, oh, no. <laughs> we didn't get to live to see the Hellhounds. Okay. Well. Oh, well. I'll accept that, I guess. This is not an that's easy funny. starting room. Well, I guess that's it. Do you have any closing <laughs> statements, Mad Gas? Uh, that brought back memories that I didn't want to be brought back. All right, so ladies and gentlemen, we are at Black Ops 1 now. We just finished World of War. I got Skizzleax. We are going to be doing <laughs> Kino Derto in Theater of the Dead. Let's get it. I'm on PC, by the way, so I apologize for it looking very condensed and weird. Uh, but it's still gonna function properly. That's all that matters. Man, it's been a while since I played this. So what, what are we doing? We're doing like starting room challenge. Like, should I put you down? Something like that. So we <laughs> we are not doing a one v one, despite common belief. This is we're working uh, together. We're a team. Do you have a round prediction, or uh, are you just hoping for the best? I would say if we can beat at least round fifteen in the starting room. That would, that would be, be pretty lit. I, I'm gonna get the M14. But nah, man, dude. Like I really thought that we're gonna do one v one and. Um, I thought that I'll be able to take you down, you know what I'm saying? But the thing is that, like, we, we won't have, like, uh, power on. Like, I was thinking about getting quick revive, but uh, we won't be able to. So we, we don't want to leave the starting room, right? Right. You gotta stay in here. I, you, you know what? Like, I can, you can, you can keep people busy. I can pull a, put us pull a sneaky and go turn on the power and come back. Nobody, nobody will ever find out. <laughs> I would say Kino is the most iconic map ever, just mm, because yeah, yeah. it's the most played on the best-selling zombies game there is. Absolutely, bro. Uh, I remember, man. It's my it was, first map. It was probably the best map ever, but the, the thing is that now it got... It, it gets a little bit too repetitive, I would say, after around 20, 30. Yeah. You, you don't want to be playing it. Yeah, for sure. Us back, man. This is my first map ever, back in 2010. This yeah. was that game that I managed to play in on PS3 back when I would, uh, <laughs> I, would I was a, tro a trophy hunter. No longer I am. Though. I believe my last tro a trophy was the, with the crossbow or something where you would have to pack a punch it, stick oh, it to your yeah. teammate. That one was and difficult. Get, like, five, six kills. It was really, it was a pain in the like in almost the impossible. <laughs> yeah, no swearing. We're family friendly here. <laughs> yeah. That's YouTube, dog. Dude, YouTube. half YouTube my media. videos have gotten age restricted. It's kind of ridiculous. Uh, yeah, dude, I feel you, bro. Like, I find alternatives. <laughs> Gotta find alternatives. No swears, no curses. Dude, Noah J got one of his videos age restricted. That. He didn't swear once. <laughs> I saw that. <laughs> it's so ridiculous. How long have you been playing zombies? Like, Black Ops 1 was your first game, right? Yeah, first map, first game, okay, right same, yep. here. Uh, when I was 10 years old. Okay, so this is gonna be tricky because they're gonna be walking down the staircase. We need that double points. Definitely need Yeah, that. double points. Yeah, I'm gonna buy the Olympia in a bit. I can already feel everything getting much more intense already. In round four, it's crazy. I remember, like, uh, in Black Ops 3, it wasn't this intense. I mean, it can be, though, if you don't buy gobble guns. Yeah, I got a max ammo, so you can toss your nades if you want. Yeet, potato out. Oh. <laughs> oh, I swear. All right. I swear, bro. All right, all right. All right. There we go. Okay. I'm gonna buy Olympia. Ooh, dogs. Okay, modern Warfare. Dogs. Oh, I got a stick. Okay, I'm, I'm coming up. Huh? <laughs> Actually, let's, uh, you know what's a good idea? Let's camp over in this corner back here. So that way, we will not be, uh, surprise attacked! I'm being attacked! Oh god, thank I'll you. Cover you. Thank you. Cover me, I'm reloading! Okay, I keep missing. I downed. Dude, I am not good with oh, this. Oh, you're a nub. You're a nub, and you call yourself a uh, Call of Duty zombie player. Oh, I'm, I'm about to die. I'm used to auto aim, and <laughs> dude, that was yeah. fucking sad. What the hell happened? Oh my god! <laughs> do you want to redo that, or do you want to call that a game? Uh, let's let's redo it one more time. I'm uh, I'm gonna take the nuke. All right, sweet. We we beat round five. You gotta progress to the round. Aha, uh -huh, yes. You're in Boston, right? Yeah, pretty close. So you're getting hit by that uh, hurricane, or no? Um. I'm not even sure. I, I think it's hitting lower down south more, I think. 
Yeah, America's big. America's big. Yeah. Aren't you from Canada? You're a Canadian, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, just just Canada. You know that uh, that exists somewhere in the north. Uh, double points. All right. Yeah, I ain't gonna risk it though. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not certain we need points. You're trying to train down there? Oh damn, Ooh. that's a risky one. A little bit, but. I'm holding my head high so far. But DLC 4 predictions, though. Like, you think it's Call of the Dead, right? Because that's what I've been hearing. I haven't been... You know, normally, I'm pretty big on leaks. I like keeping up, and that's the, the stuff that I do on my channel, right? But uh -huh. uh, but this time, like, I gotta be real. I don't know what's going on. Like, I lost so much interest in Black Ops 4, but I'm hearing that it's, it's Call of the Dead. Yeah, I think it's gonna be Call of the Dead reimagined. That seems to be the safest bet. I personally love Call of the Dead. Yeah, same. Um... Uh, I don't want but, them to butcher do it. I, I'm scared that they're going to butcher it, is all. Yeah, but do I want to see it uh, as the finale map? I'm not sure about that one. Just keep running. But even if you keep running, you still get hit because multiple dogs. Potato out. Ooh, ooh. Yeah, be careful with the nades. Like, I'm just trying to circle. I'm just trying to circle. Oh, God. Oh, oh God. There's so many. Ooh, get a pack. Yeah, there are so many. Just try <gasps> to just no life it. Just no life it. Just no I'm life not, it. I'm, gonna I'm not sure what you mean, but no life it. Oh! Oh god. <laughs> I'm gonna try to knife him, okay? Just keep there's running. Only one just keep there. running. I think there's a couple behind me right now. Licking my ass. Okay, I'm gonna Oh yeah, there are a couple. I see them. I see them. Alright, M14 time, baby. Yeah, it looked like there was oh. only one mo mother 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 lover, but now there are just plenty of them. There's more spawning. In front of you, man. Okay. Okay, all right, all right. God damn, there are so many. All right, this is the last one. Do it one. for the double digits. Do it for the double digits. Don't worry about me. I got paper. I got paper. That's all right. Oh, that was bad idea. I didn't think he was going to hit me twice. Oh, don't die. Don't die. That's the scariest goddamn thing ever is when you're red screen and there's a dog up your ass. Die, bitch. Oh, oh, God. Uh, don't take that maxi till I spawn. I need more ammo in my... Uh, oh, God, I'm sweating. I'm sweating. <laughs> Uh, it looks like the homie just burnt a lot of calories, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, we need speed cola, man. We need the speed. Or double tap. I'd even take that. Well, I guess in BO1, that's not very helpful. Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna try to not even aim down side. Just uh, fire from the hip. Like, that's probably the best thing. Okay, insect kill. Wow, that's that's very clutch. Oh, man, I almost died there, but hip fired. All right. Yeah, hit fire, it's where it's at. Insta-kills and nukes are the gifts from the heavens. I don't know, man. I really wanted to see a map with Victus in it, but they are just wrapping up so fast. I kind of want it to be over already, but I kind of don't want... I, I feel like Black Ops 4 is what is making me say that. Like, just wrap up the story before yeah. it's too late. Just don't ruin it, right? Yeah. But, like, I don't know what it is, but Black Ops 4 HUD is something that I don't like that much, and the game just feels plasticky, right? Yeah. Uh, oh my god. I'm surprised I'm alive right now. I'm gonna die. Yeah, I yeah. got trapped. It's really hard to train back here. There's no room. Yeah, I mean, you were in the... Uh, I'm, I'm stuck too. I'll crawl in the corner and die. You just clutch it out, and hopefully we'll get to 10. Yeah. My time to shine. <laughs> but I don't think I'll be able to clutch it, man. Because whenever they hit you, like, you flinch so hard, it's yeah, not even fun. they, like, drag you back with them. Ooh! Oh, god, if you can get to me. Match made in heaven. Match made in heaven. All right, gonna revive you. Holy uh, Maybe uh, I'll, I'll have a... This one in the... <laughs> I was keep back <laughs> okay. you. All right, let me revive you, man. Thank you. Here you go. All right, we got to 10. Not a problem, man. Double points. That is necessary. Oh, I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Oh, god. Oh, yeah. Got this other. God damn it. God damn it. <laughs> oh god! Ugh. How can you even train there? Like, I'm barely. I'm dead. I'm dead. That's how. Fuck. There is no hope. This is. Round 10, though. That's That was the goal, though, at least. Let's do this. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have five. I have chaos here. And, um, Hello? praying to God that we get past round five. This starting room is so, like, ominous in a weird way. Oh! Oh! Oh, I just threw a grenade. My melee button is uh, is not <laughs> right. Oh god. Okay, so how do you want to divvy this up? We got two people. We got one big room and one small room. It's really, yeah. really odd dynamic. I guess we could oh, just what? freestyle it. I mean, that's always just the the simplest way to go about it. I'm thinking freestyle might be for now. The best here. If yeah. we if we notice like a pattern, we could pick up on it maybe and go with something else. I'm thinking world record. Really? Let's go. 
Let's I have no it. idea what the world record is. Wasn't there a glitch where you could like get on top of the table or something? Did you ever end up doing that before? I remember hearing about that. I never did that. Um, yeah, me neither. I do know about the one for... Oh, wow. I can't adjust my sensitivity or my controls. Okay, cool. Never mind. Um, I know there's um, the lag switch you can do to get out of that that right rear barrier. Uh -huh. So I know that's a thing. So obviously, um, we're not turning on the power. So therefore, we will not be getting the Pentagon Thief. So no worries there. Um... No Nova Crawlers, that's another giant relief. It's just zombies. I, I, oh, woohoo! Oh my god. Five is one of those starting rooms that isn't small, small, but it's, it's interesting. The spacing is interesting. It's like awkwardly small. Dude, this video is going to be just an absolute behemoth. Uh, this is going to be the most editing I've ever done, the most recording I've ever done, the most people I've ever played with in like a specific time lot. This is just a massive, entity of a video i mean 29 maps 29 youtubers god damn and it's it's awesome too like um i really do appreciate the fact of like the the variety in caliber that you chose right like you've got some small youtubers all the way up to like some of the big dogs but uh, yeah i think i think this is going to be beneficial for me and everyone in here in this video it's a great uh win-win oh, for everyone it's always just nice and refreshing to like play with new people yeah ha like i'd say a good quarter of the people that are in this video i'm talking to and playing to for the first time in this video bro that would have been crazy to like throw on um to this list like some custom maps and have mad guys like do a first room in his own map. Oh my god, yeah, that'd be... Oh, there are so many zombies over here, by the way. I would steer... Oh god. Ooh. Um. Um. Don't blow myself up! Oh, I almost blew myself <laughs> up. Oh god. Oh, oh, run! I'm cornered. Oh, oh. No. dude, there are so, so many. This is ridiculous. Okay. Dude, my sensitivity is just utter garbage. I don't know if I'm going to be able to revive you. <laughs> if not, no worries. Yeah, I mean, just... we only have two guns to purchase if you have to respawn. Yep. Alright, I'm gonna try to use my grenades to their gonna, fullest I'm potential. I'm oh, an insta-kill! Okay, this will be good. I can revive you now. Perfect. There we go. Let's end it quickly, maybe get a couple... Oh, we still got insta-kill. That was a good revive. Okay, so what we learned is we're gonna die next round. Or the round after that. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> Stuff for it! I got a single one hit. Yep, I got one hit. Wow. Alright, I'm gonna try to get out of your way as best as I can. Oh, I... I second-guessed myself. Oh. That wasn't a good idea. Okay, well, seven? You know what? On five, I will take that. Yeah, that's that not that's not, bad. not like bad at all. Next map will be Ascension. See you there. We have Ascension now. I have Nero here. Now... He's actually more of a multiplayer guy, but we all enjoy zombies. If you don't enjoy zombies, I don't know why you're watching this, uh, but we're just going to hop into this. You practiced. Yes? I did. <laughs> I didn't want to embarrass myself because I'm a multiplayer guy, like you said, uh -huh. but I've been playing zombies since the beginning, back when it was essentially an Easter egg in World at War for being the campaign. Right. Um, I, me I remember back in uh, World at War trying to get to round 20. Right, that was like always our goal. We're playing Nocturne on Toten, and we just could not do it. Ooh, you seem to be lagging a little bit. Are you all right? Are you lagging? I found, no, I'm good. I'm oh, all good, buddy. Okay, then. It just <laughs> it looks like you're lagging, but I guess you're not. Okay. Well, that worked to my advantage. See, we're sort of like opposites. Like, I'm more zombies. I sometimes play multiplayer. You're more multiplayer, obviously, and then you do sort of zombies. Like, yeah. the same amount Very that I do amount, multiplayer. But... Yeah. Okay, so I'm a huge fan of custom zombies, and I know you are as well. Mm -hmm. Um, especially in Black Ops 3, like anything by Z-Roy, I've played, I actually have a second channel that I play a decent amount of zombies on, and I like to just boot up custom zombies maps that I've never played before, that I know nothing about, and I try to just get the viable ending, if there is one, uh -huh. or figure out the Easter egg if I can, stuff like that, and so, when Black Ops 4 came out, I didn't touch zombies at all, I just didn't care, I'm all about multiplayer, right, but yeah. when contracts yeah. became a thing, um, that's when I started playing more zombies. And I basically view it like a custom zombies map. Like I'm running around trying to figure out pack a punch on my own. Some maps are easy, like Voyage. Other maps like um, <laughs> Ancient Evil. To this day, I still have no idea how to pack a punch. Uh, Ooh. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that no. one's a little trickier. <laughs> yeah. Well, well, if I can't figure it out on my own, then I, I just keep trying. I keep going back and trying to figure it out. Every time there's like a contract for it, I play it. I'll try and figure it out. But uh -huh. um, oh god. 
I almost died. Yeah, you, yeah, you better duck when that comes down. Like I said, <laughs> I I've been hear it. I have no game audio. Thing. That's the problem. <laughs> How are you gonna do anything with no game audio? I don't know. I've done it before. I, I will manage. But um, yeah, this thing's actually really great for us if we utilize it properly, because it, you know, it, uh, it deals infinite damage. So um, we do have ourselves a very good uh, potential starting up challenge here. I would say. Here's the yeah. Here's the thing. It's a matter of how far are we gonna go? Because if we really wanted to train, we could probably make it to a super high round just as long as we don't get hit and uh -huh. cross paths, right? Like yeah. that thing will just we can go infinitely with this thing here. Yeah. So. And we do have quite a bit of space in the ascension starting. I think one person could easily train on this lunar pad over here, and then someone could either go upstairs, I suppose. So I like to do round predictions. Um, I may have already asked this. I don't even remember anymore. I ask it so often. Uh, my round prediction. I'm gonna go with like. I'm gonna shoot for twenty. Do you have any high hopes? 20? Yeah. I was, I was hoping for ten. I had to. I got oh. to like nine, nine or so. Uh, just completely playing solo, just practicing. I'm like, okay, I don't want to embarrass myself. And getting used to Black Ops One zombies is weird after playing Black Ops Four. For sure. Like yeah. the lack of aim assist, uh, like little things, quality of life stuff, lack of hit markers, right? Lack of points popping up when yeah. you shoot at them. It's, it's a bit of an adjustment. Yeah. But. Uh, you want to you get nukes here? You want to? I guess it doesn't matter now. Yeah, yeah, all right. See, um, I actually love BO1. It's my favorite COD ever. Keynote or Toten was my first map ever. I just think this map is simplistic beauty. Black Ops 1 is still holds up as the best multiplayer in COD history. Uh huh. Uh, with Black, Black Ops 2 being a close second, I get a lot of flack for it, but I didn't care for Modern Warfare 3 that much. Huh. And I think it's because I enjoyed it the least of all the Modern Warfare games. That's I thought Call of Duty 4 and Modern Warfare 2 were better. Modern Warfare 3 is not bad. I mean, it's certainly better than Ghosts. But when you compare it to COD 4 and Modern Warfare 2, um, yeah. I just think it falls short. I just, Mostly because of little things they changed about it. I just think MW2 is a little broken for my taste. And I have more memories <laughs> on, B on MW3, so I'm biased for sure about that. Oh, we all are. That's the thing. We all are. Like, there's no objective truth when it comes to, like, what's the best COD ever. You know, we're all biased. We all have, you know, when Modern Warfare 2 came out for me, I was, like, what, 17? Still <laughs> in high school. And so my life was COD, more so than it is now. <laughs> and <laughs> I guess less so, actually, technically. But um, we would just play all day, all night with my friends, staying up till freaking 3 a.m. on a school night because oh hello <laughs> <laughs> yep they came up from behind all right so let me ask you this what are your fondest call of duty memories or more memory specifically do you have one? Oh, it's hard to pull you know yeah one out it's of the hat here, tough it's it had to be back in the cod 4 to modern Warfare. oh Two god days. i don't want to die oh no oh i'm don't alive die round six don't die on round six now oh, it's okay oh, i'm oh. not the zombie youtuber you're okay. supposed to be carrying me right oh now. god oh god oh god okay well the problem is they're not dying with one shot anymore they're dying with several shots i'm gonna try to get to yeah okay. which is the problem there's a max ammo over there but who cares okay all right we're good look we're at good. you go we're good. we're good we're good we're good i honestly and should have died there but i didn't okay there's it anyways fondest memory do you have one so yeah so fondest memory it's more of a collection uh just back in the day being in high school being I think a lot of us, we think back to our childhoods and we think, wow, that was like a great time in my life. I really enjoyed that. Yeah. I kind of feel the same way about those days because it's me, my best friend, Tyler, um, my cousin, and a bunch of people we met online. Um, back when friendships were actually formed in COD lobbies before party chat and stuff, yeah. we pl we would just play all the time, and it was so much fun. I have specific memories on each COD game. It's kind of weird. Like, for some reason, and I'm not even a big COD World War II fan, but mm -hmm. I used to go to my cousin's house, and that was the one game my uncle owned. My uncle loves COD, but he just he purchased that COD because it was the most recent one at the time. And that's all he plays. He just focuses on that because he's super casual. So every time I go there up in Maine with my cousins, that's the only COD we play. And we grind for hours and hours, even though I didn't really care. I just cared about, you know, playing with him. So that's, like, out, unusual. Yeah. Like, that game is, like, good, but... Um, it's not I, like a preference. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a firm believer that World War II is actually one of the better games that has come out. Maybe even a top five one after all the multiplayer updates. I know Zombies was a bit different and yeah. uh, people didn't enjoy that nearly as much. But it's underrated. Um, after, after they, yeah, after they revamped the multiplayer, I started to enjoy the game a lot more. I am having a hard time up there, by the way. This M14 yeah. <laughs> is not killing anything. <laughs> Uh oh, I'm definitely well, down again. All right. Well, I'll try to revive you. <laughs> Worst case scenario, if I don't get to you, you respawn and buy the. the yeah, yeah. Two the idea guns. is, as long as you can stay alive down here, and <laughs> then what do you call this giant machine? I'm sure there's a name. I don't know. I just call it a spindle, and I downed. <laughs> 
That's so what was that, round 20? Disappointing. You're, 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 you're going for there? I was going to say, one of my other fondest memories in COD history is playing BO1 Nuketown, and I was, I think, 11 at the time, so I played against bots hardcore, man. I played against Very bots. I, I used to, before school, I'd play for a half hour against bots on Nuketown, only Nuketown, and then I'd come home after school and do the same thing for literally all goddamn day. It's... Uh, I did the same thing, yeah. but uh, that was fun. Uh, a little disappointed at the round. I thought you were going to get a little <laughs> yeah. bit harder. In well, fact, uh, you should be I got, there were just, uh, I don't know what to say. I, don't, I have no words. I mean, <laughs> that is one of the easier ones, but that's typically for one person to train. Yeah. It yeah. kind of, it kind like the zombie spawn was sort of sporadic at the end there. Anyways, so we've talked an awful lot about other Call of Duties. Um, why did you pick Ascension? Why was this your, uh, we should probably say something about Ascension before we like wrap this up. Well, for me personally, Ascension was one of my favorite maps from Black Ops 1. Definitely enjoyed it. Yeah. But also, because it's black and white at the very beginning, I thought that'd be kind of fun and unique yeah. because we're not turning on the power or doing anything like that. So that's honestly, that that's all the thought that went into it for me. I'm like, I want, if we're only doing a starting room, let's do the one starting room that's all black and white. I'm just looking forward to seeing what people say about you dying in round eight. I'm, I'm looking forward to that. You mean yeah, you we? I, w -E, I'm, we. I'm, I'm the multiplayer guy. I'm essentially the recruit bot here. You were supposed to carry me. Is that how this so. works? <laughs> So if I hop in a multiplayer match with you right now, I best be carried by your ass? Oh, you would be. Okay. <laughs> I'm uh, just kidding, Greg. Right? No, I've would. seen you play multiplayer. That's how I found your videos, actually. It was Call of Duty World War II multiplayer. Welcome to the Call of the Dead starting room challenge. I have Crazy Rabbit. I'm sure you're familiar with him. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna. Uh, I'm just going to ignore that comment, and uh, let's go kill George. Let, let me finish. It was supposed to say, I love meningitis. All right, so uh, my round prediction is round 12. I'm being very optimistic. And I'm Sarah Michelle Geller, and you're Freddy Krueger. I don't like my field of view to be, like, too drawn back or too... Oh, I want it to be so drawn back, I can't even see my weapon anymore. So should we try to kill George? Because if we do, we get a free I death machine so. drop and a free perk. Um, so maybe we should try saving a zombie and then... Just I was going to ask that. you if you've done the Easter egg, but no. I'm not on PC. I've done it a million times on Xbox, but not on PC. I do know if you have the upgraded Olympia, uh, it takes, I think, the entire, all of its ammo plus some upgraded mm -hmm. to kill him with okay. face shots. Ow, ow, shit. I got a double points. Um, I'm going to kill you. And um, so he has 500,000 HP, so we're going to have to slowly... Uh, chip away at that my god this is going to take forever we're gonna be here for time. so long but i think <laughs> we should I, thi I think we owe it to the audience to try i have an idea we gotta be careful not pro to tip. kill that zombie pro oh fuck was that your pro tip because the zombie's dead and so are you okay well my pro tip was to get mustang and sally when i go down i only get the pistol <laughs> it'll uh, work okay myth busted i I, th I thought that i was really smart but you know i'm just fucking stupid so you think if he had a tender because he's like eight foot tall he'd get hella bitches Ooh. Maybe. I mean, he's dead now. Rest in peace. But, yeah, he... I think he was 6'5". God damn. I have a friend. Uh, his name is also Tim. And he told me he met George Romero oh. in um, real Tim. life. Uh, I'm frozen. You're... Can you shoot me? Um... Oh, hey, buddy. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, never mind. George freed me. How... What? what? I was shooting George... I got distracted. Continue with your story. I was listening to your story. I was paying attention. Anyways, my friend Tim met George Romero and Danny Trejo in real life. At a, like, That's cool as fuck. You get to meet I would love to meet yeah, any of these characters, to be honest. Even Sarah Michelle Gellar. Even? Uh, she's number one. Oh, yeah, that's right. Because she has female parts. I mean, if we get the death machine from the zombies... That's gonna be... Oh, God, that'll help so much. I mean, it won't kill him, but it'll severely circumcise him. Yeah, it'll take the tip right off. Probably, if you're uh, not circumcised, I just don't even trust you, let's be honest right here. You're circumcised? Yeah. I am as well. Hell yeah. Not that the audience, like, needed to know that, but they do. But now. they do. Because if you're not, I don't trust you. So the water healing George is a total myth, right? Yeah, that's bullshit. Yeah, I figured. There are so many myths and zombies, it's ridiculous. He never regens. He just always goes down to the bottom of the sea. You ever seen your dad's penis by accident? Um, I'm trying to think. Not on accident, on purpose, though. <laughs> okay, hang on. 
Okay. No, <laughs> no, I, I've whoa, never. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, I have seen it, but it wasn't like an accident or on purpose. It was just he was in a urinal taking a piss, and so was I, and like. And you just looked over. I mean, I was like eight years old, maybe or maybe younger. Fair enough. So I mean. You yeah. know what he was doing. Like I've seen it, but I wasn't dominance. like being devious or anything about it. Oh my god, we need to like work on uh, saving a zombie if we're gonna try to kill George. Your dad was establishing dominance. You All know right. this, right? Because when you're young, it's gonna look fucking huge. That's oh my god, I never thought about. That. You now know you're what? gonna have that image of a huge dick in your mind. And you'll never compare. Jeez, I never thought about it like that. All right, so right. I have a nuke over here. I'm not gonna grab it. Let's save a zombie and try to kill George. Um. This guy doesn't have an arm. I think this is going to be one of the long... I think this will be the longest starting room if we actually go for I think that should just be George. our goal, is just to kill him. Honestly, yeah. I mean, otherwise, if we didn't try, we'd probably just die on round 10. Wouldn't be super exciting. Ah! Alright, I think... Oh, he's chasing you, boy. Alright, let's try to save two zombies next time. I think and, we can and, get a And not out. an armless one. Oh, yeah, because crawlers are... Good crawlers in this game. Not the shitty ones that die after 10 seconds. Though I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but there are like a lot of zombies. You know, I'm gonna toss grenades. No. Propaganda. Alright, I got one cute little boy right here. Or, okay, that's not wrong. I got a cute zombie right here. Just, just make the light go dim. Give us a little bit of hope. Yeah, I want to know that I'm making progress. Maybe if we pray to the rain gods, it'll give us a death machine. My nipples were just so erect, and then immediately just... <laughs> Canceled that I'm one so out. determined to actually do this. I really want him dead. <laughs> I want him to die. I want him to re die. You're literally just gonna have to speed this up because it's gonna take like 12 hours. Yeah. And then uncut it right now. Penis! And then recut it. All right, shit, holy crap, he's so close! Ah! He just wants a little hug, give him a hug. That was a very aggressive hug. <laughs> yeah, no kidding, he almost took my life. He's just a very passionate lover, what can you say? I'm typing, I'm typing!
All right, so if we happen to get a death machine, what we're going to do is we're going to do an honor system. All right, one of us will protect the other with the death machine while yeah. the other shoots George. Um, okay, we got to stop shooting George now because I don't want to get slowed down and get killed. Oh, okay. uh, I didn't shoot him, but the zombie exploded next to him. Ah! Don't kill me! All right, I'm going to cook a grenade at him. Okay. Three, four. <laughs> Damn. That was a direct, that was a good throw. I hope that did something. Myself if I saw a death machine. <laughs> I would have been, I would have been happy yet pissed. Oh, I hear something. That's a double point. Fuck me. Okay, I kind of had to leave the water. Okay, well, I died because you threw a grenade and the crawlers <laughs> kept fucking scratching at my toes. That was not me. I mean, I did throw it, but I'm not gonna take responsibility for it. Please don't hit me again. Please don't fucking. Well, we tried to take George we Romero failed. out. We failed. We tried. It's just not enough firepower. All right, let's go again. Dude, I think I'd rather uh, chop my own dick off with a pair of patch oh clippers. All right, so we have Shangri-La, we have Starburst. He, I, I've heard through the oh, grapevine oh. that you're a, a pretty good zombies player. <laughs> uh, sure, let's go with that. I've heard that, um, but this is no easy task. We are going to be battle tested here. My round prediction, I'm going to go with like, I'm going to shoot low. I'm going to go six because with close quarter maps like this, that tends to be the average. What about you? Uh, yeah, I don't really know, because it depends on if we can get Juggernaut. The monkeys can be manipulated, and so can the napalm, and everything can be manipulated, but it's such a confined area, it's going to be difficult to do that. <laughs> yeah, it's not... A lot of the times you can kind of force the drops to be back here, so you at least have the most time to get them, but uh -huh. those monkeys are stingy sometimes, so it's... Yeah, and this spacing I, I, is I had to, too. <laughs> yeah, I had to I had to practice a lot on this map for ZWC as well last year. Oh, so I have right. a decent amount of experience in the first room, but I was pretty much only spending the first like four or five rounds in here until I got through the drop cycle. So I have no idea how this is gonna go on Black Ops One. Well, it's not gonna go well, but uh, I think we can do not terrible. <laughs> uh, I, <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> I don't shoot really expect to get very far. Monkeys, just for dignity purposes. Let's see. This is probably the well. Yeah, this is definitely gonna be the hardest first room on Black Ops One. I would say so. Yeah. On Call of the Dead, Ascension. we tried killing George, but it, oh boy, it just took far too long. We just gave up. It, seriously, we were there for probably like 45 minutes shooting it with an. Yeah, to say it, it takes like. 14 rounds worth of M14 ammo or something. Basically, uh, Starburst had been assigned to the Giant. He, We uh, agreed on that. But since it's so hard to uh, get everyone to fit in uh, with different uh, consoles and everything like that, I had to kind of swap some maps around. So uh, the Twitter uh, list isn't as exact as this video. You got 
instead of the giant, one of the hardest maps ever. So <laughs> I hope you're happy. Definitely way harder than the giant. Fun fact, uh, the giant was actually supposed to be a DLC map for Black Ops 2. Really? Yeah, apparently, uh, I can't remember who it was that told me, but it was one of the guys that makes... Oh, there's a Max, so... One of the guys that makes uh, custom maps said he found the file in... It's right after the Max, okay. Found the file in the, the game. No, I missed Ooh. it, because you can't knife on this game, why?! Oh, what am I... I'm being hit by a headless zombie, hell yeah. Oh, where is this Shrieker zombie, dude? He is right behind me, yes. Die! Okay, I killed him. Oh wow, he died really fast. See, Just in this little area in the front, um, it's actually possible to train. Uh, everywhere else, it's it's a lot more difficult. I've noticed that on round six, that's when shit hits the fan. I've noticed. I'm yeah, that's when. Well, players. isn't that when you get the next uh, special zombie? I think. I'm not quite there. sure, but I've just noticed on every map. Oh, round oh, six another is where things pick up. Hello, Good speedy boy. I missed both of those shots because oh, he's no uh, on PC. not wanting anything to do with you. Okay, we're good. Alright, okay, well, he's alive still. Insta kill, you know what? Yeah, let's just take that. <laughs> I remember watching people do first rooms of this like ages ago uh -huh. when people actually tried to set like four player records on these maps. This one is so. D I've never genuinely tried a starting room on this map before. This is my first genuine. I haven't on go Black ahead. Ops 1, so this is new to me. Uh, nuke, should I grab it or no? Um, you might as well. It's pretty early around. Alright. Plus, that'll save me from having to kill the 17 <laughs> zombies pouring out of my windows back here. Oh, you're not getting nuked. Hello. It's just gonna be interesting once my windows start being broken, because I'm gonna have to start... ...flooding towards you with all the zombies. This is getting tricky! I'm screwed. Wow, oh. one hit. I got one hit. Oh, that's a napalm spawning under my feet. Hello. Oh no, I gotta be spawning over here. What are you doing, game? Okay. Well, round seven. Um, we didn't do terrible. <laughs> Honestly, dude, I wasn't expecting a whole ton for Shane, just because of how difficult it actually is. Like, even the map in general. Black Ops 1, like, zombies are kind of wonky, too. The reason I died there is because the zombie was behind one, and then when I went to jump past it, it ran out around it. Yeah, I sort of got one hit. I just got blocked. I am ready. All right. Boys and girls, we have the moon starting room. This one's interesting because there's area 51 where you actually spawn, and then there's the spawn room, which isn't actually a spawn room, but it's what we deem the spawn room. It's confusing. Mm. Basically, we're going to leave area 51 because that's just... It's... We're gonna Hell. die in a minute, <laughs> so we're just gonna we're gonna go to the actual quick revive room and try our best there um, yeah. You know what there is a possibility though that we could get jug or speed cola at area 51 if you wanted to attempt Oh, true. We, we haven't really discussed oh. that. We haven't really like yeah. Uh, I mean, I guess it's possible. Save up the money, though. We'll That's see. We'll see what it is first. If it's speed cola, I'm not gonna try. If it's jug, yeah, jug would be really worth it, especially because it's like zero gravity once we go to moon, so we're gonna be bouncing around. I feel like that's gonna make it much more difficult. Yeah. Let's see what we get. God. Um, jug. Uh, should we try and stay and get points? I feel like we should. All right. Yeah, I feel like we owe it to. Why the don't viewers. I let you get it? Yeah, yeah. You, you, you get all because we'll get it much quicker. Oh God, get a thousand there. points. Oh no. I'm scared. I'm scared. I I'm just scared for that buzz of when they so no here comes the erratic them. I'm scared. Um should we uh uh Yeah, you need four hundred points. Oh no, just train, just train. You gotta we can, get out of here. No, just, just just don't panic, just train, just train. Okay, okay. okay. Just just <laughs> stay with me, Jack. Training. Stay with me, Jack. I I tried to knife it and threw a grenade, all my binds are off. Duh, uh, uh, okay. Okay, all right. I'm we're working together. We're working together. Yeah, we're gonna we're, we're gonna give it. I'll loop back around. Okay, okay, okay. Oh no! Oh wait, you've got all of them. Oh no! Oh no! Oh oh, that was a bad. Oh no! That was a doozy. Oh no! Oh, that was oh. a doozy. That was a doozy. <laughs> Shit! Let's try that again. Oh. All right, uh, are we doing the same thing or are we just gonna leave? Uh, yeah, let's try. Yeah, we it got again. Jug again. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, all right. I'll train like that. Do you want? To... Yeah, I'll train down here. All right, that's you very kind of you, much. Jack. I appreciate your yeah, sacrificing. Yeah, I, I am quite the same. On my behalf. <clears throat> I also figure once you buy it, you can just buy it, and we'll just, we'll just you'll, you just dip. Except I don't run up. freaking see any zombies. All right, we just gotta Here keep our, uh, we just gotta keep our composure. That's the number one uh, tip. I'm gonna toss some nades out there. It out here. <laughs> <laughs> 
Don't worry, I had a ton of practice. Z ZWI, I tried, I tried mood a lot. This may not mean I'm, I'm any good at it, but I would hope it would help a little bit. You only need a hundred too. Yes, right, I got know. enough. Okay. Nice. All right, yeah, now uh, you can try if you want, um, unless you don't want to do that. I can try. It might take a little while. Okay, they're getting stronger. <laughs> okay, Tim. Okay, they're, they're getting stronger. Uh, do you want to go? Um. Let's get up that. I'm gonna yeah, leave. Let's just go. I'm gonna leave so we oh, can. Oh no! Oh okay. no! You let him down here. I'm gonna open, open oh, it up no. for us. Uh, uh. All right. They're gonna turn on me. He just turned on me. Shit! He just turned on me. Go, Tim. Just run. I can't run. I can't leave without you. Go. Oh yeah, you're right. <laughs> Shit! This is not this working is out the way I thought it would. All right. Well, I'm crawling to the platform. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh no. All right. Let me know oh, when you're on. Uh, uh, I'm body blocking. Okay. I'm slowly crawling. Very slowly. <laughs> ah! Just. Okay. 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 Run okay. Up now. I'm almost there and I'll be there once you get here. Oh, no. Ah! <laughs> no! Dude! Get <laughs> on, I'm on it. I'm on go, it. Go, I'm go, on go, it. go! Shit! Hoo -hoo -hoo! <laughs> okay. Put the ass mask on quickly, motherfucker. Oh! <laughs> Okay, we made it, and I got Jug, and you didn't, and I'm sorry for that, but... No, 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 it's fine. It's at least we're alive. Like a year for me to get 2,500 points. Dude, you know what I just realized? <clears throat> what? The M14 and the Olympia are outside. Oh, so we just have pistols. Uh, oh. Um, oh, that's not good. Yep. That's all Maybe we've you could have saved up for, like, pack a bunch or something. You know what? I don't think that would have helped us, because a Mustang and Sally would have decompressed the area, and then it would have ran out of ammo. That's... That's true. And yeah, uh, we're screwed either way. Yeah, we're gonna have to start knifing very, very. We're quickly. actually so limited on this one. Playing Area 51 on Black Ops 1 reminds me of how much easier it is on like Black Ops 3. Yeah. Oh shoot, the astronaut's already here. Oh, oh no, no. Well, no. I can't let hit. I can't get, let that mofo. Oh, there's a max ammo. You want to reload? I have nothing to reload. Oh, okay, yeah, me either. I, <laughs> I can't let this guy get near me, because if I lose yeah, Jug I'm, after I'm all of what we just went through... Is it even worth killing him? How often does he spawn? I think once every other round. Let's just let's just try to kill him once, and then if he respawns, we'll leave him alone. Okay, well, I used literally every bullet on him, and he's too all right. alive. Alright, I'm gonna wait my grenade at him. Oh, God! Oh. Oh, oh no. I uh, You know what? It doesn't matter. It like what else are we gonna? It's not like we can even pick up the hacker. <laughs> we're not. Uh, we're not uh, gonna survive too long, anyways. With that, uh, because you can rebuy ammo, like in other starting rooms. Yeah. There's like a there's like a shot. Over over but this. Yeah. Dude, you got one of the one of the hardest ones here. God, the rounds are gonna take so long. There's also just gonna be this no ammo thing in the middle of my screen for the rest yeah. of the game. Yeah. And now we play the waiting game. <laughs> This insta kill is gonna get us to round five. The buried in Trent. So, did we miss we... that? <laughs> How did we? Oh, it? The, oh my God, the crawl. There's just like so many, and I have like nothing to kill them with, <laughs> except yeah. the knife. I, I threw my nades, and then you basically just try and stab, and then I can take them out. All right, Jerry. Daddy. Uh... Oh no, 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 no. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. The number one trick is to not get trapped. This is the first starting room I've had Jug on, but at the same time, I have no defense. Okay, well, yeah, there's that. Honest, yeah, I'd rather have, like, ammo, like, resupplyable ammo than just Jug. Yeah. Plus, you don't even have Jug because I I'm the only one that yeah, got I it. Have, <laughs> I basically just have a knife. We got a max ammo, and, so that's good. Yeah. Yay. And it's zero gravity, so, like, if you hit one of the little little divots, you just go flying. Right. And basically done for. We, we could just go for headshots with our pistol. Well, I can be a lot less careful with knifing because I have Jug yeah. than you can. Yeah. Again, thank I you kinda... for that luxury. Oh! Ah! Oh, God! No. Tim, no, don't leave me, Tim. Oh, no, I didn't even realize you were in this corner. Oh, no. I hear a drop. Oh, there's a nuke. Ooh. Oh, thank God. <coughs> um, let's not let's not even waste our ammo on Arhiga. Let's just let him live, cause yeah, he is it, just... it, it, it'll literally take both of our like entire magazines probably. I think round six, into the barrier. dude. If we can somehow survive this round, then we will not have tied the lowest. Oh heck yeah, dude! I but would say this is the hardest. This is around this is, shadows. This is like mostly because you can't get more ammo. No, let go of me, asshole! I got I lost my jug and I downed. Oh, no, oh no, oh no. Stupid Arhiga! You racist asshole! All right, actually, let me die because I don't get ammo. Why are if they I respawn. tracking like this? Who designed these? I'll get oh, out. No, I'll I'm get dead. out of your I'm way. Dead. I'll get out of your way. I'm dead. 
Oh no. No! Dang. I just bounced like five times in between the little square thing. All right, well, that was Moon. I mean, this was definitely one of the hardest because we didn't have any guns at all. I mean, I had Jug, but that didn't help Jack out at all. Can, yeah, the most you can get is just Jug, and then you And we had stupid Arhiga dancing in the corner like a little <laughs> prick. Anyways. You just bounce around. I keep asking everybody at the end of these starting rooms, do you have any closing statements, Jack, for the viewers that have to sit through another hour of this video? <laughs> um... Yo, just drop a like on the video. I have, once again, Tim, the same person that you saw on my bus only video when I played Transit. Tim um, and we're on Tim Black Ops back. 2. That's right, the adventures of Tim and Tim. We're back on Black Ops 2. Tim and Tim. This is going to be tough. I... This is going to be one of the harder ones. Yeah, for sure. We have an Olympia, of course, and M14. Wait. Yeah, the Olympia, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah, Not guys, a lot I read of space. All your comments from the last video, and I want to say thank you so much. So many people reached out to me and, and made me feel great, and y'all seem to enjoy it. Yes, it is very strange that Tim Hansen and Tim Malcolm from a reality TV show did a video together, but here we are again playing the same fucking map. <laughs> yep, except this time, we're trapped in here, and I guess we can build the turbine. I just, I'm gonna do it just so I don't have to, like, see, hold X for part every time I walk past it, so, I'm just well, gonna do it. Well, we can probably use it as a distraction when we need to. Ooh, you know what? That's smart. I didn't even consider that. The Olympia and the M14, that's, uh, isn't there a trick, though, that, like, if you buy the Olympia, you can make it the ray gun somehow? I've, like, read that before. Ooh, that's a, really... yeah, that's a, that's a perma perk. I am not quite sure how, how do to do, do that. It? it has a lot to do with okay. random chance and luck. So I'm not quite sure, but that, yeah, that is a thing. Oh, All right, shit. nuke. May as well grab that. So you've been a busy man, huh? You've been traveling around a lot recently? Dude, yeah, man, the show has been fucking crazy. Thank you to all the people that watch it. We've been number one four weeks in a row. Actually, one of my favorite shows is Power. And Power's a huge show. It's the biggest show stars ever made. And we beat them last week on the season premiere of the final season. I was like, I just beat 50 Cent. That's crazy. Yeah, it is crazy. Like, it's just so, I, I can't process how big this show has gotten. You know what else is crazy? The I fact that the bus blessed. is still here. <laughs> and we can't get on it. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Ted's probably a little angry. And we got the lava in here now. Yeah. That actually is going to be a giant boner. I did not figure yeah. it out. Okay, I well. didn't think about that either. So, for those of you guys that don't know, that didn't watch the Transit Bus Only video, this is Tim Malcolm. He is a star on... Uh, before the 90 days, which is a television show on TLC, it's popping off. It's really cool. He's not an official zombies YouTuber, quote unquote, but um, he loves COD zombies like we all do, and uh, he's uh, a yeah. he's a really and special sort of different guest. Not like the average you know YouTuber. A little different, but. He's still uh, still a transit boy at heart. I like am, right? and, and actually, uh, I, I was telling some people today that I was doing this video, and I'll say it again, and it always sounds like I'm trying to suck your dick, but I, dude, like, you're my idol, man. Like, so to get to play with you <laughs> is like, I'm okay, telling you. I, like, I I'm appreciate like, I, that. <laughs> dude, nah, seriously, like, I love your channel, man. Like, I Thank always you. watch your shit, like, especially when I'm, like, cleaning or something, I always throw it down in the background, and to play with you, you're like a fucking legend. I hope you don't take this offensively, because it's actually meant to be a compliment. You can make something that anybody else would do that would be boring as fuck, and somehow you make it interesting. Also, the bus, I don't think, is actually going to leave. I think it's just here forever, because <laughs> we have to, like, walk outside. That was a really smart idea, this, oh, this distraction thing. That's going to help us a lot. I'm out. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, fuck. I'll put mine down. Didn't distract See if it... well enough. Yeah, this is... Oh, my God. This is a difficult starting room. There is just not enough. All right. Uh, well... The fires would just fuck me up. No offense, Grenade, but if you maybe? die, um, you'll just respawn back in. And Okay, you know what? I didn't mean to open up this door, but... Fuck it. Do you have any grenades? Uh, oh, yeah, I do. But I don't want to blow myself up, so i got to be careful. Yeah, uh, good one, man. Totally no. Oh, man. I would have died. I was about to grab you, but I, I, I didn't want to die. It's fine. Just survive, dude. I don't want to go out on round five. Oh, God. Okay. All right. All right. 
We good. Okay, I am back in. Let me grab a fucking gun. That was horrible. The fire, man. I, I didn't think about the fire when me and you talked yeah. about doing this video. Yeah, the fire is oh, going to be a giant kick in the balls. I didn't <laughs> even <laughs> consider that. If we make that. it a 10, I, I'm going to be impressed. To be I, yeah, that's all I need is double digit. Oh, God. Oh, I'm going to down. I downed. Well, okay, maybe we're going to die. Maybe not. Maybe Tim will clutch it. Nope. Oh, <laughs> Shit. Oh my god. You know what we could have technically done, which wouldn't have helped us anyways, is we could have charged up quicker vibe with our turbines and grabbed that. But then again, like we didn't have we, we would have been fucked no matter what. There was no avoiding that. Uh, but nah guys, thank you so much. I got like a hundred people that messaged me from the last video wanting to play and I've been super busy so I haven't been online, but I'm not ignoring you. Watch ninety day fiance before the ninety day season three on Sundays. 8 o'clock, and we'll support your boy, Mr. Queen City himself, Tim Malcolm. Thank you guys so much. Welcome to the Nuketown starting room challenge I have. I'm Russian, except it's not Luke, uh, like you saw in Noct. It is his girlfriend, the gamer Cherry. The Cherry Gamer. I, which one is it? I slipped yeah, over. Yeah, just wh whatever one. Which, but is, is yeah, mine. whichever. But <laughs> yeah. I'm actually Russian. I, I just put on a voice. There is quite a bit, to, quite a bit of space to work with. Um, you know, we got the classic Olympia, the classic M14, um, and random perk spawns. So, you know, we might get something half decent in here, but of course we can't open up uh, this center area that costs three grand. So we can't get Galvies or anything cool like that. But honestly, I have high hopes for this. I'm going I'm to go for like a round 10 prediction. What are you feeling? I don't know. I think we could get better than 10. Probably. I think probably 12, 13. Yeah, because a lot of... It's, it's pretty open. Are you an M14 thing. gangster, or are you an Olympia gangster? Olympia, all the way. Oh. <laughs> it seems like they're no, all... I, 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 I really don't know. Probably, like... I don't know. It just depends on, like, you know, how you feel in the day, isn't it? Like... Yeah, if you're, if you're like, feeling... You know, if, you know, if you're feeling powerful... You maybe go for an Olympia. Like if you're if you're a top guy, maybe you go for the Olympia. Maybe if you're a bottom guy, you go for the airport. <laughs> Jesus Christ! So you and Luke are I'll friends with uh, with Justin, correct? Yeah, J Justin's Justin's my dad. That's exactly what Luke said, word for word. Oh, I I got double hit. Oh my God! Jesus! Tim, come on, you're trash. Oh, God. Come on, dude. That doesn't happen when you pick up the Olympia. Uh, Olympia. Yeah. Well, you know what? In my defense, I have no game audio right now. Luckily, I'm not as toxic as Justin or Luke. <laughs> dude, I was I was listening to like you know Luke you know playing his knack, and I'm like Jesus uh -huh. Christ. Yeah. No. He oh, literally what? he DM'd me right after the game. He's like, I hope I wasn't too toxic for you. I'm like. <laughs> I, not, I mean, I'm not family friendly. Like, I don't care if you swear. Yeah. Luke was just kind of like... <laughs> Going for it, really, yeah. Really, really... Him, him and Justin are like so... I don't know. They're just like... They'll just say anything. Yeah. Without any filter. D I oh don't... shit, I opened this. I wasn't supposed to open this. I'm sorry, Tim. I broke the rules. You mother effer. You know what? That's fine. That's fine. Uh, just don't purchase anything. I mean, you okay. know what's tricky about this? Uh, okay, I won't purchase. We, we don't open doors, right? But this is like... It's a bus. <laughs> It's like, I know it's, it's, it's not really like you know, in the actual like a... world record strat, like you're allowed to open it. Like, okay, you know, I know what? we're not really going, you know, you with know... like you know, ZWR, but like that is allowed, so I just completely forget, you know, it's just like instinct, you know, when you're just running around, it's like, yeah. hey, but I won't purchase anything in chat, we won't, you know, run through it, okay, we won't uh -huh. go near it. Yeah, that's you know, that's fair. You know what? One of the hardest things about the starting room challenge is like at you know, accidentally opening up a door, like that's one of the toughest things. Yeah, definitely, yeah. Because it is so instinctual, isn't it? Especially in a starting room, you just want to, like, open the door, you know? Yeah. Uh, did something drop in here, or was that elsewhere? I feel like I felt something drop. I can't hear anything, like... Yeah. Um, but it doesn't, like, it doesn't look... Silver Vibe normally spawns over the other side. Try to grab that. Yeah, okay, there we go. I don't know, like, your content, like, is good, you know, it's like, I don't know, you and Justin's, like, content is actually, I don't know how to say it, it's like, it's different from everyone else's, you know? Yeah. I'm not gonna here's, bash anyone. Here's you know. the content creator process, just, here, the process that Justin and I go through, right? We hop into Discord chat, we already have the map downloaded, we literally just press mm -hmm. record and just act as Hope if it's, as we act as if it's not recording. <laughs> we just play. Yeah. I do have to cut out Justin quite a bit, I have to censor him quite I'm a bit. I'm not surprised. <laughs> but other than that, like, it's just a free-flowing thing, and for some reason we, like, oddly click, even though I've never, like, met him or talked to him prior. <gasps> Ooh. That's all right. <laughs> Sorry, there's all these. Oh, they've got one runner, so watch yourself. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna have to. What the hell just dropped? Oh, God. 
That shook my <laughs> whole screen. Um, okay, so here's the deal. I'm gonna try to loop around, and if I can't get to yeah. you, um, worst case scenario. You just train them over there. It's okay. Yeah. And then right. back oh, there. grenades are, are probably helpful. I'm gonna toss some of those. Let's go. Let's go. Sweet. <laughs> okay. See, I'm pretty toxic, right? But I don't like. I don't know. I don't like doing it around other people. Like when you're in calls and stuff, you know. It's like. Okay. Yeah. I don't know. Well, it's just it feels weird because you just don't know their level of like you know. Yeah, that's fair. Um, Define toxic though. What do you mean by toxic? Like just swearing a lot? Because no, I like you know I make like you know, jokes. Making crude I, like, remarks. I probably shouldn't have made. Like I had to delete yesterday's vod on Twitch. Like uh -huh. put it that way. It was like it was stuff that I really should not have like been talking about. I think there's like you know obviously like a line with toxic. I think you know when it's funny and it's like you know just yeah. I laugh. There's a but... line for sure. Yeah. Oh god, oh god. My line is just a lot further than a lot of other people's. I think that's what makes you two so different, though, you know, like... It's a different type of content. I'm only joking, your t content's trash. Don't... Oh. Don't oh. listen to me. What the fuck? Alright, my bad. I'll try better next time. Uh, what's... I'm just doing for, for the Mega Bucks. I was told if you're in a Tim Hansen video, you get... V-Bucks? Instant to a billion. Are you a Fortnite player? You're not a Fortnite player, are you? Uh, not, not so much anymore. I used to be, you know, me yeah. and Luke used to... I don't think I've ever posted a Fortnite video. I just... Really? No, not even one. I, I posted a video as to why I don't play Fortnite. For that video, I used gameplay of my friend playing Fortnite. Like, I've literally just... <laughs> like, I never, ever liked that game. And I think it's kind of dying, to be honest. Yeah, no, 100% it's dying. Like, we still playing it end of Season 5, I think. Uh -huh. Or maybe even Season 4. Dude, um, Apex had a lot of potential, but those developers did, just got honestly, very complacent. Yeah. They're just like, all right, we got a hit on our hands. Um, no, no updates. That's it. That's a wrap. What's your thoughts on Blackout? How do you feel about it? Blackout. I loved it at first, but uh, I'm gonna... yeah. the community, to me, the Blackout community, is just the sweaty multiplayer guys, and they were just yeah. really... It was so to Like, any Blackout video I ever made were, like, I just got so many dislikes and so many toxic comments. I'm like, alright, fuck this. So, are you excited for DLC 4? Um... I'm a bit dying. Lightly excited, if if that makes sense. It's, it, the, the trailer was a little underwhelming to me, but you know what? I'm going to play it, and I'm going to probably enjoy it to a certain extent. And I'm going to try to revive you even if I die, all right? Even if I die? No, nope, we're doing it, we're doing it, we're doing it. Oh, my God! Let's go. <laughs> well done. Let's go. All right, max ammo. All right, toss your nade. I can't believe we even didn't get quick revive in here. I'm so sad. Shit. Yeah, we didn't get anything. I think mean, we still can if we live. What if we did yeah. get jug? Oh, I'm screwed. Yep, I'm screwed. Yes. Alright, hold on, I'll, I'll train up a little bit. I honestly, I do, I hate it when people go down in your game because there's just so much pressure on you, you're like... <laughs> pressure makes pearls though, okay, you're good. Oh my god! There's an armada behind you, I'm gonna run. Um, <gasps> double tap! We got double tap inside the garage. Oh my god, really? Yep. I, got double uh, tap. I can't yeah. duck. Oh, I gotta... Ooh, come on, come on, prone, prone, prone. Okay, alright. I got double tap, but I'm probably gonna lose it instantly and we just... Something else dropped just now. Yeah, oh, we got speed. No, Jug would be a lot better, but I'm not gonna complain. <laughs> double tap is... Sure as hell not I'll gonna be complaining. I'll the end of the rings, because I know I'll die if I go and grab it right now. I think this might be one of the only spawn room challenges where we get perked. I was so excited for Shang, my dude. I was like... Boys, I love Shang Star. Were you room. practicing? A lot of. Ah, I, oh, I just lost my perks. Oh, yeah, by the way, uh, right. she was scheduled to do Shang. That was the plan, but a lot of people had different. Basically, it was a nightmare scheduling all this because of all the different platforms I have to swap on to get to accommodate people. And may. Oh, okay. Ah, damn. Yeah. All right, well, you know what? Double digits. 12 and, Check. Yeah. Uh, you we, know what? We done pretty good, Tim. We I feel like I good. feel like if we got jug instead of like speed cola, if we had jug and double tap. Yeah, we'd have been jug. I think I think we could have gotten like twenty. I think least. you can even get pack a punch in the Nooktown starting room, can't you? Dude. I actually do think. Yeah, what? you can. You, you actually can. can. Yeah. Yeah. Welcome to the Die Rise starting room challenge. I have Mitch, who was originally going to be doing Zetsubo with me, and because of BO2's PC sluggishness i don't know what you want to call it uh we had to swap some maps around this is my least favorite map what are your what are your opinions on die rise do you have any um i didn't i didn't mind the map so like i've got a really unpopular opinion i don't like bo 2 zombies in general okay yeah that's fair um i think the maps are good but i think the actual engine that it runs on is just trash that's fair that's completely fair i actually kind of agree i think mob and origins were great buried was good and everything else was just subpar but yeah. that's just my opinion. And um, 
Let's see. Oh my god, the sensitivity is so low. What have we got here? We got the Olympia, and I'm assuming there's an M14 around here somewhere. The M14 is actually within this door, which we can't open, so we don't get the M14 this time around. Oh. Usually okay, we so do. We that's it. Just the Olympia. Um, there's a couple buildable parts, but no buildable table, so those don't do us no good at all. This is a very unique starting room. You have like a lower level, and then you have this like awkward staircase, which you can't really do much with. Also, these zombies have armor, which is irritating. Yeah, they do, which is annoying. I'm just gonna run with the uh, Olympia around, I think. Do you have any round predictions? Uh, I'm gonna say seven. That's a very good guess. I'm gonna go six. Oh shit! Oh, I'm screwed. You're about to go I'm down. screwed. I'm screwed. I was trapped. Okay, we, we are definitely not dying on round three. Okay. That ain't a thing. Well, in my defense, right. I wasn't using my Olympia. I should probably start doing that. That's all right. <laughs> you got, you got There's not much you can do. <laughs> oh, it's only two hit on this too. Shit. Yeah. It's all right. You'll come back next round. <laughs> Hold up. I might have time. I might have time. Oh, clutch. Oh, let's go. <laughs> all right. Now I'm going to use my Olympia. Oh, God. This training situation is going to get real ugly real quickly. Yeah, the more I'm looking at it, it's actually not going to be ideal if we're training together. This is going to be, um, interesting, to say the least. Well, maybe one of us can stay on the elevator, because maybe it requires two of us to travel down there. Oh, true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, so I'll chill on good. here. Oh god, they're hopping down, they're hopping down, and they're- oh! Uh, I don't know how to grenade Slowly, on slowly I'm taking them. I'm going to for grenade. I'm going to oh. hope- It was. Damn. Okay, perfect. Uh. I hate the way oh! I'm to train. Oh god! <laughs> oh, shit! Okay. Alright, we good, we good. Oh, that was a drop. What is that? That's double points. That's double exactly points. what double we needed. Oh! oh! Oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay. Alright. Grenades. Grenades. Get out of the way, grenades. Okay. Did that do anything? What's up? What's up? There's a max ammo down there. I don't know if that's beneficial to you, but it's there. Okay, alright, I think I'm able to revive you. This crawler's kind of fast. But uh, I'll do it. Die and die. Alright! Hey! Alright, round right. seven. We've made it this far. If we can get to double digits somehow, that would be incredible. Wait, this is like a dog trend or whatever. I don't know how- OH GOD! The- Oh fuck, fun. the jumping jacks. That's right, I have totally forgot about these things. Oh, why did I think they wouldn't spawn in? Nova crawler is on coke. We, we just gotta keep- we just gotta keep moving. Oh, they jump off the wall! Okay, alright, alright, damn, hey, damn, hey, damn, hey, damn, hey, damn. Hey, oh, God, I did not foresee what was happening. Oh. Die! Ow, 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 ow. They three hit you, I think. I think. Okay, okay, okay. We're all good, we're all good. Alright. Oh, God, it's so hard to hit them! Dude, they do not stop moving. <laughs> oh, God, they snorted a fat line of coke before this. Come here, you little shit. Ow. Okay. Thank God! Oh, yeah. Oh my god. As long as this Olympia stays at a two shot, I'm fine. Once it becomes a three shot, that's when we're in trouble. Yep, that's, yep. <laughs> that's doomsday. Slow but steady wins the race! Right, we've got a good little strat going here. Sorta. Yeah, I think this is working. Uh, until one of us downs. Oh, thank god! Nice! <laughs> I've never been happier to see a noob. I'm not in danger yet. Alright, not quite. Ow! Ow! Oh, 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 don't hit me! Don't hit me! Don't hit me! Okay. Don't go down! Don't go down! Don't go down! If you can hit that train there, I'm fine. <laughs> okay. It's so scary. All right. Let me. Just... Okay. Don't... I might have to do an ammo run midway through this round, but. Okay. All right. All right. All right. They're dropping from all angles. Oh my god. Oh! Don't hit me again! Don't hit me again! Fuck! Grenades just exploding left and right. Is that a drop? It is! Oh god, and there's another insta-kill. We'll save that. Let's try to end this round. Let's okay, round perfect. We got another insta-kill, too. I'm gonna dry hump it for good luck. Why am I saying random things in the chat? Alright, I'm gonna I chill in this elevator out. until the insta-kill runs out. When it runs out, I'll go back to training. Oh, a max ammo. Okay, that's decent. Oh, fuck. Okay, we're out. We're out. Double points. That's always needed. We got double points, though. Yep. <laughs> always look at the brighter picture. Don't hit me. I swear to fuck. Right, I swear to What? That was, that was a one hit. I swear to God on everything, that was a one hit. I'm not gonna lie. We are definitely gonna be fucked here. <laughs> okay. I'm trying my best to stay out of your way. If I can get a full 24 train of zombies, which I think I have right now, I can just I think so. Oh no! I tapped out of the game! Oh. <laughs> oh no! I pressed G for the grenade, and then I went down to press the W key. My finger slipped and I accidentally pressed the window key. Damn. Okay, oh, round 10. No. Round 10 was... I'll, I'll take that. I like that. Yeah, technically, if we killed all of the jumping jacks with 100% accuracy, you get a free perk drop, which could have made things interesting, but that's just, like, next to impossible. But anyway, this is Greg. This is... 
the best map of all time, Mob of the Dead, don't at me. And let's hop into it. One advantage of Mob of the Dead is the afterlife. Everything else is pretty much a disadvantage, though, because of how small it is and we don't have a gobble gum machine or any perks or anything like that. But afterlife is cool. We'll, we'll, uh, we'll see how we do. And we got a double points. That's right. Yeah, I'm just gonna buy that M14 right away. You know what? Not a bad idea. M14 gank for life. Yeah. Um, I ch <laughs> I choose not to be gang affiliated. I don't think I've ever actually like attempted a first room on this map before. I don't think I have either. This is I like I played it so much, but like yeah. never first room. You know. I mean, there's there's just not enough substance to it to even really like want to. But yeah, I'm gonna grab the Olympia. Uh, Let's make round predictions. I know that there are going to be some maps where I don't and I just forget, but while I remember, what do you think we're going to die on, Gray? <laughs> uh, I think I think 11. Yeah, that's... that's Yeah. Something. Maybe 12. Around round 6 is like when things pick up heavily. Like 5, 6. So, we'll we'll see. Yeah, when that 14 stops killing zombies. And the I'm just going to keep buying rounds. Yeah, the Olympia's like, reload speed yeah. is going to become a problem. Does it even matter when we grab this double point? Should I just... <laughs> Should I just... you, can, you can just get it now, it's fine. Yeah, yeah. it's like literally nothing. I don't really need points because it's only 250 for ammo for both guns. They're already getting out over here, dude. Jeez. Yeah, they're they're uh, they're getting angry. The big thing that makes this a lot more difficult is not only is it a small area, but like all the zombies on this map double swipe. Like, that is true. Yeah. Like, ridiculously fast. You picked your favorite map and you got it right away. A lot of people just, I like, had to assign maps because of how, like, confusing it was of everyone on different platforms and having to arrange everything. And I had to move people around. You got, you got a pretty solid pick, uh, I think. Well, I mean, it, it, it's been my favorite map since the release. Oh, and by the way, people, uh, this is on normal difficulty, of course. I ain't no cheat skate. I'm not going on easy. That's for all the BO2 maps. Brutus is already spawning. Oh my god, he's oh, over here. Whoa. No, 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 no. Oh, that ain't good. Greg? Oh, I got hit. Um, okay. there's. I didn't kill like any zombies on my side. Oh my so. god. Oh my god. Greg? I'm trying, dude. I'm trying. <laughs> I was. I was. If I didn't oh, yeah, die. Have afterlife. I would have. I would have been more surprised if I lived than died right there. Okay, well. Um, do they permanently die if we shock them? I'll try to train Brutus over here. Well, the, all the zombies are coming now, so we gotta, like, hop back. Shit, nope, shit dead. on a stick. Dude, that is hard. Brutus made that, like, infinitely harder. I did not think he was gonna pop in that early. Well, I guess that's it. Um, Brutus really just dicked us. Okay. Yep. Well, I mean... You can't really do anything with the M14. Yeah, the there just aren't many expectations for mobs starting room. But uh, anyways, on to what's up next? Buried. Here we are in Buried. We're gonna hop into this. I have Optimus here. He's more of a he's a commentary YouTuber. He doesn't he's not really like in the in the heart of the zombies community. But no matter, uh, he selected Buried, and we're gonna do it. Buried's a little tricky though because there isn't a door to to get out of there. But we're just gonna not jump into the hole. We're just gonna stay on the top level. We have an Olympia. We have an M14. We're just gonna try to deal with that. But you know what? That's all right. It's a true test of character. I'm probably gonna grab the, uh, I'm gonna grab the M14. Yeah, that's probably our best starter here. Uh, let's make round predictions. What round do you want to predict we're gonna reach our demise? <laughs> oh, man, yeah, there, there's not, there's not too many weapons, uh, there's not a whole lot for us to run around to. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, let's see, I would say probably, like, nine max. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna shoot for, I'm gonna shoot for ten just because I want to get to double digits. That's really my... That's what's gonna help me sleep at night, is if we get to double digits. So, you're not exactly a Zombies guy, but you are a Call of Duty guy, for sure. Yeah, yeah. Um, Multiplayer. Zo zombies is pretty cool sometimes, I just feel like, uh... I'm just not really into the whole lore of it. I think the lore is just kind of... Um, it's a little overbearing at times, for sure. I'm, yeah. not, I'm, not, I'm not even a huge fan of it, either. Uh, like... I'm not a huge fan of the BO4 story. I liked the... I liked it when it was simpler, and like, BO1, 2, even 3, yeah, to an extent. I, I, yeah, it, I don't even, ugh, I wouldn't bother. I mean, I guess we do have a lot of space, but it's not training space. It's just corridors. We don't, yeah. very narrow space. Yeah, weird. This is like probably one of the more unique starting rooms for sure. People don't ever stay up here. They just dip almost immediately. Yeah, I've never been up here this long, ever. Yeah, it, there is the LSAT up there too, which I would grab, but 
uh, you, you really can't, um, like, you fall automatically when you grab it. Like, you can't grab it and then land back in here. You just drop down into the oh, map. Yeah, you go straight down into the very map, don't you? Yeah, if we could get the LSAT, that would be pretty sick. I'm gonna grab the, I haven't even grabbed the Olympia yet. I've just been rocking the starting pistol. Yeah, I've just been holding on to both and then just kind of swapping in between depending on what range they're at. This, this right. Yeah, these these are not gonna last us long. We're gonna see these drop off in like a round or two. Well, also we got grenades. We gotta be mindful of that because that can actually be really helpful. Uh, oh, yeah. At a distance, of course. You know, you know what might be a good idea is actually just camping like over in this corner because like we can maintain this barrier. Oh, maybe not. I don't know. It seems like the rate of the zombies coming in on this barrier. Oh God. Oh, turn around! Turn around! Turn around! Oh, Christ. <laughs> oh God! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Shit, I'm gonna have to- I'm gonna fall off. Nope, I had to die. Well, this might be it. Alright, it's time to fall up. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Damn, round six. Yeah, no, I thought we could camp or- Pfft. No, yeah, that, didn't work out. that didn't last that didn't long. The Olympia's fall. reload speed just kills it, and then the M14's just a pea shooter. Anyways, well that's Barry. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Origin Starting Room Challenge. I should probably actually load into the lobby before I do that little intro. Um, this one's gonna be interesting because there's more space and there's more to work with. I have Fat Matt here. I'm saying round 13. That's, that's fair. That's, yep, that's a solid bet. Um, uh, we can turn on Gen 1. We can get Quick Revive. We have the Challenge Board. We have, uh, we technically have a Mystery Box location and a Wonder Fizz location. I don't think either of those will be helpful to us. M14 and a Ballista. And is that it? I think that's it. The Ooh, the Panzer sold that. Right. Um, no, is we don't... he going to... S I don't think he's going to no, spawn it. Right. I hope so. Unless he comes to this hole, then... <laughs> Somehow he squeezes through here. I don't think he will. I think we're no, safe. I... So you picked Origins. Was there any specific reason for that, or is it just because you like the map? Um, Favorite map of all time. Yours is Mob, right? Yeah. Mob and then so... Drys and Drek. Oh, okay. Mine's pretty much the same. I like Origins a lot. I think it's the second greatest map like just objectively uh but it's just not one of my favorites i guess i no like if if i could play another map i would not like a first like i don't know like if i had to get to around 100 on a map uh -huh. and i had to pick one that was for fun i would not pick origins okay because like all the generator it's just a chore list yeah now if we were playing on the black ops 3 version things would be a lot easier we could literally spend the thirty thousand points of gobble rooms oh my god it'd be so much easier yeah and then I mean, I'm not allowing Megas on DO3 anyways, but um, yeah. if I did, <laughs> there's a mystery box, Wonder Fizz. I've noticed through all of these starting room challenges that round six seems to be the round where everything goes to hell. Okay. Every single time. Round six <laughs> is always, like, for some reason, the cutoff of, like, bliss and then just death. That's it. It's just torture from there on. I mean, even if we do get the Panzer, when does he come? Like, eight? Yeah, round eight. So, okay. yeah, we're fine for now. I'm gonna grab the ballista now. And just go. For I'm really it. thinking he doesn't come, but you never know. He won't. Sure. I, I, I really don't think he will. Origins is a really interesting dynamic because you have two different levels. You have a upper and a lower. Yeah, no, it's a great layout. No, this challenge is actually pretty fun. I'm enjoying myself so far. Yeah, <laughs> so far. 10 out of 10 experience. Haven't gone down yet. All right, I got a breach, by the way, so watch your back if you happen to be near yeah. the staircase. Ooh! Oh! Totally fine. All right. Shit. Dude, oh, zombie blood. We're good. We're good. I was gonna be like, at least we made it to seven, but... And there still is, like, a zombie blood in the thing. Do you wanna just recuperate really quick? Alright, you know what? Yeah, I'll do that. Alright, I'm gonna throw nades then. You know, I forgot about nades. Oh, they're all gonna pile up too? That's perfect. So, I am Takia. What are my challenges? Spend 30,000 points, six generators, and 115 headshots. So, six generators, not possible. 115 headshots, that's possible. Gotta spam ammo, and I should probably go downstairs before we die. No oh, shit! We got round eight. Oh, oh, I'm gonna try oh, to get out of the way. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Yep, death. Nope, not not death. Nope, nope. I can kind of see it. Death, oh. death. <laughs> shit! It was a good. We got eight. I'll take eight. eight. I'll take eight. That is origins. Now we're gonna head into Black Ops Three. If you've made it this far into the video, God damn, thank you, uh, Matt. Do you have any like closing statements? What do you want the viewers to keep in their mind for the rest of this video? Uh, they got a ways to go still. Whenever I order a burger from anywhere, I don't get pickles on it. Hmm, that's interesting. You know what I think about burgers? I think if you put what? mayo on burgers, you should you don't be deserve that. locked up.
That's terrible. Mayo on burgers just doesn't belong. Anyways, um, on to Shadows of Evil. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Black Ops 3. We are doing Shadows of Evil, of course, to kick things off. I have Chopper here. Of course, all links are in the description. There isn't a Gobblegum machine in the Shadow Spawn Room, so we're not even going to worry about that. But um, we are going to load up Shadows and we're gonna get into it. It's been it's been a while. I think I part. think on round eight the Margwa comes. I could be wrong. Yeah, <laughs> that's gonna be. Tr I think one of us might have to go into beast mode, and then the other one's just gonna have to run around and pray to God <laughs> that they live. Bro, I'm telling you, the absolute sauce for this map is if you can hit the death machine at the end of round seven. So when the Margwa spawns round eight, it's oh, just light work. That's, that's true. That's the we way. have a fumigator. That's the way. Yeah, we have a fumigator. Mm -hmm. That's right. Um, I'll let you pick it up. So yeah, I guess. Yep, so we only have one. Unfortunately, like, it doesn't really start to give you good stuff until, like, round 10 or 11 or so. What you can do is, like, kind of get your drop cycle in a way where you can try to land the death machine round 7. That's cool. It, it's possible to to take care of the Margo round 8, but it's significantly harder. We've got a max ammo in here. That's... Ooh. Oh, I don't know. Eh. That's not good. We already... That's, we have, yeah, we, have, I mean... we have unlimited <laughs> ammo in here. I don't know if that's necessary. Yeah. I'm so used to spawning with an RK-5. I don't have that luxury on PC. Bro, me too. I was I, I was thinking about it, and I was like, wait, where's my RK-5? I was like, oh, we're on PC. There it is. And, and we have Quick Revive, <laughs> if that's necessary. Have you, have you ever done this one solo? I have never done this starting room challenge solo. No, I... <laughs> I have not. I think it's. I think this is definitely one of the harder ones. Uh, yeah, it's so small. especially in BO3 for first room. Yeah, because there's no gumballs, which is a big disadvantage. Because yeah. even just having a gumball machine means you have like in plain sight and that sort of thing, and that makes it so much easier on other maps. Yeah, dude. But or uh, you have the beast mode table, which is nice. Yeah. However, that's the only a lot thing. of starting yeah. rooms have like mystery boxes and sometimes a wonder fizz machine. Like this is the probably one of the, <laughs> thank you revelations this is one of the most primitive starting rooms of all time it could be a huge game what if we just pull off a casual world record right here man you never know yeah, you never know never really know <laughs> could be absolutely cracked on the sticks today dude this map is so good man it feels great for me to be back on shadows yes. i don't know i don't know where you stand on favorite map but this is still like it's number, number one for me. it's uh, on my top on my favorite list it is number four it is my favorite okay. map. I this map is simply beautiful. There's just attention detail with everything. Do you remember? I was looking at this map. Do you remember the uh, the rumored f or like the cut fifth district that was supposed to be in this map? I I never I, about I, that? I never heard of that. Really? Yeah, there was a fi there was a fifth district that was supposed to be part of Shadows uh, that got cut. It was something that uh, like Jason spoke about briefly. Um, he never really told us what it was going to be, though, but there was supposed to be, like, a, an entire new section, an entire new district. Wow. Um, but I think they wanted to keep it to four because of, like, the four characters in the map, and it would make, like, the yeah. gameplay that much more cool. Yeah. But <laughs> the world may never know what that what that could have been. It could have been sick. District. Dude, if somebody made, like, a custom map with shadows just with the fifth district added, that would be amazing. Holy crap, yeah. Where do you think they'd you know put what I mean? that? I, Where do you think they would, like, put the entrance to it? I don't know. It could be behind here, like, Easy Street, just maybe an extension further back, like, this oh, way. Oh, yeah. Got the bug around. Here oh, we go, here cool. we go. So this should be pretty easy. If we can land the Death Machine next round, Ooh, that'll be perfect. The pot is red. That's that's the goal. It just turned red. That's good. <laughs> oh, my God. Jesus! Wow. Oh, my God. There's actually a ton. <laughs> Holy crap. Yeah. Just chuck it up for the boys. Oh, that didn't do much. Cheat that bad boy. <sighs> I, I really like, I was thinking about it, I really like when custom maps are, it's like the original map, but with something new added. Like, I really dig yeah, something. Yeah, like, like a, like a reimagine. Like a, mm -hmm. like, you ever played Town Reimagined? They, like, had, had yeah, a PhD oh, that was great. in the bunker, and they had banana cola. That was incredible. They opened up that bowling alley, that is, that's. Oh. Yeah, see, I, I love stuff like that. It's like all of the. Yeah. All the areas that we wanted to play in in the original map like years ago, and it finally gets like opened up or designed like that's my favorite. Oh shh. <laughs> Try not to swear <laughs> as much. Shit. <laughs> then there it is. Actually, the number one cause for concern in these starting room challenges is accidentally opening up a door. Okay. Dude, that's it, dog, honestly. I wonder if you go into beast mode and kill zombies, does it permanently kill them or do they respawn? I they never Uh if you uh, if you like melee them they permanently die. Oh I am I'm gonna it's die. It's getting tight here. I'm clap. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. If you get a death machine, uh hold it. I'm gonna try to keep killing. You got this dude, you got this. I'm out of ammo. I think that's it, what's in front of you? Uh, oh, she's running! Ah! Uh, All right, thank God. So, <laughs> all right, uh, here's our Margo. We can take a chance so the with the pot if you want. 
Or we could just go and... Uh, uh, yeah, actually, I'm gonna open that up. Alright. Okay, get, get ready for the Margwa. I am ready. Oh, we got a nuke. Okay, that's actually great. Yes. Um... Okay. Just spray the Margwa, spray the Margwa. I'm gonna nuke it. Alright, one head off. Nice. <laughs> oh, this, oh, it's, oh no, we got this, we got this. Okay, so I'm gonna grab this instant kill when they start spawning. Oh back my in, god! And I'll just <laughs> play out. Just keep running. Keep running, you got this. I'll help you. Two. Nice. Two. Yep, yep, yep. Alright, I'm gonna try to run past right. him this way! Oh, that didn't work. Oh, I don't have quick revive. One second. I uh, keep keep killing. I'm gonna grab this revive and then I'm gonna come get you. Actually, tell you what, I can just grab you in beast mode. That is smart. Okay, I got you, pal. Oh my Hang in God. there. We I'm survived I'm gonna bleed this the Margwa. I'm very happy about that. Dude, that's I've never gotten this far. The game. I've never gotten this far because I always die to that mother effer. Okay, I'm gonna gather them up. I've got a genius plan here. <laughs> I'm gonna wait till I'm gonna wait till you're a little bit lower, and then now, dude, wow. look at that. Clear the Margwa. Oh my goodness. What do you know? On a two-player game. That's. I, th I think it's pretty impressive. That's good. Yeah. Oh, we got a meatball round. Oh, Beautiful. So that's perfect. another. That should be another free round unless we get smoked on this for All some right, reason. Yeah, I'm gonna cook some grenades. Blow. Wow. Oh my god. Holy I'm riding the wall. Dude, <laughs> you saw that, right? <laughs> yeah. Mr. Tony Hawk out here wall riding that. You bad Italian cuisine. <laughs> Why did Treyarch add these things? I don't understand. I don't. I think that's like I don't know. one of the biggest questions. It's like one of the biggest lore. <laughs> I, I get it as like a thing. They're like, hey, let's reuse the wraps and zombies, but let's make it look cool. Oh, you know what? I gotta be honest, with you. That explains a lot. Ah. <laughs> don't know if I'm about it. This is pretty decent, even for a two-player run. This is this is actually really good. Training. Like we're gonna have to focus more on like uh like movement now, because we're not gonna hold down these barriers. <gasps> then I jump into beast. All right, I'm gonna let them gather. Oh, my bad. I just figured oh, you're I'd good, grab you're good. that. Oh, quick revive. I think they'll keep gathering. I guess I can grab that. Mode. Try to burn as much of this beast mode as I can, and then as soon as it runs out, I'll just nade the middle where they where they gather up. Actually, oh yeah, I forgot. <laughs> they come towards you because it's not solo. Oh <laughs> Very God. cool. Hey, I leveled up. I'm level three now on PC. Oh, I'm screwed. Oh my God. I'm, yep, there was no escaping that. Our demise is uh is coming quick. Well, uh, do you have, a, you don't have a beast mode, do you? Nope. Just, just, uh... <laughs> Insta kill. Oh, there's an insta kill. Wow, aggressive much. Dude, it's getting a yeah, I think little get any, bit difficult. Any nice drops will be be pog. It's like kind of impossible beast to mode? train over here. Oh my yeah, god. it's a little rough back there. Oh my god. I'm just trying to slay out if I can. I'm like surviving. I got the Ooh, I'm dead. Oh no. I'm cracked, I'm dead. Oh, oh my god, <laughs> dude! I just, I just instantly died. Wow! Oh my dude, god, dude! Good game, man. Good game. All right, well, thank you very much. I appreciate it, guys. Check out Chopper once again, and on to the giant, ladies and gentlemen. I have my friend Johnny J25 here, the co-host of the Zombros podcast. Uh, we're on the giant. We're gonna do the starting room challenge. What else would we be doing? It'd be kind of weird if we did a completely different challenge in the midst of this giant video. I don't know why yeah. I had to clarify that. It's like, okay, guys, so we've decided halfway through that the one room challenge just <laughs> blows. So yeah. now we're just doing the no rules challenge where anything goes. You can open up any door, hit the box as many times as you want by yeah. whatever perk you fancy. Yeah. Doing the no rules challenge. So what's actually very unfortunate about this all is we tried playing Die Rise because that was the original plan for Johnny since that's his favorite map, or at least one of his favorite. Uh, but it is the undisputed credit map. Things, things didn't really work out on the BO2 servers for some reason. We tried solving it. So, anyways, we're on PS4 now. Or, PC with my PS4 controller uh, playing the Giant. We have, of course, an RK5 and a Shiva to work with. Nothing else. Um, it's an interesting dynamic, this starting room. Because we have, like, this platform up here. But we also have um, some lower area. It's, it's an interesting starting room. One person can kind of chill in this front area by the clock. Yep. But then the other person's going to have to get creative. So what is your favorite map? Is it Die Rise? It, it, it's up there. Favorite map. I don't know if I have a favorite map, but it's like favorite maps, you know? Uh-huh. Yeah, I can agree with that. Like, Mob of the Dead and Die and Drac. Number one is Mob, but it's basically 1A and 1B. Die and Drac and Mob are, like, basically equal to me, but at the same time, like, if I had to pick, it would be Mob. But they're, they're dead even to me. If I had to pick a favorite map of all time, I think I would go with Mob. 
not only because I think the gameplay is just amazing, but it's just innovative as a map, uh -huh. especially as a concept too. Like in a way, it could be its own encapsulated story. It doesn't need to exist. In the zombies. That's right. Yeah, I love how unique that map is. Oh God! I almost downed. Oh boy. All right, grenades are a thing. That's right. Grenades are a thing. Ooh, an insta kill. Okay, that's gonna be good. Yeah, I think double digits are entirely plausible. I think we can get there for sure. Oh, absolutely. If we can't, I'm gonna be really upset. Just shy of like a fuck up. Ah, uh, nuke. Okay. Ah, fuck. All right. You sacrificed yourself for the greater good, Johnny. Yeah, it was kind of dumb though, because I could have just waited for the zombies to get out of the way. Yeah. You probably prefer John, yes, instead of Johnny. Yeah, but I also at this point don't really care. Uh huh. I have another friend named Johnny. It's plus Johnny. And his name, I don't even know what his real name is. John or Jonathan? Pfft, beats me. Well, so Jonathan is, how does he spell John? It's. It's J O N. It's just straight up John. Oh, then yeah, it's John. Because it's there's an H in there. Yeah, the, the uh, J O N. They are an inferior John. So, you know, so Dalek? No, I think. Yeah, actually, yeah, John is an inferior John. <laughs> you want to put it out there? I'll say I'll, I'll throw the gauntlet down right now, John. I was gonna ask him to be in the part two of this video, which may or may not even happen. But if there was, I was gonna ask him to be part of it. He might have something to say. Uh, Watch you know, he can come on here and defend his name all he wants. I might go stop. Oh, I'm screwed. I am screwed. Yep, one of us was bound to go down right there. <laughs> it was either gonna yeah. be you or me. I definitely screwed you over there by running away. That's all right. Dude, worst case scenario, if I bleed out, don't even try for me, because I'll just respawn and grab the two things we need. Oh, I grabbed an insta- Let me try to crawl to this insta-kill. Yeah, Let me- it, Let, let it. that be my dying grace. Let me just- eh. I might just, just run over to it. Yeah, alright. Well, now if you want to revive me, I can cover you. Yeah, I might just let you die. Dang. Yay, Maxim. That was a pretty- I, I, I pulled off some good moves there. Yeah, I saw that. That was pretty good. That was pretty impressive. The best damn zombies player this community has ever seen. Actually, I think that I think that title belongs to Lonely Mailbox. Oh, mailbox. Everyone asked, like, he was a request for this video. Like, people were like upset that he wasn't a part of this. I'm like, the guy doesn't even upload zombie. He hasn't for the past like two years. You realize this, right? <laughs> like, they're like, where's mailbox? I'm gonna down. Holy shit! I shouldn't have downed. I was t too busy talking about mailbox. Okay. That's a really good strat over there, what you're doing. And what I'm doing is not a good strat because I'm about to down. Okay. All right. Well, I made it out of that alive. Somehow. Uh, Going back to the mailbox thing, though, I'd be curious if he'd be interested in this call. <laughs> Maybe. I mean, he's doing his own thing. He's got... He's. I think he's doing film school and stuff. Like, he's got... Yeah. Well, see, the thing is about this video, it's really only like a 15-minute session of just zombies. Like... It's not like he has to edit or produce anything. It would just be on my end. If the people want him, I'll ask him, but I'm not going to badger him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah it's, what leverage do you have on Mailbox? Mailbox, if you don't... <laughs> if you don't if you do not do a starting room with me, I so help me God. I will say mean things about you on Twitter. I will save your upload schedule. I'll steal your channel. I will, I'll upload videos to your channel. 30-second <laughs> clips of me brushing my teeth in the morning. You're done. It's just going to be 15 minutes of me eating Cheerios. You know what really upset me about this whole thing is Noah. I think I already told you this off of camera, but for those of you watching, Noah, J456, the Noah, hit me up asking me to play zombies with him on Twitter, right? After this video had already been arranged. So I can't shove him into this video assuming somebody cancels on me or doesn't well, cancel you on me. You I just have to kick somebody out. <laughs> Which would be a really dick Thickish thing to die. Ah, oh, God. You, now you gotta ask yourself who of the however many people six more people up, is worth cutting for Noah. Ah, shit. All right. <laughs> All right. This is not meant for two people. This this is actually good for one person. Like that like that little area you were in was is great. But I just had nowhere to be. <laughs> I was just running around. So that is it. Uh, do you have any closing statements? Uh, die rise for president. Uh huh. Right. I might cut that out of the... <laughs> no, I'll keep it in. I'll keep it in. I'm not that close-minded. Welcome to the Derise and Drax starting room. I have Reed here, and let's not waste any time. Let's just get oh. into this madness. Also, round oh. round predictions. What are you thinking? Oh. 
because on on round 12 that Panzer is gonna make an appearance. Oh yeah, we're 12 then. Yeah, 12. that's gonna be tricky. Oh. With Megas, it wouldn't be hard. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. With Megas, I was all pumped to be using the uh, raindrops and stuff and laughing about how fast we'll be going through the rounds. With Classic, <laughs> yeah. The weapons are gonna fall off really quick. Yeah, we got a Shiva, an RK-5. We could possibly get a ray gun. I'm not even sure how to do that. Oh, yes. Oh, we totally should have looked that up before this time. That would make a huge difference. I heard this weird, uh, this is this could be total superstition. I don't know if it's true, but I heard you could just toss grenades in the gondola yes. or yes, something. I heard the same thing. Should we just try it? Should I just? Yes, yes. Grenades. I don't even remember what grenade. It, do I have tactical on okay. or something? Oh, there they are. Oh, no. All right, grenades in the tram. <laughs> I doubt it's going to do anything, but maybe hey, in a couple rounds something. we'll be thankful for it. I'm not a big PS4 guy, so I don't start. I don't spawn in with the RK5, um, and I'm a low ass level. So, uh, just for the for the audience wondering. I don't know. I, I, if you're measuring, being like, oh my god, you're not a prestige match across all three uh, levels. <laughs> it's like really? All, it's all like platforms. Johnny Kinect, this guy. This guy doesn't even play the game and he gets away with being a zombie YouTuber. I don't think it's a requirement to be a prestige master yeah. at zombie. Yeah, Lex is prestige master level 1000, and when he hopped into my Thanks lobby, bro. I was like, Oh, God! Lex, <laughs> do you want to talk about something? No, but on Xbox, I'm, uh, I think, level 700 prestige master, but on PS4, oh. just not not even close. I know Lex was already in the prestige master range of like two to 300 the first week the game released. Dear God! So, like, how is that even possible? I know. He, he just non-stop played it for like two or three weeks, and I was like, god. oh my god, Lex. Or at least re he reached the final prestige, because it was only 35, it's only 35 levels per. The guy was just non-stop. It was... Dear god. Oof. I don't know if Oof. that's like concerning, or if that's dedication, or what, but... Little could not do that. That speaks a lot on uh, BO3's replayability. I mean, for someone to mm -hmm. be playing it that much and grind that hard. I don't think, Absolutely. I think it's just something we don't have in BO4, to be honest, but... Oh, I agree. You, you play it for a few minutes, I'm like, well, that was... Yeah, yeah. You, you complete a, a gauntlet on, like, hard difficulty, you get a sticker. <laughs> it's like, here you go, yeah. champ. Yeah, no, I think you, I think you get a sticker for completing the gauntlets, like, on regular difficulty, and I think if you bump up the difficulty, it's still the same sticker, but, like, slightly different. Yes, with a slight... Uh, with a slight... Uh, yeah, <laughs> something like that. I think it's a miracle BO4 even was released, to be fair. Yeah. I think it really I just, had a trouble development. Yeah, Activision... I, this is my theory. Activision was like, Yo, Treyarch, go ahead and make us a game. <laughs> Another Black Ops, because they sell well. Treyarch's like, alright, we'll just remaster all the maps that people want us to that haven't mm -hmm. been, like Mob and Five, and then we'll create, like, a, a new fresh storyline in Chaos as, like, a, you know, to keep things fresh on the side. And mm -hmm. that's what BO4 is to me. <laughs> and it, it, I feel like they just tried to fix things that weren't broken. And ultimately, sure. I just think the the HUD, I don't know. It just, it all just seemed unnecessary. No, round five, I'm so rusty. Dude, I need a Shiva. Oh, God. I, I almost did, and I revived you, but you didn't get up. I guess I missed, like, the last millisecond of that. I'm gonna grab a Shiva, because I haven't go. done that yet. Yeah, please do, and I'll, I'll look <laughs> behind myself. I was trying to be uh, clever. And that's what cleverness gets you. I was rebuilding a barrier, shooting zombies down by you, covering your back, and then... Mm -hmm. you know. We got dogs. Animax ammo. So I think the next plan is to keep spamming the tram as soon as we get it. Yeah. I think if... I think on the fifth tram fuse, you get something good. Again, that could be total BS. These are just things I've heard. That could just be total hey. myths. We get that ray gun. That's, that's all I care about. I'm just trying to enjoy my time before round 12. <laughs> <laughs> yep. This starting room is spacious, but it's like a different kind of space. Like it's not like wide open. Mm. You got like some, like it's manageable, but Absolutely. that Panzer is just a killer. Greg and I did mob, and we got to round six. Brutus spawned in, and the minute Brutus spawned in, we were done. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Pack no! your bags. It was just done because there's no space in the mob starting room. It's just yeah, you're doomed. If we get a ray gun somehow. That's oh, going to take the I'm Panzer right. out, for sure. I'd be so excited. Find me, I have a ray gun! Fire sale, good Ooh. thing there's no mystery box oh, in here. Oh, so much sadness. We get our nades back per round, or per... Per round, yeah. Okay, yeah. Because the new game is the dumb charge rate. Again, things that weren't broken. Mm -hmm. And then you couldn't have, like, 
monkey bombs and a special grenade. Yeah, you gotta you gotta sacrifice your uh, your wraith fires if you want to hold the hell's retriever. <laughs> it's just, just yeah. What I think it, it interrupts the flow of the game. Yeah, wraith fires game. are infinite damage, aren't they? And the hell's retriever isn't. Yep. So why would you even get the hell's retriever? Yep. It just totally decentivizes it. Because you have to do the Easter egg, right? Oh, uh, yeah, I guess. It's required. I'm like somewhat managing. Oh, my God. Oh, nice. <sighs> this is getting uh, a little another, tricky. Another made out. I may I have... I gotta remember I have in plain sight. Like, for this... Okay, I had to use one of them. Right. Oh, boy. Better that Which than dead. Ooh, thank you. Ooh, okay. Come again. I'd be willing to bet that 95% of all starting room challenges on this map end at round 12. <laughs> <laughs> I'm screwed. Oh, I'm not screwed. Ah! Ah! Oh my god. Oh, I got God in this board. Ooh, I'm gonna die. Maybe not. I am like Don't do it. shocked. Don't do it. Shocked I'm alive! Think. Okay, I have to use my. I have to use another in plain sight. Okay, that's. that's all right. I got. <sighs> oh, I got another in plain sight. I can't see. The screen's blurry. Okay, I'm alive. Camping probably isn't a good idea, but um, there is that little area up there with quick revive. Yes, that isn't too Maybe bad. Maybe one. That's actually a really great area when you have the bows or yeah. pack a bunch of weapons. But right now, I'm thinking if I stay up here, things are a lot more manageable. No. And us both down there. Ooh, okay, oh, we'll save that, that. Save that, save that. Nah, whatever. Ah, uh, yeah, crap. I've never used a single mega elixir, or whatever you want to call it, or a talisman. Yep, yep. I've only yep. used classics. That's it. Like, anywhere but here, temporal. Like, that's actually it. Oh, wow. 11, 11. We're getting close. Ooh. Getting close to D-Day. One time I had a nightmare about being in D-Day, and it was oh. literally the... Obviously, it was the scariest stream I ever had, but I don't think I've ever been more terrified in my entire life. I had, I had, okay, I had a pallet, a wooden pallet as a shield. Oh, oh no, yeah, that'll do it. Ah, oh, shit. Oh no. Okay. Um, I'm gonna just crawl in the corner and stay out of your way, unless you have in plain sight. That works too. Thank you. And I'm gonna do that so you can get your train going again. I'm gonna go back up. Oh, but I'm about to go the wrong way. And okay, in plain sight. Okay. Uh, uh. Stay alive. And once again, I have to use the in plain sight. God damn it. Okay, that's. <sighs> wow. We'll be okay. We got crawlers. We got crawlers. Dude, I got I got downed by a headless zombie. Oh, oh shit! Did I hit that? Oh. Ah. Please, just like anything but tone death. Sword flay. Oh god, he's right next to me. Oh, he came right to you. Okay. Okay. Well, I'm gonna try really, really darn hard. Oh, I'm gonna die already. Okay, I, I oh, managed. Purple. I managed. No, it's purple. It was there. I managed to shoot him nice. <laughs> once. Well, uh, that's uh, game I over. Plain sight, oh, uh, oh, oh, oh. Um, I lost it. You should get it. Oh, so close. Nope, that's game over. I knew it. Oh, There's just. No, I was so close in plain sight. Oh. <sighs> Very good. If you have any closing statements, Reed, go ahead. Uh, you're killing it, Tim. And I think some people are like, well, you don't like Tim Hansen when I said you were killing it in a meme I made in one of my past videos. Tim, what you're doing is terrific for the Zombies community. Thank you. Keep it up, and this is a great idea for a video. And I hope to see you killing it with more videos in the future. Thank you. And next up is Zetsubo no Shima. Ladies and gentlemen, we have Zetsubo no Shima with I'm Helios, a.k.a. Hagen. And, um, What's going on? We're just going to go take a gander, first. hop into Shrek's... Swamp. <laughs> Swamp. Uh, yep, classic Hulk <laughs> only, mean? of course. And I'm ready. I, I'm scared, but uh, I'm ready. This starting room uh, is interesting because we have quite a bit of space, and we have a lot of water mm -hmm. we can actually swim in. Uh, so it's an interesting dynamic. This is the only starting room with water in it, I believe. Hmm. Correct. Uh, no, call the dead. Call the. Dead. I was just about to say, yeah, call the dead. But um, <gasps> yeah, this Weird. is bucket. an Give interesting bucket. space. So if you're I got gonna, the bucket. If you're gonna pick up the bucket, you, you're responsible for getting us the best possible plants. By the way, I planted my seed so you can water it. <laughs> oh, dude, let me let me water your seed real fast. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we could get like um. I know you can get like an XM53. You could get an RK5, a Shiva. Uh, uh locust, uh, if I remember correctly. Yeah. I love this map. Like I remember hating it when it first came out, but I think it was just because of the like the hate train. But like this yeah. is such a beautiful map. 
Yeah, it's growing on people for sure. The community seems to really dig this map. Kind of like Shang. Like every, I feel like every jungle map is hated at first because they're difficult. But then it sort of uh, grows on people. Oh, oh by the way, round predictions. Do you have a round prediction? It's okay um, if you don't. <laughs> I, I'm going to say 16. I feel like 16 is the rip. That seems like a... Yeah, I can see that. You know, I'm going to go... Uh, I don't know. Should I be optimistic about this? I'm not. I'm not even sure how I should feel about Zetsubo. <laughs> I'm gonna go 18. I guess. 18. That's. I mean, that's that's a long shot, but anything's possible. Uh -huh. Oh, I forgot there was a spider around. Jeez. Oh yeah, that's right. Sock options been doing me pretty well. I'm not gonna lie. Oh yeah, that one's helpful. I guess. Since we're using wall guns, I guess uh, alchemical wouldn't really be that helpful. I don't have it unlocked anyway, so it's not like I could equip that. If I <laughs> it's not like you're level a thousand. <laughs> Uh, max ammo. Dude, why did I put Arsenal Accelerator? You can't even get the skull in this. <laughs> I'm an idiot, dude. Give me an XM53, baby. A oh, that looks. That was. That's the power play. That's the. That's the Shit. one that I want. All right. Well, this suddenly got a lot better for me. <laughs> I'm over here struggling and shit. I am happy with that. This is the happiest I've ever been to have the locust. <laughs> no cap. N no game. Maybe I should save my locust ammo because I was I was trying to uh, yeah. That's limited. I'd say. Oh, we live another round. Let's go, baby. Grow, grow, my child. What do we got? Ew. I got. <gasps> Damn. Oh, I got a locust. Let's go. Let's go, baby. I got that phase camo. Let's go, baby. I think I think 18 is entirely plausible now. That, that was pretty good luck getting both two locusts. I've I've never seen that to be fair. Yep, we gotta take advantage of that. We gotta capitalize. You gotta no cap. Just okay. All right, all right. settle down. Oh, another spider round. Lit. So so we can get that C going. Honestly, Probably uh. Though I hated the thrashers, I never minded the spiders. They're annoying little shits, yeah, but they mm -hmm. they add quite a bit to Zetsubo. I always kind of liked them. Oh yeah, unless I mean, I down by them, then I fucking hate uh, them. Oh yeah, it's gonna be huge later on. I feel like. Yeah, those and nukes. Nukes are just like the biggest relief. Mm -hmm. So uh, what's the uh, the meaning behind your clan tag, Turkey? Oh, um, one time. Okay, there was this episode of SpongeBob where. Squidward goes to Squillia, uh, Squidville, and, uh -huh. um, God, I'm trying to remember. One of the squid characters said something about a turkey sandwich. <laughs> like, <laughs> that's about as interesting as a turkey sandwich or some shit. I've seen more alert people in a retirement home. Oh, which way to the living without a brain seminar? Don't be late. I've heard better comebacks from a turkey sandwich. Get a life! My brother just thought that was funny and he made our clan tag turkey. And then I just, you know, I was part of that clan, quote unquote. So yeah, right, it's, right. it's turkey. Um, really a fucked up and weird backstory, but now you know. It's, uh, it's all, it all makes sense now. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm actually dead. Oh, God. All right, well, I'm going to grab that. And I have it in plain sight, so it won't be. Oh, dude, you, you are the best, dude. All right. I don't know why they're still humping me. It's because they hate me, dude. They don't want me to be back. Grenades. I just tried knifing. Grenades. Oh, oh nuke. wow. Hog. I just wasted all my grenades, but that's fine. I'll take it. <clears throat> I was red screened. I'm sorry. Remember Leafy is here. I do remember Leafy. I did a lot of impressions as him when I would stream, and people would be like, Jesus, you are him. Did you unironically watch him when he was popping off? Or? Uh, yeah, I did. I watched him just because, like, I thought it was entertaining, not to, like, bully kids or anything like that. I just watched it because I thought it was funny. Yeah, me too. Like, I was, God, 15 at the time, and I was watching it, and I'm like, damn, this is this is comedy. So cool. This is content. <laughs> and then and then I realized he's like kind of a dick. Oh, spider round pog. Now you can you can respin the I don't know if gobble. spider rounds are good or bad for us at this point. I mean, it's max ammo and like free gobble spins. Ooh. There's an insta kill back there. I know that there's a holy shit ton of them. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I just popped it in place. I got the insta kill. Let's go, baby. All right. Now they're all coming for me. Shit on a stick. Oh, there's a nuke. nuke. There's a nuke. Yes! Oh god. Alright, okay. dude. Got the XM, by the way. Oh well. That honestly is, like, not even bad. I would take that. And you just oh, blew yourself I just... up. Oh! <laughs> Yo, revive me, I have the XM. <laughs> I was waiting for that. <laughs> I'm gonna pop uh, in plain sight just to, like, safely get away. There we go. Uh, okay, max ammo. Oh, another max ammo? Yeah. You all good, dude. I do the same thing when I'm playing I'm zombies. I'm down. Shit on a stick. <laughs> no, I, I don't have an in plane sight. I this is this is not mine, fun. But... 
This is not a pog. Oh, a crawler just stopped me. It's over. Yep. Oh, oh, I couldn't use the... <laughs> God Dude, I called it! it. Round 16! <laughs> I haven't I haven't played Rod Krovey with JC Backfire, guys. Um <laughs> There's a lot What's of fire. Up? There's fire. There's dragons, I believe, that will be breathing. No, fire. Nothing jumps out at us, dude. Yeah. I got <laughs> oh, God, this is gonna be I don't know, this is an unpredictable one. I wish we could get the wrench. Oh yeah. It's because every time I do Garad, I always go for the wrench. I've also had to do a lot of map swapping with people for, like, console's sake. Because, you know, configuring everything, even after I thought I had it configured, <laughs> it took a lot. Yeah. Oh, there are challenges, too, on Garad Krovi. Oh, God. I yeah, Garad Krovi's the best, that. dude. This is your favorite map, yes. <laughs> this is my favorite... One of my favorite video game levels ever. In existence Ooh. just there's just so much to it there's so much to do uh-huh it's very simple it's like Darice and ascension but like the modernized version of it it's so good it's very true i know you're a sonic I fanatic i know I that <laughs> i know my jc I love sonic. backfire lower <laughs> dude it feels like it's it's kind of wild thinking that i i think a lot of people talk about this in the community but this map is the last ether map that mm -hmm. is just individually like creatively yeah. new by itself well chaos maps are innovative but well yeah even though ancient evil is amazing it I is it, ancient, ancient evil. evil is a very well designed map unfortunately um that was dlc 2 long after people had already left bo4 <laughs> i think the dlc season is just there's so much effort into like dlc 1 and stuff normally and yeah the season was very weird because dead of the night was just kind of of the night <laughs> it just kind of came like, out yeah here you go here's here's a new map we're not going to mention it <laughs> at all before yeah like, it releases. like ancient evil kind of felt like the Dorizon drac of like in terms of all, yeah. like all the stuff you could do in it if you know ancient I mean? evil was dlc one i think turnout Ooh, that would have been player sick. count yeah. would have been a lot better well, what do you think about gorod gorod is a great map it's in my mm -hmm. top 10 for sure five i if it was in my top five, it would be number five. I have I have my solid four. Like you know how there's like the Fantastic Five. Like I have like a I have like a Fantastic Four of zombies maps. All right, I got Dorizon Drac, Mob of the Dead, Shadows of Evil, and Call of the Dead. Those that's my Fantastic Four. Everything else after I'll have a discussion about. Like Doris is up there. Gotcha. Gorod is definitely up there. I think Doris Doris is definitely up there because it, it just kind of has to be. Right. Yeah. And then for me, it's. I think it's ah oh man, I don't know. I, I go back and forth a lot. I think Mob and Garot are just so good. So like yeah. th that's like my top three is like Doris, yeah. uh Garot and Mob. But Garot is my favorite, of course, out of all of them. Yeah, Garot just feels like a BO3 map, but it's it feels classic. Like it, it's not as yeah. complicated, it's not as like mind bending, but it, it is very it just feels like a classic be a one map making, in this engine i remember making like videos back before garage came out it, i think it was i think at, at that point i made like a video this is so far back in time like i i, I experimented with some weird video types i did like this uh -huh. analysis <laughs> video where i was talking about how like the mystery box like wonder weapons are not in the mystery box anymore and it's kind of like sad that we don't have like a classic map that does that anymore yeah because like you have Origins and or a lot of BO2 was just building them. Origins was also building them. And it was just like they always made the weapons a quest instead of just, you just get the them, weapon and then yeah. use the weapon in the quest. Like in Shang and Call of uh, the Dead, you get them out of the box and we hadn't seen that in right. a while. Yeah, and I, I love I love when maps have quests that the the wonder weapon isn't like an integral part of the whole quest. It's only like one step. That's it. Zetsubo. Like, <laughs> that one's brutal, yeah. dude. Zetsubo is. is brutal. It is. <sighs> it is very brutal. It's like doing but half I love, the Easter I love this. I, I just love how this map came out and I spun the box, got the Mark III, and was just like, oh my god, they finally did it. Oh. They actually did it. All right, JC, so I have a couple things to say to you. I got like some elephants to, to clear out of the room. I did this with Lex before I started even recording oh, with him. No. So I have two things to say to you. One, you were the first person I ever donated any money to online. I donated you <laughs> Are you serious? I donated you five dollars <laughs> on your Garage Krovi stream when you solved the Easter egg for the first time. I took my Dude. mom's credit card, I'm not gonna lie. I donated you five dollars. <laughs> I remember this so precisely. You were kill it you was a Valkyrie drone round. You were playing with DC 
and you killed the last Valkyrie yeah, drone. DC. My name popped up, and you were. I said. All right. Yo, come I up love here. your channel. You have inspired me to start my own. <gasps> Also, Thank you so much, Blue Foot. I'm sure I saw an electric chair machine. It's the office, but I don't know. You saw an electric chair machine? I don't think there was an electric chair machine. I haven't seen one yet. I think it might be in the. Maybe it's in. Could it be in the Wonder Fuzz then? Yeah, I bet. I'm glad I finally inspired you, man. That means a lot. I said, JC, you are an inspiration for me to start my YouTube channel. And you said, oh, thank you. I remember that so <laughs> clearly, dude. <laughs> I'm not joking Dude. at all. That's how well I remember that. So that's number Bro, one. I, I appreciate that so much. Like I, I it's like to me that I, I did not know yeah. that it went back that far. I was just some random like, kid watching your stream, and when you read it off, that was the first person, like the first YouTuber that ever acknowledged my existence. So I was like Dude. freaking. I was like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, just that like makes fan my heart happy, man. I, I'm, I'm glad to hear like you enjoyed the streams way back then. And uh, number two is yeah. I have been watching you and Lex specifically the uh, remember that time when and the things people say. Mm -hmm. I've been watching those since they've been around. So. <laughs> I have been watching you and Lex and Pat and, you know, all the bigger names forever. And that's, you know, you guys collectively Dude. made me start my channel. So I just wanted you to know that. And now that you know that, we don't have to be awkward and I don't have to fanboy. Oh. Dude, it, look, <laughs> it's literally like, to me, I don't even, I haven't even like thought about that. Like. Tim, you, you you do realize your videos are blowing up, dog. Like you have, dude, you, you've, you've yes. become one of the zombie YouTubers. I, I'm happened. in a very unique position, <laughs> transitioning <laughs> from looking, uh, being on the outside looking in, to now being on the inside. That's odd. It's just, it's very like I've seen both perspectives of it. I guess. Yeah. You, both sides it's, of the coin. <laughs> what what you're experiencing this year, I, I think it's been this past, maybe like a, longer than a year, right? Uh, I don't know. This year I, especially, I, I, but yeah. yeah. But like what you're what you're experiencing this year of just like getting so many videos that bang and everything, like and and just having a blast making that content on zombies, like mm -hmm. that was. It, it's it's really weird, like because I I feel like oh god, okay, we need to. Oh, thank God. Anyways, what were you saying about uh, things people say? Oh! Oh, shoot. We might not be good. In plain sight. Okay. I'm yeah, in. just use it. Just use it. Okay. I'm going <laughs> to try to get you. I have one more ready. So um, I'm going to run. Okay. I'm going to run. Run, oh, run. Oh, there's a nuke. There's a nuke. Oh. I died. I got the nuke. Okay. Okay. Did the oh mangler my... die? Does the, does the mangler die? The mangler doesn't die for I don't, that kind of stuff. I don't know. Did he? <laughs> he did. The mangler died. That's perfect. Oh, nice. All right. Oh, no. Basically, what I was saying is, is I, I just thought that was like such a cool idea. It worked, and then Lex was like, "Hey, pal, I want to steal your <laughs> series, but uh, do you want to also collab so I don't technically steal it? We're both working on it." And I'm like, "Uh, sure. Uh, why not? Because that's definitely gonna help out the channel." And oh, uh, is that how you two me. finally uh got together? Is that were you? He he wanted to steal my content. Yeah. Oh, did he tell you? <laughs> He's like, uh, dude, I'm gonna steal your content, but uh, no, I'm just playing. I mean, he, he kind of he kind of phrased it. He's like, all right, I really want to do your series, but you're already doing like, it, so let's just do yeah, it together. Yeah, you're already doing it. <laughs> yeah, he kind of did the same thing with uh, with Ben for myth busting as well. Oh yes. Also, JC, I have one more thing to say. The first yeah. time I ever actually saw you wasn't your streams. It was a video on Facebook of all things. It was a video what? of you. Um, when you were poking fun at Dryzen Jack with the with the overpowered bows, it was like you playing Dude. Shang with the baby gun. You were like going Whoa. through the chaotic like Shangri La rounds. Oh, and then it would dude. you'd like juxtapose the two with uh Derizon Drac, you'd just be sick. I there. think it was something like zombies then versus now. Yes, that, that was it. And your dad yeah. your dad walked in <laughs> like when you're playing Derizon Drac. <laughs> sitting there with a lightning bow you're just like 
<laughs> I think he walked in with like a baseball mitt or something, and you guys like just rolled straight up left. Dude, that that video was like me and my like before I had an audience really like phase of yeah. just being like mad sometimes at zombies when I was like. I hate the fact that every map has these like wonder weapons that are so powerful. I want it to be harder. I remember that video getting like completely stolen by somebody on Facebook. Yeah, on Facebook, I, it was like some like gaming like Facebook page, just straight up jacked. I think it had like a million views or something. <laughs> That's such a boner, dude. You just got totally ripped off. But anyways, uh, I feel like most YouTubers go through that stage where they they're sort of content creators, but they're not yeah. like. The, like you think you're a youtuber but you're not really sure if you are you're making content but it's like yep. unofficial it's like the beginning just, of it you, all you don't have a you don't have a consistency i've had my channel since 2009 but like it did it took me till really black ops 3 2015 to finally oh god oh we might be dead we're dead oh god i had an in plain sight i was like i'm gonna try to make <laughs> i had an in plain sight i was like i think i'm gonna make this so i'm not gonna waste my in plain sight and i didn't make it <laughs> And there was fire. Dude, the fire makes this so much... Like, if there was no fire, we'd be, like, yeah, round 15 bound. This is one of the harder ones. I didn't actually expect it to be this yeah, this hard. That hard either. But anyways, were you Rip. saying something before we just died? Legitimately, dude, there's gonna be... There's always gonna be, like, a rise of new, like, zombie content creators in the zombies community. As much as the zombies community has been going through some weird stuff lately, yep. there's always gonna be more people, like, that... That rise and fall it's like load. it's like the phoenix yeah. it's just some exactly. people fall some people rise you can catch the next wave man <laughs> yeah and some people maybe maybe a year from now they're not doing it anymore there is mm -hmm. always a possibility bo5 is fantastic it is different than bo4 it might just simplify things and be similar to bo3 and you never really know so i mean i'm ex i'm actually very excited for whatever this next treyarch game is um, hopefully they don't half-ass it because <laughs> they don't have much time. I'm very curious. I'm imagining they're going to play it very safe because they don't have a lot of time. It might just be like another BO3 or something with how zombies work. Well, or maybe they'll, I don't know. BO3 worked, so if they, yeah, maybe not copy and paste, but maybe if they do something similar and just like simplify things. I think we'll that's have what a, I would another do. good zombies yeah. game on our hands. But anyways, uh, yeah, I guess that's it. All right. <laughs> All right. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Revelation Times with yours truly, Mr. T. Let's hop into it. Woo! Bye, dude! This map made so much of a difference, I think, in everybody's life. Uh -huh. And it's interesting, you know what? Because I think people see this map as a disappointment. Yeah. I think it's grown on me to the point where I really like Revelations. Yeah, it's definitely more casual, but... I think at the time, I think it was just people being upset with the ending at the time. That's why people had a sour taste in their mouth. It's to me the culmination of what everybody loved about zombies. Like it's overpowered, it's ridiculous, it's wild, but in every sense of the word, it is absolutely fun. And that is why I chose Revelations. This was That's the true. last map before the doom. <laughs> Not to mention, hey, we have a ton of space. This is a massive starting room. So here's a question. Are we able... I'm wondering if we should turn on the turret or not. How is that supposed to unfold? Cause... So, in official ZWC rules, if I just whip my ass, <laughs> yeah, whip out the rule. Uh, turning on the turret is considered opening a door. Oh, okay. So, I guess it's steer not Steer clear. Allowed. Steer clear. No quicker vibe. But, I'm down for whatever. You know what? And, yeah, no quicker vibe either. You know what? Let's just let's just not even do it. I, I'm just saying, let's, uh, let's go balls to the walls oh. here. Let's... Dude, I... I'm so shocked at how far people have gone on this with classic gobble gums, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, ZWC, some of those boys were hitting 22, 23. All they got is a RK5, and I'm like, <laughs> what is this? Like, Dude, I accidentally swallowed. Nobody's using the sheep. I accidentally swallowed an eye candy, and I'm tripping. <laughs> I'm tripping hard oh, over here. No. I'm telling you, all chemical was a play if you ran it, because, like, all you do is you just sit and spray, because points don't mean anything. Yeah, that's true. You know, you know what? I'm not going to lie, Lex. I'm kind of a scrub, and I don't have that unlocked yet. <laughs> On PS4. Oh, On PS4. All right. <laughs> all right. I checked my game time, actually, earlier today of how much I played, uh -huh. and, oh, man. <laughs> I think I've spent a whole month just on PS4 Zombies. You know what, though? Like, like one days of game time. Like, that's a lot. It, it is. It is. But you know what? 
you had a lot of fun. You made some friends. I definitely had a lot of fun. Like, it was a journey. Yeah. Well, man, it was a long journey. <laughs> Holy moly. Oh, my God. Like, I'm, I'm just thinking about all the wild things that Revelations has brought me on. And, like, honestly, I think this is the best starting room of BO4. Or, sorry, of BO3. Not BO4. But, uh, <laughs> yeah. BO3. yeah, I can't. I mean, Garad, no, because there's just fire in half of it. Uh, yeah. Shadow's way too small. The Rising Drac, that's pretty good, but... Not enough training area. Um, yeah, no, I'd agree pretty with that. Small. I'd side with that. That's supposed pretty good too, because you can do a little bit with the plants, uh -huh. but um, yeah, it's spacious. Yeah, and it's quite nice. But other than that, I think Revelations takes the cake. Yeah. Um, the like, giant doesn't have a gobble gum machine. I, I gotta say, the worst is shadows. So when you had shop for shadows, oh that must have been pretty rough. <laughs> it was. It was. Uh, it was a nightmare. <laughs> we yeah, actually killed the Margua. I, I think we got like 15 or something oh, like that. Oh, wow. Yeah. I'll tell you one thing. The parents that are on this is going to be an absolute tragedy. Yeah, yeah. But if it's two of us with RK5s, I think we might be able to get through. Maybe it was different because you were a YouTuber at the time and I wasn't. But when Black Ops 3 first released and it was just Shadows and it was just the Giant, you could go to Shadows and play a complex game. Or inversely, you could go to the Giant and just play casually. That was just a beautiful thing. <laughs> like, those two maps... Oh, yeah. Oh, God, I miss those days. And I, I remember when Dryzendrak came out and that map... Oh my god, I just, when it released, it was like magic. I just, I don't think we're ever going to get that feeling Only replicated. It's... Jirajandrak, whoever takes Jirajandrak from you is got, has got to be special because that map literally changed all of zombies forever. Like, it was the map that cultivated the whole community in my opinion. Yeah. It's what made everybody talk to each other more. It's what, like, started so much collaboration. Like, <laughs> yeah, it was the first to remember I, that I, time one. This is the thing oh, I'm yeah. really excited for about Zetsubo no Shima. That spider sound is going to be similar to the Denizen, oh and it's going to be... <laughs> <laughs> and I saw you and JC. <laughs> first thing I think of when I hear Dryzodrak is how Matt or MC Sports Hawk literally went to the hospital because he was doing the Easter egg for too long. Are you like, serious? He was trying to solve it for like three days straight. I <laughs> like, I'm telling you, three whole days. Jesus Christ, what the f- Yeah, three. yeah so he went to the hospital. Oh my God. And I ran a zombie for eight hours. I dude, remember just looking you're, when we were figuring out the Easter egg. You're <laughs> joking, dude. Oh my God. Yep. What is this? Oh God! Oh, oh, oh! Insta-kill, why? Okay, I, I'm, I'm coming towards you. I'm coming towards you. All right, well. I'm popping the Insta, nice, nice. Okay, or I mean, uh, all, all chemical. You're safe. You're safe. <laughs> You're safe with that. I don't think I've also ever played an Easter egg as much as DE. Oh, you know what oh, I mean? Like, God, yeah. I would not be surprised if, like, Codename Pizza, Ben, and I have done that Easter egg the most times on planet Earth. Like, I've done that oh Easter God, egg yeah. too many times, bro. <laughs> okay, I got in plain sight. Dude, the Panzer I'm comes on around 12, right? That's, that's when he, uh... Honestly? Panzer. I have no clue. Oh, so, uh, Dude, he's gonna spawn in. Gonna say, yeah, right. I don't have like a chat link cord or whatever it is that you need to hear game audio and plug this into my PC to hear you. So basically, I have no audio, and I'm gonna see that Panzer spawn in. I'm gonna shit a full brick. <laughs> okay, well I'll, I'll give you a heads up if I see. Yeah, just first, just give me but, a cue, uh, just like uh, like <laughs> nod at me or something, you know. I know a Margwa can also spawn in the in the spawning uh, the starting room, but I don't know when. Oh yeah, Marguas. Um, elemental Marguas, that is. I can't wait for yep, that. Yep, and Elemental Marguas. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a toss-up. No, grenades. no laser, by the way. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna run on the other side, maybe give you some space. Oh, throw your grenades. I got a max ammo over here. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, I'm out of, I'm out of grenades. I'm out of grenades. You can, you can go pick it up. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, I do have in plain sight, just in case anything goes wrong. Okay. I have uh, always done swiftly. Oh my god, no, if we ran, no, if no, we no, ran no, actual gobble gum, we got this box, we got quick revive we got Dude. everything yeah that's one of the wildest parts ultra rares and like mega gobble gum in general on this is just so much fun yeah i'm gonna throw a grenade hopefully i can uh help my brother out over there i know you you look like you're kind of struggling <laughs> oh no oh, shit. okay right, i got in plain sight i, I can go over there yeah, yeah, yeah. okay nice. i'm nice, not used nice. to this i got it too all right yeah don't worry, worry about it ps4 dpi or the fov <laughs> That boy, that boy too low. Nuke! Oh, nice! Okay, I threw my nade. Okay. 
dear We're chill. god. <laughs> the best part about this is that we can like kind of train together. Like I, if I take the quick revive half. Yeah. And you yeah, take that's the, what's best about this. This half. It, it we can go pretty far with this. Yeah. Like I'm not insane at the hoarding, but uh, I can I can do a little bit of my. Dude, share, you, you know? could fit like three comfortable trains in the spawn room. Four, yeah. four is a stretch, but like three, like one person could just be on this platform where I am. One person where you are, and then one person in the middle, and you have like a genuine yeah. ooh. Ooh, or you could just get three hit instantaneously and get stuck on the car. Oh, all right, all right, all right. Oh my god, I might blow myself with oh. my grenades. Oh, there's another nuke. There's another nuke. Okay, okay. Okay, you're you're killing it. Okay. I'm gonna go. Ah! There's a. Why are there so many? Oh god! I got you! I got you! I got you! I got you! Oh you. <laughs> Stock option! <laughs> Get something, man. It's about to get hectic in here. Dude, stock option's actually not even that bad. I have like the. No. I have like the basic bitch gobble gums. If you ran anywhere but here, I'm pretty sure it's useless on this uh, starter room, but uh. Ooh. See. Oh! Gotta get that melee weapon, baby. Right. Oh my goodness, I'm good. I popped in plain sight just in time. Oh, no, they're all coming my way. Shit! Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're chilling, you're chilling. <laughs> yeah, RP5 is really not doing enough right now. Until if I... No, but on the bright side, I got a camo for. Ooh, it is to kill! Nice, 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 nice. Okay. Yes. I'm moving out the Shiva for this one. You know what I'm thinking about right now, man? What's up? There's this new trailer that just came out and uh -huh. for the Joker movie. Uh... And I've never been. It's more excited for a movie. Have you heard of it or seen the trailer? No, that's... Oh, we got a marble. A mar shit, shit, where? Where? Yeah, yeah, ah! You're ready, you're ready. All right. Okay. <laughs> one. Oh my gosh, I'm ready. I don't have I'm an in plain sight. Oh, this is. Okay, okay. I've got one left. I will take him out. But if you just stay here. Okay. Okay, I I'm going to run around my area. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. oh my goodness. <laughs> Oh my! I'm running in plain sight. <laughs> okay, okay. He's oh, coming he... to you now. He's coming to you now. Oh. I'm trying to. Okay, I got two of his heads. <laughs> just one more. Just one more. Oh god. Oh god. I'm so scared. Oh god. I'm yeah, so scared. I'm so scared. Right, I'm, I'm so scared. I'm trying to help you. Out. I'm trying to help you. Out. Oh my. Okay. Goodness. Okay. 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 Grenades. Grenades. You got this. You got grenades. This. Yeah. I'm throwing grenades over there. I'm throwing. I'm throwing. I'm throwing. I got you on the cover. Okay. Okay. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. Oh, I'm screwed. He's still alive. I'm screwed. Oh I'm screwed. I'm screwed. I'm screwed. Oh, no, 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 no. It's the kill. It's the kill. Ah! Shit. Yeah, yeah, you're good. You're good. Okay, 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 okay. I got this. I'm going to clutch. I'm going to come and clutch. I hope. <laughs> I really hope. Ah! Don't let the flame die out. Oh, my gosh. This insta kill is fully saved. You realize why you are. Okay. Oh, he's still alive. I'm just going for the last one. It's all mine. I, I haven't focused on him yet. Yeah, don't even worry, dude. Me. Oh, it goes me, so me bleeding out means nothing. Hey! Okay, let me see if I can get the. Oh, no. Just too late. Okay, I'm going to wait on this insta kill just to the last second. So, we actually got lucky by not getting a Panzer, in my opinion. Yep. Yeah, the Margo is definitely how It's easier. Um, in plain sight. Who, who Perfect. Known? Nice. Okay. I'm here to go. I'm too old. No. Watch your back. Oh, yeah, you got me. You got me. You got me on the six. You got me on the six. <laughs> oh, god. Damn. So, this is our first max ammo round, right? Um. Oh, god, it's a furry. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's the furries. Oh, no. Shit, 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 shit. Away. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh, 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 oh. I'm dead. In plain sight. In plain sight. Oh, god. Okay, you got it. You got it. You got it. The parasites might still hit you. I know that could be a glitch sometimes. Oh, my god, there's so many. <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. I'm going back. Yeah, yeah, just, just run away. Just, oh my goodness. Okay, okay that was my last in plain sight. I tossed I'm, all my nades. I'm just gonna run away. <laughs> I'm gonna. My last grenade. There's, there's so many. Oh my gosh, there's so many. Lex, I'm scared. They take. I'm scared. Oh, I'm scared! So oh my damn! I'm running! <laughs> oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. They're so fast <laughs> and so wide. They're like, uh. They're Holy shit. I'm gonna really try my hardest here. Don't, I'm don't. I'm gonna really don't, try my hardest don't. here. No, I'm not going for yeah. you. I'm getting out I was gonna say. Out of ammo. Oh, and they are leaping. They are leaping. <laughs> my head is in my monitor right now. I am full focused. <laughs> They're leaping. <laughs> no, shit. it was the parasite. Oh my gosh, bro. All right. The last thing. Dude. Oh my We didn't even goodness. get to see Papa P.
<laughs> He's dude, no Papa Panzer. Uh, we got Mama Mark with us. God damn. That counts. God <laughs> damn. Well, that was the Revelations starting room challenge. That was pretty good. 15 rounds? I'm pretty happy with classics, that. I think that's classics. Classics. I think all things considered, we did pretty good. Lex, do you have any closing words? Because you seem to be a, a popular request on this channel, and uh, I'm sure people would want to hear one final thing from you before I swap over to Voyage of Despair. Find your way in life and don't play Voyage of Despair. <laughs> <laughs> Kunjor is the next guy up. He's not going to be happy with that. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Voyage of Despair. We're kicking it up with uh, Black Ops 4 now. There are some rules. Uh, we are doing classic elixirs only, no megas. We're not doing any talismans. And we are allowing ourselves to use whatever weapons we want with whatever attachments. I'm excited, man. I mean, mm -hmm. widely regarded as the uh, probably the worst map of all time. But, <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> but other than that... Uh, the starting room is actually great. The starting room is actually my favorite part about this map because it's like it, you got a lot of space. Um, it, it just it works. The, the spacing is good enough, so I actually think we can do pretty well on this. All right, I'm running my RK7. What 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 gun did you pick? I picked the Mog 12 because I've got Ooh, the yeah. nice little uh, incendiary <laughs> rounds attached to it. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I'm not leveled up enough on PS4. I <laughs> I gotta stick with my uh, RK7, but. Anyways, yeah, I think that one person should definitely stay on the top deck, and one person should uh, chill on the bottom. There is quite a bit I'm of space. I'm good to, uh, yeah, there's a nice amount of space. I'm good to stay on the top. I'm good with that. And I just realized... I think in the early rounds... Go on, sorry. ...that this, uh, the perk is here, um, and we don't have to turn on yes. the Sentinel Artifact to get it. I didn't even realize that. I forgot. No, we do not. I'll be lying if I didn't say that I, uh, I practiced a little bit before today. Oh, that's fair. I jumped onto, uh, yeah, I was on one game of, um... Gave myself one game of Voyage and got to round 20. But I, I feel like with Black Ops 4, mm -hmm. generally speaking, it gives you, in my opinion, a little too many chances at survival. You know, you have things like yeah. Dying Wish, and then you have all the Elixirs, and then you have your Wraith Fires, which are ridiculously overpowered, yeah. and then you have your special weapon. Yeah. It kind of yeah, holds you your have hand. a lot at your disposal in this game. Another question I've actually got for you, Tim, because uh -huh. I've, I've been watching your channel for a while, but I actually don't know when you got into zombies. Like, when did you Ooh, start uh, jumping into it? BO1, Kinder Toe, and that was my first map. I was 11 or 10 years old at the time, and yeah. I was scared shitless like everybody the first time playing, <laughs> and then I got used to it, and I just started... I just created a channel about it, I guess. And I apologize, yeah. audience, for sounding kind of slower than usual. I, I literally just got up and just walked to my PC and started doing <laughs> this because I got a lot more to uh, do today, so. Dedication, that's. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. But uh, when did you start getting into zombies? I'll flip the question. So, um, it, it was actually right at the very beginning. Um, my older brother got a PS3 that mm -hmm. came with World at War in it. Uh -huh. um, we heard about COD 4, but we never played it. And I watched my, I literally sat on my brother's bed watching him complete the campaign. And when I say it was like the beginning, I mean before the Rooks was even. And uh, oh. I watched him finish the campaign. And uh, it then obviously did the Easter egg to Nazi Zombies, which at the time wasn't in the menu. Like he had to finish the campaign to unlock it. Yeah. We both kind of witnessed that together. And from that point on, I begged him to let me play it. And he wouldn't. Yeah. But whenever <laughs> he was at school and I wasn't, I would sneak onto his PlayStation, <laughs> bang it out, and I was having a time of my life. Yeah. So that was... That's, yeah. the, that's the interesting thing about this community. People join in at different times. Like, some people have been here since literal day one with Noct. Some people joined in yeah. like, with BO1, then BO2, even BO3, even BO4, I guess. Yeah. It's just everywhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is like this weird niche like of, of a community where people only play customs, too, and don't even play regular zombies. It's really weird. I mean, there aren't a ton of people like that, yeah. but, you know... They're out there. <laughs> I tried to cover standard official Treyarch maps, uh -huh. and I really wanted to create my channel um, when Black Ops 3 was in its prime, but I just wasn't ready, I feel like. Um, yeah. I wanted to learn how to video edit first. That, yeah, I feel and, you. That's exactly yeah, how it was for me. Exactly. And, um, I mean, Black Ops 4, in just in my opinion, hasn't piqued my interest, so I found myself leaning just <laughs> yeah. automatic customs. Yeah, in my opinion, because <laughs> there are BO4 yeah. fans out there that are going <laughs> to tear you in an yep. asshole for giving your opinion. Don't bash me in the comments, lads. I'm sorry. That's the thing. I feel like Black Ops 3 just... It just felt better to play. Yeah. And when I'm playing custom maps, I feel like some of the... Uh, some of the examples of the really well-made ones kind of will almost display an enjoyable opportunity yeah. to play zombies than, uh, than Black Ops 4 does. I mean, to be fair, uh, Black Ops 3 is, like, impossible to top. <laughs> it's just, like, no. that yeah, beautiful of a game. So, like, 
I think the standards were set a little too high to, in the beginning, but still, I don't think that. I think this game was underwhelming. But you never know. BO5 or whatever they're gonna call it, that could be good. You never really know. Because yeah. all the time they but, didn't invest in this game could have been invested in something like that. Potentially. I mean, there was rumors of uh, Zombie Chronicles 2, which, you know, would make sense from both a business perspective and story-wise. Yeah, for sure. But I feel like that could be Black Ops 5 content, similar to what they did with Black Ops 4, where they add, like, a remaster every other map. Like, they, they had yeah. a formula, and they tried to fix what wasn't broken with BO3, and I, this is what this game is. That's the result of that. I could not agree more with that statement. I feel like a lot of the things that drew me to zombies in the first place was the replayability factor and just the sheer gameplay of it. Uh -huh. And then with Black Ops 4, they thought, how can we take it and exaggerate everything? It, and at this point, it's just blown out of proportion. Everything is just oversaturated. So you started your channel, was it three years ago now? And you've uh, just sought since? Just about, I think just after Revelations. Yeah. Yeah, but you originally you originally referred to yourself as Bluefoot, right? And then that yep. changed to <laughs> yeah, just Tim Hansen. Yeah, yeah. There's like a like an origin story behind that. That was my club penguin name, and then it became my <laughs> gamer tag, and it became my everything because you know you I tried to be consistent with Bluefoot, and then it was yeah. actually Bluefoot ninety nine. Then it was just Bluefoot, and I'm like, you know what this. This is not going to work anymore, dude. I'm not eight. Like, I need to change this. <laughs> so I just made it my name I, because, you know, if I ever want to change my content, people will just know my name, if that makes sense. Yeah. If you were to, I mean, seeing as you're the kind of person who has the ability to play both customs and Black Ops 4, yeah. what do you find yourself drawn to? Like, when you're not on camera, not recording a video, like, how do you associate yourself to zombies? Are you on Black Ops um, 4? Do you have customs? If I'm not recording, Second. I'm usually just playing... Uh, BO3, but not custom BO3, mm. just regular BO3. Okay. On PC? On uh, Xbox. Just because on Xbox I'm I have to... way more friends on there, so it's just yeah. we all play together. I watched your tier list video, because I was curious, mm -hmm. um, on on your favorite maps. Yeah. But, um, I mean, my favorite map of all time is actually for <laughs> Oh, so, um, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, a little, it's a little different to what uh, people normally say. But, I mean, if you had to pick one Zombies map, and only one Zombies map, to play for X amount of time, what would be your go-to map? Like, what's the one you get the most out of? Uh, well, my favorite's Mob of the Dead, but a very, very, very close second is Derizon Track. So, yeah. um, I'm not... You know what? I would just say Derizon Track only because Mob... On Derizon Track, you have more replayability with more bows, and you just have... Yeah more to work with even though i think mob is my favorite so i would i would say derizon drag what about you Bar mm. would it be Baruch? um i mean Baruch is my favorite map but i feel like that's partly due to nostalgia yeah that's um fair. yeah if i if i was to purely rate a map exclusively on the gameplay elements of that map i'd probably join you with saying derizon drag i think yeah. Just the way it was crafted, the aesthetic of it, the bows, mm -hmm. and the, the the fact that the quest didn't feel tedious. Like I feel like Zombies was on a train of of making quests ridiculously tedious to do like the simple things. Uh -huh. Like um, I feel like opening pap in Zetsubo was just over. Like if if I want to pat my weapon, I don't want to have to spend like ages draining water. You know what I mean? Yeah. And uh, we got Requiem Spike. I don't know what these things Ooh. are called. Giant. No fire. idea. Giant lava prick. That's what. I'm yeah, lava fellas. Oh god, they I'm gonna down. Jump on the oh, never mind. I feel like the best thing about Black Ops Four is literally just the max ammo replenishing your clip as well. I feel like that's the best thing from it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's it. That's actually it's. Yeah, I like that. But another thing I wanted to ask you actually. Mm. I noticed your tier list was Treyarch maps, right? Yeah. But if you had to pick a favorite map that wasn't from Treyarch, what would that be? Oh god. Um, it would be, honestly, <laughs> it would be Groston House for World War II Zombies, because I just like the simplicity of it. It's like Noct. I have a lot of memories yeah. on that map for some reason. That's like the one World of War II map uh, that I play with my friends. It's, it's, getting, it's getting to the point where it's not a joke anymore. Like yeah, <laughs> no, no joking around anymore. We also have the Essex at our disposal, but like with every BO4 map, I'm going to stay as far away from that as I can. <laughs> yeah. Oh it's god, dude, ass. I, like, they're spawning from, they're dropping from the top there and just murking me. I'm coming, This I'm is coming. just, I, this is brutal. Oh, sugar Hammer. and fucking... Hammer time. Oh, goodness. Oh, you picked a hammer after all. Die, you piece of ass! He's dead. That round was an experience. Yeah. That was not... Uh, 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 die. Bring down this fella. There we oh. go. 
Wow. There we go. Oh boy, is that a, is that a, yeah, that's what I think it is. Is that a blight father? Yeah. yeah. Oh God. Let's have a bit of a dance. Oh yeah, by the way, I have no audio, so I can't hear anything. I'm actually doing the shit. Ooh, uh, every time I hear vibrations, I know that this asshole spawns right in the, the exact same spot every time. Okay. Oh jeez. Chuck a wraith over. Oh, there's a second guy. There's two. All right, all right, all right. I'm gonna use my Mr. Hand. Tim, there's two. All right, one of them's dead. <laughs> one of them's dead. Good job. I would come down and help you, and I'm planning on doing that, but I'm also thinking about training because <laughs> merging trains is uh, never no boy, something no. that goes very well. There's so yeah. many. I'm stuck. I'm gonna die. I got stuck on the fucking rail. Oh my god. I got you. I got you. No, no. This... I'm lying. I'm lying to you. This is why can't I revive you? This is the staircase is glitchy. You want to swap for one round and see how it goes? Just to, just yeah, to sure. see, because what I'm doing isn't yeah, sustainable. Yeah, to be fair, all of the special zombies are coming to you. I haven't noticed that. <laughs> Pretty much up there, all I've had to deal with the normal zombies. 12 seconds later. Oh, no, I'm caught. I'm caught. There we go. Inevitable. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, I, there we go. I got mine out. I'm going to kill the requeases. There are requeases, not requees. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah. Die, 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 die. What is happening? I can't see anything. I'm being shocked by zombies. All right. You can, uh, do the triangle trick, I guess, and revive and hit at the same time. Oh, 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 my specialist ran out. I see what you mean, though. It's definitely harder down there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, just a little bit. I mean, just a little bit. Yeah, yeah. That'll be good. Oh, perfect. That should finish it. It really should. It... You've, yeah, you've got it in the bag, bro. Yes. Oh, he's stubborn. Okay. Here we go. My dude. As soon as the lab comes, I'll, uh, run down with my special, provided I actually don't die up. Ah, oh god, specialist out! I had no choice. Uh, well, Ooh, I looks like you got the full All power right, anyway. Yeah, you come down here, use it, and just grab the full power. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go. With the might of Zeus! A scatter! We didn't get a single. 19! We didn't get a single request that round. Not complaining. Oh, Black Father! He spawned up here! That's alright, I'll deal with him. I destroyed the Black Father and brought a nuke for him, so that's nice. Ooh, Strike Hammer. That might help. It would be good to have bullets for my weapon. That might. Contribute to success. Tell me you've got your special okay, dude, please. I, I do. Um, I also have 50 health, so I'm gonna step away from him for just a sec. And yep. Then I'll attack him. Okay. Oh boy. Die, Mr. Blightfather, please. He's a he's a strong. There's a request. Okay, the Blightfather's dead. Nuke. Perfect. Oh yes. Die, oh, asshole. Yes. Oh my god, so that was PSP. amazing. That was awesome. Round 20. I've uh, I've come down because um, things bad things are happening. <laughs> Okay, so oh, um, so Dying Wish decided um to not work. Yeah, that yeah. happens. Sometimes. Yeah, that's like the yeah. genuine glitch. Don't even try and revive me with Dying Wish enabled because you you have one HP, bro. You have one. Oh my God, what a no! You were so close. Uh, so that's it. If you have any closing statements, uh, go ahead. <laughs> Oh, dude, just thank you so much for having me, man. It's been a pleasure, and uh, I wish you all the best with the rest of the uh, the rest of the people you're doing this with. Good luck. We are going to be doing the nine starting them challenge with Lunatic. No law. And um, this is going to be, I would say, one of the easier ones. We have a lot of space. We have challenges we can complete. We are going to be seeing some Blight Fathers. We're going to be seeing some Requeses, which are the Gladiators. Oh, how was like what? You mean Recluse? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, this isn't Zetsubo, man. Nice belly button. Thank you. Oh, wait, no, I'm the old man. So, uh, Lunatic's running the MOG, I'm running the RK7, and, um, I suppose. Didn't it's not the right class. This is my favorite map in Black Ops 4. What's yours? Do you have one? Um, either Dead of the Night. That's, that's a good no, map. Yeah, probably Dead of the Night. Yeah, it's. It, I'd say it's alright. They just didn't market it at all. It's gonna be one of those maps that people just forget about because of how unpopular it is, but it's not bad. I don't hate it. Just the Nosferatu's piss me off. Get five consecutive headshots, okay. Oh, you're doing all the challenges? Oh, I didn't even I'm gonna try. I think at a certain point, it's not going to uh, work anymore because I think one of the challenges involves a shield and we're not gonna be able to grab that, so. I am very, very hot. Oh, you're not in a good way. I get a bonus point as a reward. That's not helpful. Um, buying the Essence was a mistake. I'm gonna grab the strike. Much better. Yeah, no, that gun is trash. Slide under a blade trap without taking damage. Looks like I'm not gonna be able to complete that. Oh, by the way, uh, round predictions. Do you have any? Uh, 10. 10. Uh, I'm thinking... I'm thinking 20. I think we're gonna do good. Because we have a ton of space. Like, a lot of these starting rooms do not have the, um, 
the privilege of having this much space. We happen to have one of the best maps for... Ooh, shit. Yeah, until I get cornered trying to knife. <laughs> I am. I'm I have the, the belly man. button. You have the belly button, and I have the wrinkly scrotum. Oh, tigers. Well, they made their, uh, their quiet uh, debut. Ah. Oh my god, he's so fast! She, she's so fast. Usain Bolt. I did not mean to... Wife. ...to fucking misgender this zombie. I mean, who can tell nowadays? <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Anybody can be anything. When does this new map come out? Um, my guess is very late September. They're going to be teasing it soon. At least one small teaser. So what do you, uh placing your bets on how good the map is. Okay, if it is a Call of the Dead reimagine, if it's anything like Blood of the Dead or Classified, it is going to be good, not great, and somewhat disappointing. If they so go in a completely right. other direction, then I don't know. But if it's Call of the Dead remastered, yeah, I, it's going to be like like decent, kind of like Alpha Omega. I mean, they, they started off really rough with Blood, and then, I mean, Classified is just reimagined five so it's just yeah. kind of the same i like five I, I like classified yeah i don't have an issue with that one to be honest <clears throat> um blood of the dead was just Ayo. disappointing though i don't have a problem with newtown to be fair did we no, not max get a max ammo, ammo? that's oh it, you ran right by it. i didn't kill a tiger in here so i think that nuke may have killed it possibly my challenge is done money oh no we got a big boy a big boy yeah, the BB swinging my hammer around. I felt insecure, man. My lady did. I always found these little drummer boys over here so funny. Oh, I'm getting hit by something. That would be a request. Back up. Keep your space. Oh my god. I will shoot you right in the trachea. Ah, you... Why are catalyst zombies even a thing? I've never been able to wrap my <laughs> mind around that. So they, they could use them for steps and easter eggs. <laughs> yeah, because that's necessary. I don't know, throwy boy? Throwy boy. Mm -hmm. There's a raw. Oh, he's on me. I knocked his helmet off, though. Okay, nuke. Here we go. We'll take that. And he's dead as well. I felt something crawling on my head. I'm over this. <laughs> oh, no. Um, I feel a presence. Am I gonna... Okay, I fucking died. I'm gonna self-revive. Oh, there he is. There is the man of the year, Mr. Blight. All right, Blight Daddy. You can go away. That's going to take so long. Oh, what the fuck just killed me? He spit at me. Ew. All right, well, um, I'm going to clean a puke off of that. And then I'll make my way over to you. I'll use my, uh, try to finish him off. Die, you piece of ass. Die, 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 die. Die, die, die. He, what the fuck, he one-shot me. Yeah, he has a melee that one-shots. Oh, God. Well, there's that. Five rounds before. Round 15. You know what, we should have done better, but that's all right. I'll take round 15. Do you have any final words before we wrap this up, Luna? I should have been on mouse and keyboard. It's Blood of the Dead time. I got Claystar here, and um, it's Black Ops 4, so we have some things, uh, some advantages that other games don't have. You know, with the uh, with the equipment and the specialists, but it's still pretty difficult. Starting room challenges are never easy. Yeah. What's the strat? The strat. One of us on the top layer, one of us on the bottom. You can choose. I'll let you choose since you're the guest. Uh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't. I don't know if one's easier than the other. Yeah, I. I don't want to like mess up and accidentally open the door. I'm trying to reload. I guess I'll take the bottom. Okay, fair enough. If, if, we, can if, if just... we can switch if we want to. Yeah. For the first few rounds, we just sort of freestyle it, see what works, see what doesn't, and then right. we will go from there. So we have an RK7 up here, and we have an Essex, which I will not touch. What do you have for your... You have the SOG as well? I have the RK7, so in hindsight, it would have been better to grab the Strife, but whatever. Mm -hmm. I guess I'm going to have to grab the Essex. God damn it! I also forgot that Black Ops 4, you have a... It's almost like you have Jug at all times. Sort of. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, Brutus. I don't know if he's going to spawn in if we're not turning he on probably power. probably will. Yeah, I would predict he would. All I have to worry about is it just these two barriers? Yeah, that's it. This is our first time playing together, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. And uh, I guess talking together in the same chat. I mean, I, I, we've stopped yeah. by each other's streams, but like actually talking to yeah. each other. Yeah. 
Yeah, this is exciting. First time. You're yeah. gonna be editing all of them down. Yeah. Right? Yeah. <laughs> it's so hard. brutal. Yeah, that's. Like, that's editing is just bitch. so hard sometimes. I'll pull through though. Hopefully. If you're watching yeah. this video, I did it. You ever been to uh, San Francisco or the Alcatraz Dude. in real life? No, I wanted to, and I decided to go to San Diego instead. But I oh, am, oh, yeah, it's on my bucket list, dude. I want to go to uh, Alcatraz yeah. so bad. It's funny, I, I live like an hour away from there, like to my house. I've never been there. Really? It's so tolerable. Yeah, I, I, think, oh, I, I think round six universally on every map is where shit starts hitting the fan. <laughs> I, I, I noticed on every round six, that's when shit gets crazy. All right, we're good. I'll grab the max. I just heard, I just heard, oh, is that Brutus? Oh my goodness! Okay, 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 okay. I'll come help you. I'll come help you. Oh, pop shots, pop shots, pop, pop shots. Your, do you have a specialist or no? Oh, he's dead. No, he's pop shots. Oh, he's dead as fuck. Wow. Okay, pop shots. <laughs> oh no, no, he's not. No, he's not. He's not dead. No, he's not. Okay, I'm gonna use my. Uh, I'm gonna use my Ragnarok. Die, motherfucker! <laughs> I don't know what's going on. That's weird. Rock up three. Juice would die. I'm like, I'm like lagging into the ceiling. What is going on? He's not even dying. Oh, he's dead now. Okay. I think he's dead. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna have to start training. Now I think I think I can maybe hold down the fort just uh, training, hopefully. Yeah, it's better to train down there, but... Yeah, so if one of us died, do you think it would be best just... Unless we can, just let each other die, because... Yeah, we don't risk our yeah, lives. yeah, yeah. If we die, we, uh... The, the person who doesn't die should probably watch out for themselves first. So one challenge I, I've done on my channel, which I think you might be interested in, is, uh... What you do is you start on round, or for the first five rounds, you can go outside the map, get whatever you want, and then after round five, you stay in the starting room the rest of the game. Oh, that's interesting. You know what map that would be disgustingly easy on is Ascension. Think about it. Yes, yes. Yeah, you can just go turn on the power, grab Jug, maybe get a Thunder Gun, and then you have that infinite, like, metal thing in the middle that just kills yeah. everything. You'd be set. Okay. Okay. Whoa! God damn! Okay. I got, I got Ragnaroks. Okay, um, I was gonna pull out mine. I got instant downed. Oh my gosh, I almost died. Wow, you got, got me at down. the last second. Oh, wow. Pain down here isn't too bad. Mine's a little bit crazy. Yeah, I mean, we could we could probably switch off. Just. <laughs> I mean, it's you know, it's just it's like an odd pattern. Do you play any other games other than zombies? Um, I play a lot of indie games like Minecraft. Okay, like uh, I don't play Minecraft daily, but um, I do that. Yeah. GTA occasionally. What else? Plants vs. Zombies is like an odd one I play. Oh. <laughs> Some people... Like the original yeah, one? Yeah, Dude, I, I loved... I used to play the game so much. Yeah. The second one's trash in my opinion, but the first one is... It's because the second one's... Um, it's like riddled with microtransactions. It's kind of like disturbing. Oh, okay, Brutus! Brutus! Brutus, okay, okay! Should I just train him around? Alright, I'm gonna throw my Wraith here. Um, okay. I'm gonna... Oh! Okay, my plan isn't sustainable. Okay, I'm gonna oh, yeah. temporal. Okay, temporal. I don't insta kill. Insta kill. Oh god. All right. Okay, good, good, good. good. I, I got Maybe. none up here, so. Okay. Let's just save his last song. Oh god! <laughs> oh, okay. I accidentally killed that one. Okay. Okay. Die, Ragnaroks. Should I use my Ragnaroks. No, I will. We got. We got. Okay. Do you want to? Do you want to keep him up there, or do you want me to? I got help? him. I think I'll be able to finish him. Oh, maybe not. Okay. okay uh, Next round. I need a little though. help. I need a little. <laughs> Okay. I gotta yeah, I'll, I'll come. I'm, I'm coming. I'm coming. I ran out of uh, ammo. Why didn't I just? Is he dead? Is he dead? Is he dead? Mm, no, not quite. Okay. Now he is. Now he's dead. He is dead as fuck. Right, and we got a dude. Back. Oh, nice. What are your thoughts on Blood of the Dead? Do you have any like? Do you have any? Do you not care for it at all? Or? I I don't really care for Black Ops Four to be honest. Right, but like, do, were you a fan of Mob? I mean. I'll be honest, I think Mob of the Dead is a little bit overrated. Yeah, that's fair. I do like it. I do like that's it. Fair. Okay, so I'm just as a- as a- No, I'm dead! I'm dead! I'm dead! I'm dead. I should be- it, Oh, I could be anywhere but here. I forgot. Alright, that's fine. Ragnarok time, baby! Wait, can I revive you while doing this? I, I think I can. Yeah, I can. Okay. Oh, oh okay. That worked. Okay, we're good. Some, we're good. Somehow. Okay. Anyways, yeah. As a fan of Mob, though, I just found this map disappointing in contrast. That's all. It's not, like, terrible. I just- 
not the biggest fan of Blood. The thing is, if I think I think if all these maps were on Black Ops 3 instead of Black Ops 4 yep. just with that engine, yep. they would have been great. Yes, that's yep, that's exactly how most of the community feels. What would you say your, your favorite Black Ops 4 map is? Because I know you played all of them, yeah, I'm guessing. Yeah, yeah. Nine is probably my favorite. Just because it's okay. it's simple and beautifully designed. Ancient Evil is beautifully designed, but it's a little more of a hassle. But I still think those are yeah. the two that really stand out in this game. The rest of them are obviously just sort of remasters and half-assed yeah. experiences. Yeah, this is uh, this is a little easier. If you're down there, don't use anything that's going to kill a lot of zombies, because then it's going to get hectic up here. Oh, uh, well. <laughs> yeah, I killed, yeah, I killed a lot of them at once. Okay, well, I have a lot of them up here. Yeah, I, okay. Watch out, watch out, watch out! Shit. Okay. Oh, I, I'm... Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh. I was at 100! Alright, alright. Ragnarok time, baby. Don't, don't worry about me. Don't worry about me. Let's get the end I think it's pretty close. Well, I always say that, but... Yeah. It can be deceiving. Let's see. Yep. Okay, there's a zombie. Okay. Die. Perfect. Oh, yeah. It's, there we go. Okay. You're a fan of Shinonuma, right? I didn't be here. Yes. Oh, hello. I had to use it. I had to use it. <laughs> okay, watch out. Just oh, move. shit. Ah! Oh! oh God! Okay, if you die, I'm I'm gonna die. No, I'm good for now. I got nothing. I got. I'm using my Essex. Trying to go for headshots, but it's just still not doing much. Yeah. Dude, we're doing very well for Blood of the Dead. Yeah. Oh God. Die! Ah! Oh, what? I pulled out my Ragnarok, and I still died. Oh what? Oh, I might die. I'm I'm gonna die. No. Oh goodness. Sixteen rounds. All right. Well, not a world record, but. I'll take that. Thank you so much for inviting me. No problem. It's gonna hopefully be a great video. I would. I hope. I really. I really hope. After all of these yeah. goddamn starting rooms, something good happens with it. You're doing how many maps? Thirty. There's twenty nine total. Wait, is Dead Ops on there? No. Why not? Because that's. There's no. How do you do a starting room challenge on Dead Ops? You just don't leave. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Classified is a fairly, I don't want to say large starting room, but it's more spacious than a lot of them out there. I guess, I uh, progress. may as well grab the Strife. I don't know what else we have to work with. I guess an Essex. I would rather die than pick that up. So yeah, I'm gonna roll with a Strife. No balls, we won't. And I got the RK. Well, I got the RK7, so there's no way I'm trading that out. So you're running Ragnaroks, and are you running Wraiths as well? Oh, of course. Well, with the power of George Washington, we'll be able to get to round 20. Damn right, no, 21. I don't know, some people have like these crazy tactics and like ideas for, like there are some crazy people out there that do nothing oh, yeah. but play this game and they have like these strategies. The high rounders, props to them, but I don't know how they do it. I, I don't have that in me. I don't have like the, the longevity in a zombies game. Like I have the skill, but like once I get past round 30, I'm just bored. And I just want yeah, no. nothing. Like, like let me tell you something. You, you, you know that you said on this map, right? Yeah. A straight up high round. As soon as I found that out, I was like, yeah, no, I'm never doing this Easter egg. I mean, granted, you could just like put the difficulty on uh, easy or something or normal, and it, it would probably wouldn't be that challenging, but I just don't have but that. It would still take a long time. Yeah, right? I don't want the time part of that. You know what's funny though? I, I remember going back before Black Ops 4 came out, uh, Matt, MC Sports Talk, and I, we would try and do like a high round attempt on like all the maps uh -huh. and five was the hardest just because like at the start of it's completely different from okay dogs oh we have our first contestant good thing this isn't a 1v1 this is just a work together sort of thing yeah, <laughs> oh. thank god <laughs> if it was a 1v1 dude like these videos wouldn't last you, long. Already, you already beat me what are the presidents we have on the wall we have abe lincoln George Washington, George Washington and uh, Thomas Edison, uh, Barack Obama, Thomas Jefferson, uh, Obama. Dude, I don't know why the Essex exists. It's actually like the it, it, worst. No, I'd rather have the um. I'd, what was the? I'd rather punch them. Sh yeah, no, that. Yeah, I'd rather have. I'd rather have the Shiva or the M14 over the Essex. One of the hardest parts about a starting room challenge is trying not to open up the doors on accident. Like somehow that seems oh, to yeah, be an issue. Uh, like if you're running up against the wall and you're reloading at the same time. Yeah, that can become tricky. And then like when you're trapped in the corner and like you instinctively want to open up the door when you know you're gonna die. Yeah, anyone on my view is gonna think I'm using hacks for shooting so fast. Do you have watch a body? Watch this, watch this. Ready, ready, ready. Watch this, watch this, watch this. 
Oh yeah. How fast was that? That's pretty fast. I got oh yeah, no, you're you're for sure using hacks. I'm not. I just have. Yeah, a, I just drank a lot of G fuel. Actually, I didn't have G fuel today. Not today. Fun, fun fact. I've never had G fuel. Dude, um, I'm not gonna like. I'm not gonna recommend a specific flavor, but I would just tell you never get strawberry shortcake. It is actually oh, like one of those I, things. I, I hate. I hate uh, cheesecake. I hate shortcake because I don't know what the heck that is. What is it? What is a cheese? Okay, cheesecake. I I've never had in my life, and I don't know exactly what it's. I obviously it's dairy. It's like maybe like milk and something. But I, I think they use like cream cheese instead of like. Yeah, cheese. I'm not a big fan something of that. Else. Uh, but tell me, someone tell me what cream cheese or what, uh, what what cream cheese is. <laughs> what is. <laughs> shortcake is um, very. I think it's just regular ass uh, like cake batter, and then you have some uh, strawberry sugar uh, topping, and then they top it with actual strawberries and whipped cream. So that strawberry shortcake is good, but it's not something you need in beverage form. It's one of those things that's good on its uh, own, yeah. but when you liquefy it, it doesn't work. Don't ever get strawberry shortcake. That's the one flavor of G Fuel I've ever tried that I genuinely did not like. All right, well, round 10. We made it to double round digits. 10, double digits! Who is this? Alexander Hamilton. I forgot. I'm gonna sound, I sound like a dumbass. Was he a president? Uh, I. Alexander Hamilton. Alexander. He was. <laughs> Let me stop. Jack Hammer Hamilton. I think he was. Um, he was Wait, the it, national. Don't they, sh don't they have a Broadway show about him? I. Dude, I don't know. Hamilton. He was the Secretary of Treasure, something like that. I. He had a lot to do with finances and banking. Uh, but I don't know if he was yeah. a president. I don't even want to like. Well, I know a lot about U.S. history. Not that though. How is he still alive? Oh, dogs. Okay, that works. So what we did was just meaningless. No. Right there, but... Okay. All right. I Dan. tried to throw my rage. It didn't work, dude. Come on, please. Don't do this to me. Dude, what do you? Don't let me down. Don't let me die. Don't let me. I mean, let me die, but don't let me down. Okay, hang on. Uh, I gotta try to survive don't first. Yeah, don't you dare. Okay, all right. I got a max ammo there. Let me just. If you're into that, let me revive you first, <laughs> and then we'll grab the max ammo. And I'm gonna pretend like you didn't say that. When in doubt, just spend all your money on a bottle of booze and a hooker. That's. You know what? This is not appropriate, and I don't know if I'm gonna keep this in the video. How much do hookers <laughs> actually go for? I'm like, I'm genuinely curious. Like, I'm not gonna hire a hooker. I'm 18. I'm in the fire, dude. <laughs> dude, you have the bigger I space. I was sitting in the fire. Ah, shit. Oh, no, shit. No, 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 no. Oh! <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Throw your rings. All right, all right, all right, all right. Uh, duh. Hi. Oh shit. Oh god, Wraith. Wraith. No! No! Oh, oh, oh. Oh no. <laughs> Dude, wow, you, there's a nuke right in front of me. You don't understand. Not only that, but I pulled out my specialist right as I died. It should have killed the zombies oh, next to me no. and it didn't work. That was one of those fluke ones. There are going to be there are bound to be a few inconsistencies, a few flukes here and there that like didn't make sense. Like classified was a pretty easy one. We we should have done better. We just didn't. There's just <laughs> there's just no ex, there's no explanation for it. It just happened the way it happened. It was the correlation between presidents working in the Pentagon and then talking about hookers because of uh, Monica Lewinsky. All right, well, I guess that's See, it. We're blaming, we're blaming Monica Lewinsky for this down. Yes, that's uh, out. our fate has been reached. Anyways, uh, next up after classified would be... Dead Ops. Uh, no, not quite. It would be Dead of the Night with Plus Johnny. Uh, Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Dead of the Night, the least marketed map in Zombies history. You probably didn't even know it existed. We're going to hop into it. There are two different spawn it. rooms. Oh, by the way, this is Plus Johnny. Probably should have introduced johnny yeah really high level i mean here. you guys you guys know johnny uh there are two different sides to this spawn room each with two barriers there's one with the essex and one with the strife i'm really hoping for the strife johnny and i have legitimate competitive practice on this spawn room Dude, all we right might actually be like for zwl so we might have a solid chance oh i'm on the bad side i haven't even spawned in yet oh Wait, am I? I'm not. Am, I don't. I'm not on the bad side. I'm on the bad side. Good thing I have I anywhere can. but here. I'll make my way over there. Oh, let's go, bitch. Okay, let's go, bitch. perfect. I'm gonna grab this strife. No wasting any time, okay? Now, uh, which barrier do you want? 
I'll take this one. All right. Just remember to level up that specialist. Spatialist? Alright, I got Spatialist. It. The spatula. You know what we should have done? We should have just played on fucking casual and not told anybody. Wouldn't they see our health bars? No, 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 no. All you gotta do is just put like a little, like, put the dead of the night text over the health bar so nobody can read it. Okay, that's one way to go just about put it. Text over it. What if yeah. they see us get hit five times? I, your audience can't count, so. <laughs> wow. I'm pretty sure we share a very similar demographic, giant. <laughs> yeah, well, I can't count, so that doesn't bode well. Okay. But I should have temporal the insta kill, eh? Well, I mean, it's only around four. I don't know if that's entirely necessary. Yeah, no, hey, we don't waste anything, Tim. What are we, Native Americans? Like Native Americans. <laughs> Holy shit, we both said that. We're, we're like Elizabeth Warren. <laughs> Dude, Johnny, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I, I do have a... Like, I do feel like we're actually gonna do the best on this one. Because there's only two fucking there here. Dude, if you had me on Shadows, we would have got the world record. I had Chopper, and we struggled. We got past the Margua, but after that, we were just boned. Like, there was not... Did he keep, did he, did he keep cucking you by taking the Mark of the Beast thing? No, we didn't... Neither of us used it much. We only used it oh, when okay. we, like, had to. He had the two barriers closest to Nero's Lair, and I had the two near the Shiva. So, I had much less space. Yo, Tim, Tim, do your, uh, specialist. Oh, yeah, okay. There's zombies over here as well, so just whenever you need to. Dope. Dope. Dude, dude, you just decapitated them like you're a Saudi Arabian prince. Yeah. Dude, Dead of the Night has grown on me, I'm not gonna lie. I hated this map at first. Yeah, Timothy, wait till round 12. You know what? You're right. <laughs> it, like, upgraded a level for me. This map is not, like... Cancer. The Easter egg's interesting. Yeah, no, like, the, the map is interesting. It's just the Nosferatu's fucking suck. The Wonder Weapon is like, eh. To be honest. I don't know, it just has a lot of minor things wrong with it. If the, if the celebrity cast had to be chaos, I'm glad it was this cast. Like, I think it's actually a really solid cast. I suppose. I know one of them is from Game of Thrones. I mean, that's, that's kind of why I have a big boner for this cast. I've never seen Game of Thrones, not because I don't want to, just because it seems like too much of a commitment. You have commitment issues, Tim? With, Do you want to talk about with it? With television shows, yes. Feel free to save me, Tim. Feel free to save me, Tim. <laughs> I was just, oh, Tim, I'm at 50 health. Save my ass. Dude, I don't have, okay, let me buy ammo. Why do you need me to save you? Whatever, I man. I live in a house where you can have multiple fucking dumbass looking chandeliers and be like, yeah, that works. And you can yell swear words and no one will hear you? I mean, I already kind of do that, but... Oh, believe me, I, I mean, do too. Doing it in a bigger square footage would make me feel better about myself. Johnny, do you ever, like, you ever realize how fucking annoyed my dad gets when I start screaming when I get overrun by zombies? Dude, I am gonna be happy for the next two rounds, and that's it. It's gonna go to shit, and you're on the first line of defense there. Uh, <laughs> that, is that why you picked this barrier, or is that just um, pure coincidence? Um, um, <laughs> I'll kill the zombies if you want me to, Johnny. Yeah, yeah, just murder them. Alright, Tim, it's our last round of peace. Alright, that's right. Let's enjoy this while we can. Alright, alright. Intelligent. Intelligent plays. That's what we're all about out here. We're about Lamau's and intelligent plays. Right, I do have my specialist oh, for next round. Oh god, round 12. Keep looking that way. <laughs> yeah, like, just sort of like... Building the barrier. Just sort of peer over there every now and then. Make sure fucking Dracula doesn't molest me. <laughs> I'm so scared. You have no idea, Johnny. I'm the one who's gonna get dicked first. I'm just gonna first. Right here. I don't wanna use my specialist. I'll, I'll scream. I'll, I'll just... I'll use my, uh, yeah. my health call. They're already out. They're already out. Ah! Johnny, help! I will die to a drive. Oh, watch out, watch out, watch out. I don't want to waste my specialist yet. T Tim, Tim, t <laughs> Okay, I'll waste my specialist. I'll waste my specialist. Oh, no! Okay, well, that wasn't Spartan hindsight. Did we did we even get a nose for two? No. Wow, okay, well, we're gonna get one now. Yo, just, just, just wraith fire them? I'm trying. We'll get Why aren't they done? Watch yourself, watch yourself. Yo, we're good. Yo, we're, we're not good. Okay, this isn't as Yo, easy as it was with four people, I'll tell you that. Yo, we're good. Yo, we're not good. Okay, you. Okay, we gotta time. You use that. I'll just sit here, dickless. And um, oh, there's a no spot. You fucked your mom. That was rude. You know what? Maybe this whole barrier thing just maybe should stop. No, it. We definitely need to keep doing it. Okay. It's gonna be crazy. <laughs> All right, dude. We're almost at round 15, man. We only got our. We almost got our daily tier skip done, Tim. How you feeling? I'm feeling 
I guess good. I got my level two uh, viper now, so I'll just wave yeah, that around. Yeah, me too. I'm close to level three. I'll Dude, level three. All right, I'll use move. I'll use mine when the barriers get breached. I'm just watching the window and I'm just waiting for a nose to come by. All right, I'm gonna buy it now. Oh. Yep. Go. Oh no, spot you, no spot you, no spot. Oh, there's an instant to kill. Temporal. I have one. Yeah, it's good. It's good. It's good. Okay. Oh, never mind. It was not good. It literally ran out right when you grabbed it. Dad. Oh wow. All right, I can kind of protect your ass. Can you kind of protect my ass, or can you protect my ass, Johnny? I'm working on protecting your ass, but you gotta help me protect your ass. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna try not to. I, 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 I don't no, it's for R2! <gasps> okay. Okay, that was bad. But good, because I got you, and I didn't open up the door on accident. Alright, I got it. Yo, dude, look at our points, man. We're sick. We won the game. Honestly, the best part about this is we don't have to open up the doors and play Dead of the Night. <laughs> we don't actually have to play Dead of the Night. We just have to play the first fucking fraction of it. No, it's for you, no, it's for Atu. He's here. There's two of them. Nope. Oh, here one comes. I got it. Yep. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. All right, we're doing fairly good. Yeah, I, I got my specialist. Uh, I'm just gonna go. Okay. All right. <laughs> Thanks. No, it's for Atu. Oh, he's dead as hell. All right, there we go. There we go. I'm almost level three, dude. I'm actually killing it right now. No, no, we're killing it, Tim. We're yeah. a sick duo. We are great. Except I'm out of ammo with my RK7. They, they're taking them off faster than I can build them. How, how do people even hold down that fucking thing? They're being good lol. Right. Okay, I got a full specialist charge over here if you need that. If not, I'll just... Tim, you just do it. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Okay. Uh, just grab it right as soon as it's about to end. Oh, another one. Oh, shit. Kevin, keep going. Just keep going. Just keep going. <laughs> oh, shit. Jesus. Dude, you got big focus going on right now, eh? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Dude, we would be like, I feel like we'd be screwed without this. All right. Yo, good stuff. Damn, level three. All right, we, we good. Five shots left in the mob. I have equipment oh, on. Shit. So I can... Oh, I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. Okay. All right. Bonus points. Bonus points, Johnny. Yo, dude, I, I think we really need them. <laughs> to be honest. That was <laughs> Jesus Christ, you got obliterated. Help. Dude, just yell every time I need to execute a nose for dude. Oh, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. Watch out, watch out, watch out, oh, watch no. out. Watch out, watch out. Oh, macho. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, shit. oh, 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 shit. oh, God. Oh, I'm down, I'm down. There's a max ammo. If you can get there. Nope. Shit. Right. That's tough with two people. With four, it's like... Actually, kind of easy with. Or, or even three. Yeah. Just with somebody like, who the dumbass nose for us. <laughs> God damn. All right. Well, that's pretty good. I think all things considered. And now we're on to Ancient Evil with Newbie. We're on Ancient Evil right now. Still in Black Ops 4. Y'all know the rules. And uh, let's get into it. We're gonna go for world record round one speedrun. Let's see how quickly we can get past round one. Yeah. That that's the challenge. Damn. <laughs> Oh wow! On the time, the round. It literally couldn't up. even. <laughs> it couldn't even register well, that. Kid, lads. I got the RK7. That's the best gun I had unlocked for my level. Oh, we have um, this giant area too. I forgot about that. I've got the Shadows of Evil, um, mog. What year does this take place in? Oh, nineteen. Oh God, there are ducks. Twenty, I want to say. Oh. I'm definitely wrong because Death of Night's 1918. Titanic is 1918. Mm -hmm. Echo 1918, then, I'd assume. Who is this again? Just, oh, uh, it's Apollo. I know it's called the Temple of Apollo. Yeah, that's that's my guy Apollo. I'm not, the, uh, I'm not totally well versed in Greek mythology. Like, I, I know the like the bare minimum. I just don't know, like, I don't know who Apollo is. I don't know much. Uh, Apollo's a guy which this lady likes so much that she'll get high for him. <laughs> okay, that's, that's a way to put it. Yeah. That's all you need to know. He also stands on snakes. Any particular reason for that? Or is that just like a, like a YOLO thing? 
That's just a Yolo thing. Have you ever not- have you just seen a snake and just wanted to stand on it? <laughs> Yolo? Dude, I'm not gonna lie, like, I saw a snake in my basement a couple years ago, and it was a garter snake. It was one of those, like, really small ones that are harmless, but... Um, I still decided, for some sociopathic reason, to grab a butcher's knife and chop its head off. <laughs> Cause Are you it, it, listen, listen, listen. I, like, made sure it was, like, alive or dead beforehand. It was alive, but it was frozen. Like, it was not moving, and no matter how many times I, like, like tapped it. And I was just like, okay, I'm gonna just, like, uh... Kill it. <laughs> Wait, it just accepted dead? it. It just accepted it. I just sliced its head right off and it was just like it, it didn't squirm or anything. It was just I think it was like paralyzed to be honest. The RSPCA are gonna be coming, my guy. <laughs> it was a little small snake that was living in my basement, and I don't like snakes in my basement. Daddy had to take care of that. What do you do with spiders? Spiders? I don't get I don't have that many spiders in my house, but when I see them I just I just like squash them if I can, if I if they're like in an inconvenient location for me, I'll just leave them be. You know, I don't, right. I don't go out of my way to kill spiders. They're, they're not that harmful. They, they like trapping, uh, like, like other insects that are a nuisance. So spiders are good so in a way. You tell me you won't kill harmful, sorry, non-harmful spiders, but you will kill non-harmful snakes. Well, yeah, I ain't got a lot of ammo left in my mug. Dude, you know the thing about this video is like, a lot of the people, not all of them, but I'd say like, like a good like quarter of the people in this video I've never talked to or played with ever. So, like, you included. I've never played with you, I've never talked to you. We're just hopping into this and... I guess yeah. it's working. It's not... Yeah. It's just a starting room challenge. It's not like a... I'm not gonna be sweaty about it. Like, it's not a competition for rewards and shit, you know? Oh, I'm competing. I wanna do better than Turbo. I guess that... You know what? Alright. <laughs> That's just... I'm, just I'm Turbo? turbo. <laughs> just, just Turbo. Don't... No one else? As long as... As long as I beat Turbo, I'm good. Okay, well, we're on 7. Uh, he, he's doing Alpha Omega. I don't know how... I forgot how small that starting room is. I, I don't think it's big. I, I may as well just use my Wraith Fire, so I don't know why I'm, like, saving them up. Oh, yeah, use your Wraith Fire as often as you can. Try and use your Specialist somewhat often so you can level out her. Oh, yeah, that's true. I haven't even used it once yet. We're on around 8. Yeah, I haven't used it yet just because it had been too slow to use it earlier for leveling up. Oh, the skeletons are here. I love the skeletons. I will say this, I feel like BO4's dining rooms are pretty fun. Because there's quite a lot of variety in them. Yeah, there's a lot Compared of space too. This one has a lot of space, but Blue of the Dead's like got that classic Origins vibe of the first oh, room. Oh yeah, yeah, with the stairs and the like different parts. Yeah. Yeah. I think just because we have so much more at disposal here in BO4, uh, I think it's just easier in general. Oh yeah, 100%. If we didn't have specialists, first rooms would be amazing. Or equipment. It's like, if we yeah, didn't have rates, rates would make things so much easier. I'm tempted to open up this door. I'm not gonna lie. Do it. Do it. There's more gum out there. I need it. You just don't want to be the one to open it. You don't want to be the one that people yell at in if, the comments. If, if, you, if you cut it from the video... <laughs> don't look we just don't look at that stuff. We, <laughs> we just, just totally look avoid looking at that half of the spawner. <laughs> yeah, don't open up the whole map. We'll have hands. We have, like, like the, the Pegasus chat. strike. Like, how the fuck did you get that? I think one of the best things about this first game as well is that... It's just so aesthetically beautiful. Like, everywhere's just beautiful from here. Yeah. Like, there's that big mansion in the rock over there. Yeah, Ancient Evil is one of the better looking maps in this game, for sure. You know, if you go down first... Well, you you should be ashamed because you've got the bigger area. Like, I'm literally just going around this small, tiny area. You know what? Back. You know what? Now I'm going to step it up even further. Now I'm trying. Yeah, that's, that's the plan. That's the plan. I want you to do well. I want you to succeed, Sonny. That's that's my motivation. Ooh, no we're doubt. gonna get a blight father pretty soon, aren't we? Yeah, oh one of those big gig 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 looking dudes. Yeah. Oh I specialist. <laughs> Save the day. Okay, I don't have I uh I have more space, but I also have more zombies, I feel. <laughs> like I have so many. I should have more to have four spawn points. You only have two, I believe. Yeah, I see a, I mean, we, a lot of them leaking. I'm not complaining the, though. Um, I'm grateful for my uh <laughs> I'm grateful. I'm not complaining. Should I buy the Essex? No, no, Tim. Do not. Do it. Do, do it. Do not. I am not. Do it. Get Dark Man on it. <laughs> right now. I'm actually honestly surprised got 14. I thought 10 maybe. I'm going to have to start going in there again too. Yeah, I forgot how that. big this spawn room is for some reason when I was thinking about it. I was just thinking about the area I'm I've in. I've got the Blight Father. Don't <laughs> ruin I forgot you had the extension over there. Oh shit, on a stick. I'm going to throw that Wraith. And, uh... I, I beat up the Blight Father. 
You beat him up? Yep. Okay, I'll come help you. I'll save you there. Oh, thank you. You didn't... You didn't save me. Could we actually just go do the Easter egg now? Gally's first. I don't think the subscribers would like that. The subscribers would love that. Easter egg first room only. We just count everything every time we're not in the first room. For every minute we're outside of the, sp of the spawn room, we have to uh, play on transit. I feel like the only people whose transit is their favorite map are people that like bought BO2, only had BO2, and could only play transit. <laughs> Did never bought BO3. Like, just they just had nothing else like transit. because transit was just it. I feel vibrating, and I'm not quite sure where it's coming from. Never mind. <laughs> I feel vibrant. Him screaming, screaming you. Him. I'm gonna get stuck. No. Tim, did you lose your specialist? No. Oh, I'm using my anywhere but here. There's a max. I got carried. That's fair. I mean, it's fine. You're <laughs> you're dealing with the uh, the smaller area, so I mean, I'm not gonna like put you down for that. Die, 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 die. Please, 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 don't hit me, don't hit me. Shit, shit, shit. Damn it. Okay. Okay. Why did I activate the ducks? I can't know it, but there now. <laughs> okay. Yeah, about to get swarmed in a ooh, few seconds. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, I'm gonna use my special. <laughs> yeah, that's not doing uh, jack shit. That's not doing jack shit. Try and scream it. Try and scream at my guy. You press RT on me. You missed me. <laughs> I, uh. They're everywhere. They're literally everywhere. Oh my god. I mean, 16 rounds is good. It's it's not bad at all. I think we did great. To say, to say that neither's warmed up. Yeah, that too. And we got to 16, and we both, no offense, garbage. We did well. <laughs> I'm offended. Anyway. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. You've made it to the final stage. <laughs> all right? You've made it to Alpha Omega in Black Ops 4. Uh, I'm not sure if this video will be out in time for the DLC 4 map, probably not, so we're not going to get to that, I'm assuming. Anyways, we have Turbo here, and we're going to hop right into this. Hello, Let's my sexy bastards, what's it. up? You know what Hello. sucks about BO4 is, uh, people forget to ready up. Newbie was talking a lot of shit, and he got to yeah, 16. No, all that talk, huh? So let's see He's if we can let's see if we can exceed 16. I, I, I don't know what I did to Newbie. I love him. We kiss on the occasion, but I I, I, I don't know what I did to him. I, I, I if that's because I you know I destroyed in his uh which mutator is anyway series. If it's because of that, then I apologize, Newbie. I'm just that good in zombies. But you know what's okay. <laughs> hey, all right, so I'm pretty sure uh, this this spawn room is interesting because we spawn in yes. and there's a ramp. There isn't a door. We're going to go beyond gonna the ramp. We're going to jump bitch. over it. Jump it's ramp. not a door. It's like a clear opening. Uh, Tim, you know I ordered a pound of sour green apple gum on uh, Amazon. Yeah, I, I, uh, why though? You no, know, it was a late night purchase. Okay. I uh, hopped on Amazon and I was like, you know what? Uh, it's only five. It was only five dollars. Five dollars. Five dollars. They're selling a pound of gum. First of all, on Grubhub, one of my diners sells a pound of provolone cheese Ooh. for fifteen dollars. You can get a pound of sour apple gum on Amazon for five bucks. It's a fucking bargain. Mhm. Mm that sounds good. You know what? I kind of want to do that now. Stop yeah, tempting me. Yeah, but like me. go to like the uh, pizzerias or whatever. They have like the gumball machine. You're like, I gotta get a gumball. Like yeah. I have to get a yeah, gumball. Yeah. That's you know? yeah. <laughs> but now I just now I can just reach into my uh bag of a pound of sour apple gum. And I can get cavities all day. Damn, are you excited for DLC 4? I'm so, somebody probably asked you this already. Yeah, I, just I mean, want to know myself. I, I f assume it's going to be Call of the Dead Remastered. It's fucking Call of the Dead. It's, it's probably Call of the Dead. I'm equally as excited as I am worried. Let me put it that way. Okay. Yeah, you know, I believe it. Yeah. Because you, Call of the Dead is a tough map to beat, to top, in my opinion. It's just yeah. one of my favorites, and I just don't want to see them ruin it. And I know that it's very possible they could ruin it because, again, in my opinion, they ruined Mob, my favorite map, with blood. I've seen it firsthand. There is literal evidence right there. So that's why I'm very worried. What the fuck is happening? Oh my god, do you see this zombie having a seizure? Here we go. No, actually, no, no. Okay. Well, that was just <laughs> on my screen. That's on your screen. But anyways, yeah, they're going to probably buff the VR11, make that a lot better, and just scrap the scavenger. That's just how they typically reimagine things. Uh-huh. 
I don't know though. I mean, we got elemental mark twos in this map. So also, uh, this starting room turbo is uh, a little bit condensed in contrast to ancient evil and all the other ones. So, hey, so uh, Listen, newbie, newbie wants to talk all that talk. I could have picked an easy starting room, but that's that, true. Uh, mm -mm -mm. Training is. Uh, you know what? Alpha Mega. Here we go. Damn, you know what's fucking not? And I'm sorry if I'm cursed. You know, you're dealing with Turbo here. The, the curse is my flow now. Yeah. I apologize to Hanson. You know, I apologize. But we met. You know, we didn't know each other when I was doing ZWC2. Right. Or ZWI, but we and met. You were there, Tim? Yeah, we met. I met no, Yatu. We... I met Hagen, Shane, all of those guys Did for the first time. No, I remember exactly what happened. I was sitting there preparing for ZLAN, just practicing. I was playing Dead Ops Arcade 2, just fucking around, trying to pass time. And you, and, did I come up to you? and a bunch of other people were standing behind me watching me. I think you had a Chicago Cubs shirt on or something oh, no, like that. No, 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 that was ZWI. I had the... And you know what's funny? They, everybody says that was a Cubs jersey. It wasn't. It was like a spoof jersey. It said SUP. SUP. Dude, these wraiths cool. are so, so helpful for the starting room. Rates oh, yeah. are just like rates in themselves honestly make this like just infinitely easier. Literally. <laughs> what was your go to like special something at launch? Like when you didn't know like which one was the good one yet? Like which one were you like using? Okay, uh, uh that machine? for Ether I did the katana. And then for Chaos I did the hammer and I still use the hammer because it's fucking badass. But don't you think it would have been cool if we would have been able to like even though we get to upgrade them like in game of course, like level one, two, and three. Don't you think it would have been cool if we would have been able to like customize our special weapons? Like level up like level them up like you, you know, if you unlock a calling card, yeah. your path to sorrows is gold, or like, you know, you put a camera on it. I don't know. Oh, and I'm trying to be consistent with this. I know it's going to be difficult to remember this every time we do this uh, starting room thing, but I'm trying to do round predictions. What round do you think we're going to die on? <laughs> oh, well, since you said newbie has it out for me and he went to 16, listen to me. Uh, uh, listen, we're doing 17 rounds. I'm getting above. Oh, uh, newbie. That's... This is what, what's happening. Okay. Happen. All right. What happens if we don't reach that? <laughs> if we don't reach that, Tim Hansen, I cry easily. Yesterday, <laughs> when I did this with newbie, it was the first time I ever have talked or played with him either. Like, that's uh, the same thing for a lot. Like, like a quarter of the people that are in this video, I've never talked to or played with. It's crazy. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, but most of them are just friends. When it's a bigger YouTuber, though, because... Like, oh, never playing with Lex before. Dude, it just felt like it wasn't even real. Like, I felt like I was in a goddamn dream. And you know what's funny? That was, like, the first time he played zombies, probably, in, like, a couple months. Probably. <laughs> He's probably a little rusty. Yeah, revelations with Lex. Like, I, like, 15 year old me, when I was watching him, would have never fucking imagined oh, that. Oh, boy, here we go, Tim I, I got you. I got you, Wraith. Okay, all right. That was almost. Oh, uh, there's a specialist. Uh, this is the first time I'm using my specialist the entire game. I've been, I've, been using it. I, I've been using it to save my ass a couple times. What one are you running? I got Ragnaroks. Oh, you Path of Sorrows. I Path of Sorrows. Yeah. I'm a greedy bastard. I don't like to revive my uh, teammates. Sam Hansen, I, th I think I have a deviated septum. You know what that is? A deviated septum? I have no idea what that I was, is. Uh, randomly, I was laying down one night, as I do, and I was, you know, I was touching my nose, as I do. And <laughs> I'm just I'm grazing, you know, my nose, going along it vertically. And I was like, holy shit, there's like a, it, it might, some of my nose is crooked. Like, I think I have a DBA septum because of this is one of my nostrils. Breathe, what? nice, and this is the other one. That, that one's clogged. Okay, so I think it was smart that we came to this fraction of the starting room because the oh, other one, yeah. we would have been oh, fucked a long no. time ago. Look at them just pouring out from there. Oh my god. They're coming like ants in an ant farm, Tim. Yo, are you a fan of 13 Reasons Why or no? Okay, I've been listening to a lot of podcasts that have been talking about, oh my god, who killed the fucker? I don't know. I, I, I don't watch it. Like, not a um, single episode? I watch, like, okay, when my friends tell me, like, they're, like, gnarly scenes, like, on that show, like, when it's like, oh my god, uh -huh. like, he raped this girl in a hot tub, I get that, I know, I guess that happened, right? Yeah. He, I, I, I was like, okay, I gotta check that out, see how crazy the show is, I checked that clip out, that was a crazy scene, I was like, I can't watch this show. Yeah, it's a little bit I graphic, end up, for sure. I will end up in hives, and just a panic attack after every episode if I watch that show. Yeah, it, it's a little rough, <laughs> but... Uh, I finished it just today, and I was just wondering. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I've been on, recently, I've been on, like, crazy, like, Netflix, like, crazy. Like, I've been trying to, because, like, Dave Chappelle's new uh, special came out mm -hmm. um, a couple days ago. That was pretty cool. But, you know what? I was scrolling through Netflix, and even on Twitter, I guess, like, the new season of Walking Dead's coming out. Uh -huh. Bro, I miss getting excited for The Walking Dead. Yeah. I, 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 bro, I miss 
the October nights, like usually, like it would be around the Halloween time. Yeah, so and... Halloween decorations would be in my house. That just the full smell of like my, you know, the apple cider candles that Bed Bath and Beyond sell on yeah. October. <laughs> just smelling the pumpkins. Just smelling the apple pine. You're like, oh yeah, it's Sunday night. The Walking Dead, bitch. But now it's like, uh, the Walking. Uh, yeah, dude. It's like pulling teeth now. Also, by the way, around 15, so newbie go suck my left toe. Dude, we're um, oh, we're screwing, creeping up. I didn't even realize we were this far. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. So I actually uh, rewatched uh, the first episode of The Walking Dead to see if I could like rewatch the entire series. And after the first episode, it was like an hour and 15 minutes. I'm like, I can't. I can't. Like emotionally, can't. I cannot reinvest myself through this entire fucking endeavor. It's just too much to handle, too much drama. It's it's a little over dramatic in my opinion. It was still a great show. Yeah, I'm, fucked, I'm, I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I'm oh, fucked. All right, I, crazy. I got a wraith here. Oh. It can it can temporarily like shield you. Here's what we gotta do. We gotta pray in me. <laughs> okay, that's step one. I have a wraith fire ready to be on my screen. Here we go. Akuna Matata. <laughs> Perfect. All right. I have faith. Come on, come on, come on. Right. Oh my god. Okay. Get ah, What is that? Oh, 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 oh. Dude. Now. Now we just have one more. I assume that'll end the round. Will it not? Come on, come oh, on. no, it didn't. Wait, so did you guys die around 17? We died on 17, and it subtracted Fuck. to 16. Alright, right, they're still spawning, which I'm a little scared for. I think we can handle. I think. We around. can, because that nuke probably did a lot of damage. Phil Swift. That's a lot of damage! There we go. Alright, Tim Hansen. Solid. Newbie, what are you gonna say right now, Newbie? Just, just, Newbie, we might die. We might survive. But, Newbie, right now, are you sweating? Are you sweating? Oh, you have swamp ants <laughs> right now, Newbie. Are you scared? Right now, newbie. <laughs> oh my god, it's a dog round! Yes! Okay, 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 okay. Wraith, 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 wraith. Sheet, sheet, sheet. There's so many, though! There's so many, though! Tim, we got this, though, Tim. Oh, I'm taking out my. Oh, no, I'm done. Oh, I should have used my katana still. Okay, I'm using mine. I'm not even risking. I'm not risking a goddamn thing. I'm using my rag. Oh, newbie's like, no! Ooh. Ooh, I'm surprised oh, we've done this well. Go. I'm surprised. Oh, oh my goodness, we're on round 18. I'm surprised, dude. Alpha Omega. I figured this was gonna be a like a really. Oh, what? Tim. Just and fucked. Especially you playing with me. I thought we were done around five. Tim, I feel like we can get to 20, man. Dude, I think we can do whatever we set our minds to. <laughs> I think Mr. Rogers put that installment in my body when I was like at a young age, but um, we can do. It. I have 10 health. I have 10 health. Yo, get a recharge. Get the recharge. Ooh. I can't. Okay. Yeah, I guess you have to. No, I'm gonna let you grab it because I already have a full specialist, so oh, I, I, I would, I would maybe. just, I would just waste it if I grabbed it. So you no, go I ahead and grab you, it. Thank you. All right. Alrighty, God damn it! I am <laughs> shocked. What if, what if this is the highest I get on BO4? Seriously. Okay, that's. Uh, oh, it ran out very abruptly. Yep, 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 yep. yep. All right, Wraith. Wraith, 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 Wraith. Bonus points. We're saved. Bonus points. I'm not even gonna try to shoot them. There's no point. Yeah, just drag them. Well, I'm just trying to get like you know more damage. You know. How about a little more? Newbie sucked my ring toe. Oh, let's go. Dude, we're. Let's go. We're doing. All right, yeah, you go that way. Let's go, baby. I am a little surprised we've gotten this far. I'm not gonna lie. But you know, a bunch of people say still like, no, it doesn't count. You should have stayed up that ramp. You should have. <laughs> yeah, there's gonna be that one guy. That that's how it is on a lot of maps. Like Barry, there's no like actual like door. Oh my god. On Moon, there I isn't. About Barry. Yeah, that's a tricky one. There's a couple. Oh shit! Okay, right fire. I tried to pull out my um, specialist and I didn't have it, <laughs> so I died. Um, yeah, we got this. It's over. Okay. Well, you know what? 19, wow. technically 20, because this game likes yeah. to. You know what? I'll take that. I feel like we ended this mega series of a zombies collaboration video on a high note. I, I would say like so. Did. Yeah, for sure. I feel like we ended on a high note. That... Thank you so much. For, thank you for having me. No problem at all. Team. That was every single Treyarch zombie starting room challenge. Wow chronologically with 29 30 youtubers including myself if you guys enjoyed this leave a like like i said in the beginning of the video if we hit 10,000 likes it's a lot 10,000
thousand. Ten thousand likes. I will do this all over again. I will recycle oh, some people. Boy. I'll take some people out, put newer ones in. I'll mix and match. I'll get this thing going all over again. A reboot for 10k. Anyways, Turbo, you have the honor to help me conclude this video, so if you have any final words for anyone, go ahead. I have, uh, I have some final words. People, this man right here, Tim Hansen, is revolutionizing the Call of Duty Zombies community. He is the man, okay? If you don't get this video to 10,000 likes, I'm gonna personally, personally get my gumadas and get my 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 uh, my Brooklyn stompers <laughs> to come to you and stomp you down. Like this video and once again just Tim Hansen. Thank you so much for having me on the, uh, the video. My man, thank No problem. And also guys, every single channel link is in the description. Make sure to subscribe to at least at the very least your favorite ones. You don't I don't expect you to subscribe to 30 people, but pick the ones you liked at the very least and just show them some love. Even if you don't want to subscribe, just visit them, drop them a like. The the, the least amount helps. I appreciate it. And I guess that's it.